Why is it so dark? Oh, oh that's better. Okay. Hi, Sandra. Hi. Hi. Oh, goodness. Give me just a second, sweetie. I am so not ready for tonight. Can you hear me okay? Am I coming through good? Am I clear? Can you hear me? Oh, I am just... Oh my goodness, I am so behind tonight. I overslept. Kenzie doesn't feel well tonight. Yeah, she messaged me earlier, said she was going to a Christmas party or something. Hi, Joy. Come in, come in, come in, come in. Uh, thank you, Sandra. No, Kenzie uh, had messaged me, said she was going to a Christmas party or something, and she was going to be late. So, unless she changed her mind and decided she uh, had, you know, it doesn't feel good or she's not, I, I don't know. I, that was what she said. So, um, Again, I you'll have to forgive me. I am live. I am on time. However, I am so not ready. I literally just woke up like 30 minutes ago and it was like, oh no, I gotta fly. So uh still working on the camera setup. Uh I do have the new camera, but he was working on it today. And uh, apparently he did not get it completely set up installed due to the fact that uh, I am still using the, the one that's on the roof here. Okay, guys, I am going by you guys. So uh, you have to tell me if I'm in line, I'm not in line, uh, what's going on. So I'm going to give everybody a couple of minutes to get here we are going to be working on king charles tonight um oh coffee honey coffee uh so how's everybody doing thank you sandra uh joy i seen your new uh um diamond painting you started oh my gosh it looks so good and you're in the um winter whip uh thing that uh she has going on mm. i need to take a picture of this and matter of fact somebody remind me to do that i gotta take a picture of this and um upload it for my beginning photo uh christmas morning did not make it i there is just not enough of me to go around and so it is, um, honestly, I'm sad to say, wah, wah, wah. it is going to end up going back in the tube and packed up and be saved to complete next year. Um, I will complete it. This is going to be the one and only whip. Uh, that I have. I try not to open these unless I've completed another one. I was going to get out um, uh, Mask of Love by Josephine Wall and finish that, uh, which uh, I set it aside to do Christmas morning. But the kids got a new puppy. And uh, it's it's a King Charles Cocker Spaniel, I think is what it is. And um, anyway, this is a partial from Diamond Art Club. Uh, I uh, the stats it cost uh, twenty four ninety nine. It is a fifty one by fifty one centimeter. It is a partial. Uh, 4,401 drills. It has, it is square, uh, 36 colors and four ABs. Reach out for a shining 
Reach out for a shining cherry red cup of holiday spirit and touch toes with a caramel colored cutie. Gaze into the sweet, beseeching eyes, imploring for a uh, rescue. As you nuzzle its warm and fuzzy fur for a velvety lick of love in return. That is come that all information just come directly from Dumb and Art Club. So um yeah, uh, a Christmas morning uh, is a gorgeous, beautiful painting. Uh, it is not going to go uh, anywhere other than in one of the Hobby Lobby uh, round tubes. Uh, and it will get set aside. It will get finished. I will just have to attack it maybe later on this upcoming year and finish it in advance or something like that. Um, it will not go away. It will not go away. So I figured that this is a partial. They just got a brand new puppy and it is a, I guess it's a King Charles. Uh, it's a Cocker Spaniel. Oh Lord, don't let my son hear me say that to him. It's, it's, oh, you know, one of these, one of these, these all fired, expensive, something other. It's a poopy dog. Hi, Snow Bunny. Welcome, welcome. Come in, come in. Join us. Break out your whip. Have a seat. Oh, my goodness. We're just getting started here. Uh, gonna wait a little bit. Kind of let everybody get in. I have a live unboxing. Uh, so I was trying to kind of let everybody get in and get situated because I'm still kind of getting situated myself. Oh, goodness. Oh, and by the way, don't ever make the mistake of freezing a styrofoam uh, cherry vanilla Dr. Pepper. It does not work very well. And you end up with a mess. Uh, it is literally bleeding through the styrofoam. So that is, uh, I'm not sure what's going on there, but that's not a good thing. So, oh gosh, there's eight of us here already. Let's see who is here tonight. Oh, which by the way, I finally found the size button on um my chat so i can see it tonight all right we have joys happy hobbies raining diamonds hi raining diamonds come in come in come in welcome welcome sandra's here and snow bunny 426 so yeah hi guys hi 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 sorry i'm still getting a little Little setup here, I uh, overslept, and oh goodness, y'all know how it goes. Oversleep, and then got 101 things you're trying to get due, and so yeah. Whew, got the new computer set up. I don't know if I said that or not. Oh, uh, last week, I could, well, I could, what did I have last week? Honestly, I can't remember. Uh, had the had the, um, yeah, I, I think the new computer was set up last week. But anyway, we got all that done. He still, uh, we still have to add the camera in, uh, get the mic set up. Uh, we have one camera. He still has to decide which of the other cameras we're going to get yet. Uh, we don't know if we're going to do a uh, click camera, like a camera with a video uh, recording ability. Or if we're going to do a video recorder uh, with a, um, a, a or a, kind of a point and shoot kind of thing. Joy, ask your husband, what does he use? Do you use a video camera or a regular uh, camera that has video capability? I really do have a mess going on with this cherry vanilla Dr. Pepper. I have to, I will be right back. I have to go set this in the sink or I'm going to have like mess everywhere.
Sorry about that, everyone. Thank you for holding down the fort, peeps. Again, note to self, never freeze a cherry vanilla Dr. Pepper in a styrofoam cup. Oh, wow, that was turning out to be a huge mess. It was like it was seeping out the sides of the cup. So that was, yeah, that was not a good idea. Because uh, I got lunch right before I laid down and took a nap. And it was like, oh, well, I'll just save my cherry vanilla Dr. Pepper for when I get up and stuck it in the, in the freezer. And it was like, oh, no, that's not a good idea. So, yeah. Anyway, um, let's see. Kind of. Uh, Ralph. Hi, Ralph. I was just fixing to say, where's you and Kathy tonight? Uh. Cassandra, hi. Welcome. Come on in. Come on in. We're still waiting a little bit for everybody to get here. Plus, I'm I'm a little behind tonight. Got a... I owe Ralph a dollar. Yes, I have witnesses. Everybody heard that. I owe Ralph a dollar. I was trying to get Christmas morning finished, and him and I had a bet. I lost. So, uh, yeah, I owe Ralph a dollar. Ralph, Christmas morning is getting put away in its Hobby Lobby tube. Uh, and it is going to get set to the side. However, I'm going to try this one because it is a partial. It is very, very small. Uh, so if I don't get this done and, and in the mail by Christmas and or thereabouts, uh, I'm in. Tr I need. I need to have my fanny kicked because there's no reason for this. This is itty bitty, teeny tiny. So, and if y'all hear me blow my nose, I apologize. I. I am so 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 sorry, but I'm sorry. Mother Nature has a way of doing its own thing. But I um. When I woke up, I had something in my eye, and I don't know about you guys. Whenever my eye bothers me, I end up, my nose just goes crazy. So, but okay, we're gonna, this is, uh, I got this kit in, um, I'm gonna say about two, three weeks ago. It, I haven't had it long, and it was for the kids. I got this for the kids because this is the kind of new puppy that um they got so i figured what a fa fabulous way okay uh next saturday night we are throwing a christmas party yes there will be door prizes and giveaways and all kinds of good stuff. So, uh, yeah. So, make sure that you are here next Saturday. I want a festive. We're going to have eggnog and Santa Claus hats and whatever else I decide to come up with. I'm trying to figure out how to make how to make my office space kind of like Christmas party like maybe I'll get some wrapping paper and wrap my mat here for for that night to give it a little Christmas festivities so um let's see what I got here come on you I have not done an unboxing on this kit uh, either so this is this is the unboxing of King Charles. For tonight, hey, y'all get a, a, a whipping chat and an unboxing, and then I can get this, get this bad boy up and and work on him. Oh, 
Who got the Harry Potter? Oh, I'm sorry. I'm not looking at chat. I'm looking at people. Oh, my God. Sorry, people. Hi. Oh, gosh. I'm so sorry. I had chat. Okay. I, I will get it together here in a minute. I promise. Um, Christmas fabric. Snow Bunny. I, I, yeah. Um, I, do I have Christmas? I, oh, goodness. I, I've got a ton of fabric. I've got to have Christmas fabric in there somewhere. Um, okay. Put that right there. Try not to bump. Hubby's computer. Okay. King Charles. That is what he is going to look like. All right. Are you going to focus, dude? Oh, I don't know. I don't know where to... I, I still have not... And then you got your kit, which I have said many, 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 many times that you do not need to buy anything. You don't need trays. You don't need fancy, fancy pins. You don't need none of this uh, because everything comes all in a kit. So I'm going to... I love these little baggies. They're... they're kind of thin but they're still good to, to kit up i will be using the 96 slot art dot kit for this i'll show you guys in just a second uh brand new i did do an unboxing on it so make sure that um you check out uh that in my video section um, it's pretty snazzy. I kind of liked it. Okay, I do need to wax, so I'm going to set that right there. Uh, pen. Oh, goodness, this one didn't have, or maybe I'm, uh, uh, I missed it. Okay, there's my tweezers. Oh, there it is. There's my four-placer. Comes with a four-placer, comes with a scrunchie, and... So there's your pen. This is a square kit. Comes with uh, tweezers. Has a little boat. Which, by the way, if anybody has been on Facebook lately, um, Diamond Art Club's got a new kit that is fixing to be in their uh, all of their new releases. Uh, I do. It's in the Harry Potter kit. Um, Snow Bunny, you passed. I broke down. I broke down and got one. Uh, I did get the Harry Potter uh, crest with the flowers. I thought the flowers were kind of pretty. I'm not a big Harry Potter person, but it was like the... Um, uh, I did like the crest due to the bright colored flowers on that black background. I thought it was pretty cool. So it's like, okay, if I got to do Harry Potter for the new kit, is the only reason I bought it, is because of the new kit. Um, it's not Harry Potter, Kenzie said. Sander, what? Well, okay, it's not in the Harry Potter. I seen the new, well, no, I didn't get the Harry Potter. I got the, I got the crest. Uh, and who did the unboxing for that? I'm trying to remember who did the unboxing. Um, I don't know if it was, if it was Rachel Ray that did the unboxing for that one or not. I'm, I'm sorry. I'm trying to remember. Um, Joy, I am not a Harry Potter fan either. I'm really not. Um, it will most probably end up being a gift. I am going to do it. I do like the flowers. The I, I love, it looks like peonies. And I love, peonies is my end-all, be-all favorite flower. Oh, uh, mm, They smell heavenly. So, uh, yeah. I haven't seen Jenny Rose. Jenny Rose isn't here tonight. Or hasn't got here yet. She might be running a little behind. Um, I don't know if anybody's doing their, their lives right this minute or not. Um, 
I heard there is some kind of schedule to that, but I am not in that, that group, so I'm not on any type of schedule, but I know that Saturday nights is pretty popular for everybody, so maybe maybe everybody will get here in a little bit. Uh, I still can't believe how much. Oh, uh, Raining Diamonds, welcome to my club. Uh, yeah, TJ's uh, Santa. Oh, I haven't looked. I just woke up. I, I, I started the opening bid for the Santa pin. Raining Diamonds, what, what, what is it up to right this minute? I haven't looked. Okay, craftability got back in stock. Only one of the clearance kits I was loving. So oh, you jumped on it. Yeah. Thank you, Snow Bunny. It was emeralds and fairy lights. Um, I knew that there, well, there was only four kits, and somebody had two. Again, I, that's why I thought it was either Rachel Ray or... Um, <gasps> Oh my gosh, raining diamonds, really? TJ's pins up to a hundred dollars. <gasps> it's a gorgeous pin. Plus, we all sit there and watched him make it last night. Okay, again. All right, that's what I'm working on. And of course, I got a ferret that is wallowing my feet out. Who is this? Ah. Oh, come here, King Zid. This is King Sid. Say good morning. Say hello to everybody. Hi. Say my name is Sid. Say I'm just kind of wallowing around. Yeah, I know you want. Mm -hmm. You want to get on Mama's desk, don't you? Say yeah, I do, Mama. Yeah, I do. Oh goodness. Mm. You guys say hello. Say hello. 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 There we go. Yeah. This is my bad boy right here. Yes, he is. Uh, this is my, this is the spoiled rotten child of the family. Yes, I have one that thinks it's a mountain goat. Uh, and and monster child is sleeping right this minute. Thank goodness. Oh, Sid, man, you go right there. Oh, my Lord. Okay, I just slipped under my desk. My husband has, well, that's new. I have a UP, I got a brand new UPS, and I just noticed where he put it. Wow, okay. Anyway, that's that's an another thing for later. Yeah, Snow Bunny, that's Sid. He's he's wallowing my feet up right this minute, saying, hello, Mom. Ralph, you didn't have to work? Oh my God, Rain and Diamonds! I I am so happy that that TJ's pin got up to hundred dollars. And that is the auction over. Raining Diamonds is the auction over. Did she end? I can't remember if she ends it tonight or if it's ended in the morning. Yeah, Joy, Joy just got a pin. She won, I think it was last week's auction. Um, oh, Ralph, my, ba my, my babies don't have fleas. They're not outside or long enough to have fleas. Cassandra, yeah, he's my heart. Sid is my heart now. I, I have five. I have five free-range ferrets. And uh, everybody, Sid is, Sid is my heart. Um, and then we got Monster Child, which is Ellie, which thinks she's a mountain goat. Uh, she's the curtain climber. Um, was at work. Oh, Ralph, you're still at work. Okay. Raining the oh raining down you won um sweetheart I uh raining diamonds I will get my, uh if you if it has not been shipped here's the thing um okay when people place um okay I'm sorry my nose is running okay here's the thing with uh, YouTube chats and Etsy 
uh, everybody uses different names on platforms. So in all honesty, and I, I, I have the hardest time connecting one name with another. So here, um, I mean, in all honesty, I can't remember if you used raining diamonds with your Etsy order or not. So please forgive me. I just shipped out 30 orders on Friday. If your order was in that, you would have received an email from me. If you just placed an order, I promise that I will get that to you as quickly as I can. Um, Sandra, you got yours yesterday? Oh, thank you, thank you, thank you. I'm so happy that you liked it. Kinsey shot me a message and said that she, she liked everything. Snow Bunny, uh, well, honestly, it was supposed to be a partial, but you sitting here looking at it, I think I was wrong. I know that, no, nope, it is not a partial. Uh, my sincere apologies. Uh, I thought this was a partial. It is not a partial. However, it is snack size, so that's not too bad. Okay, I got it in frame. There we go. Um, so yeah. Well, let's see. What do we got here? We have one, two, three. Okay, there's four A Bs, one oh two, one twenty seven, one twenty eight, and one forty one A Bs. And there is thirty six colors. So he looks pretty cute. Okay, Raining Diamonds, if it shipped on Friday, because I did, like I said, I did 30 orders. Um, NG Glam Girl. Oh, now I know who you are. You changed names on me. A new Glam Girl. See, that's what I'm saying. Everybody changes names, and I lose track on, on who is who. Thank you, Sandra. Uh, so it'll be done in April. Ralph, it better not be done in April. Oh, please tell me these are squares. Yes, these are squares. So, okay, here is the... Can y'all see that? It is backwards on mine. I don't know why my cameras... I'll be so happy when I get new cameras set up. That is the last thing. I got the mic, I got the stand, I got everything. We're just waiting on that last camera. And for me to dye my hair, uh, and, and so I can be camera ready. Y'all, y'all definitely don't want to see me right this minute. Whew. Talk about jammies, bunny slippers, and my hair pulled up in a ponytail. I am so not camera ready right this minute. Uh, Snow Bunny, thank you. I uh, thank you for the order. I will, I will get that. Like I said, uh, we're. Believe it or not, we're a little ahead of the game. I I grinded it out on Friday, man, and it was like I am bound and determined. So I I was a, a day behind uh, on when I had told everybody expected shipping. So I literally just used Friday and just packed and packed and packed and packed and packed. If it was printed it went. And, um, so I ended up shipping out. I think it was almost, it, it was either 30 orders or give or take one or two above or below, but I had three bags worth of packages that ended up going to the post office. So it was a lot. It was a lot. Oh, thank you. Snow Bunny. Uh, you know, on my end, the video recorder, uh, it shows things backwards. Why? I don't know. It's it's uh, YouTube Live. They, for some reason, or other, it shows things backwards. Now, when I use my regular camera, it doesn't. Ralph, you say in April, huh? With everything going on? Well, believe it or not, I... With me crunching and grinding out on Friday, because I started, well, honestly, I woke up at 
Friday night or uh, Thursday night. And I, I literally grinded through the night and then Emil uh, come home and he got home about 630 and we started packaging orders at 630 a.m. And he left to go to the post office at 4 p.m. So I was, yeah, I, and it was like, if it was printed and, you know, cleaned, because see, we have to clean all the trays as well. Uh, so if it was printed and cleaned and ready to go, it, it got packaged. And so I was, I was ahead of the game by that, by the end of Friday. And it's like, yes, yes. I have two days off to where I literally do not have to do anything but push a button. Choose a file, push a button, maybe change filament, and that's it. So, uh, yeah, okay. Now, I do, okay, Harry Potter, for, okay, I'm, squirrel, squirrel. Um, going back to Diamond Art Club, and today with DAC's uh, Harry Potter releases, um... That has a whole brand new kit in it. I will be showing that. Next Saturday, we are having a uh, Christmas party, okay? Where I will be doing door prizes and giveaways and all of that. So, tell your friends and tell you, your fam. And I got stuff ordered and coming in. Uh, so, yeah. Glow in a dark filament. Ralph, don't start. Don't, 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 don't start anything, Ralph. I would love to do that glow in a dark filament, sweetheart. I really, really would. But it gums up my my printer's too bad. I'm, I'm not going to do it. Same thing with the glitter. I can't use the glitter on it either. I I tried the glitter, uh, and, and by the time we were done, let's just say the husband was not happy. Ralph, I'm going to beat you. You're starting stuff. Do not get the glow-in-the-dark filament started. Also, I'd like to know who diamond paints in the dark, okay? How are you going to see anything if it glows in the dark or not? Because, I mean, who diamond paints in the dark? That's what I'm missing. I am missing my light pad. No wonder I can't see anything. Whew. But I do have to... Well, y'all get to watch me. Y'all get to watch me do drills. Ralph, you're being bad. But that's okay. Your pen glows. Um... Does any of mine? I don't know. I mean, in all honesty, I have no clue if mine glow or not. I haven't. I haven't checked them. I haven't checked the. Um, I haven't turned the lights out. All right, this is the drills that were in the kit. What do we got for whites? Ah, six, six, six. I love that red. I love that red. It's so pretty. Uh, 380, uh, 3865. Let's see, there's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Wow, 11. There's 11 bags of white. I'm trying really hard not to bust y'all's eardrums if you're wearing, um, earbuds or, or, or headphones. Okay, that's all the whites that are in this one. The rest of them looks like they're just little bitty bits of this and that. There's not a whole lot of colors in this. There's really not. I mean, just little bitty, little bitty bits. There's an AB right there. That one's, I'm trying to find a sweet spot, guys. Hopefully that's clear. Um, Yeah. That's a pretty one. That's a peach colored one. I don't think I've seen one like that. The AB that's peach. But it's got all these. All these colors. Ooh, there's black ABs right there. I have to admit, I am partial to the black ABs. I really do like those. And then we got pink. There's pink. 
pink ABs. There's four ABs in here. Let's see. Where are you at, Mr. King Charles? All right. We've got one, two, three, four. Four ABs, and that is going to be a day. All right, you got the zero, you got the one, you got the two, and you got the up arrow. Okay, all the up arrow. Here's ABs here. Uh, ABs here. All right, you've got ABs through the handle of the cup here because that's a one. Um, here you got ABs down here. Here's your twos. For the ABs, one, two, up arrow, okay, and the, ah, any eyes, you got ABs, any eyes, so really the only two that we have a substantial amount of drills uh, is red, white, there's a ton of white, all that's white, but I'd, I'd still rather do white than black, at least I can see that. Uh, color blocking. I honestly, that's why I said this should blow out pretty fast because I mean, if you look here, all of this is white. The whole shooting match is white. So, and then all of this is red. So we have these big, huge swaths of color, color blocking. So yeah, I mean, should be able to knock it out fairly quick because I mean, look, it look the it's that is just like this little bitty teeny tiny amount here, and each uh, granted there's a lot of bags. There's there's thirty eight colors, thirty thirty five colors, and but if you look, there's not a whole lot in each bag. I mean, there's maybe a hundred drills. Um, you're kind of heavy on your reds and your browns a little bit on those right there. But that's about it. Um, no joke. There's there's really not that much. I might just work out of... Due to the fact that these are so... So uh, small. I might just work out of Ziploc bags. You know, little baggies. I have never done that before, but I don't see why I couldn't. It would definitely help when I was done with the end of the... When I was done with the painting, all I'd have to do is just, you know, toss it in with the picture and with the leftover drills. So, yeah. Let me... Um, oh, goodness. I got a mess going on here. Okay, guys. I need, Ralph juggle do something handle handle the handle the door till I get back I have to find my desk here okay there 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 all right box All right, I'm back. Sorry, guys. I had to... Again, I just woke up, so... I am flying by the seat of my hiney. Sandra! Hi! My friend, Sandy Chan, is here. Everybody, this is my real-life friend, Sandy. And Sandy is from Tennessee, across the state line. And her and I have been pals for ever oh my gosh what sandra uh sandy has been um 20 plus years now with me bebopping all over the united states from one state to another i finally moved close enough for her and i to to have coffee dates so when she lives uh about two and a half three hours away from me so when i'm on my way to go see my kids in texas i will I, I pit stop at her house for coffee and uh um and, and to unload my car because her and I we swap a lot of stuff. So it's like when I'm on my way to her house, my, my poor little Miata is is loaded down. And then when she comes to my house, her car is loaded down. 
We have boxes by our doors, you know. Oh, this is for Sandy. This is for Sandy. So, yeah. Everybody say hi to Sandy. That's, that's my pal right there. Which one of you got the other end of diamond painting? Uh, Snow Bunny. That was my uh, friend Marilyn in Canada. Um, I need to make another road trip. Sandy, I was going to go see the kids this Thanksgiving, and it. Um, I ended up, uh, my road trip turned into a new computer system. So, uh, plus, I had done gone and seen them two years in a row. Uh, so I figured that, um, yeah, but yeah, Sandy, Sandy lives across the state line from me. She is about three hours away. So, uh, yeah, Sandy, uh, is my, is my real life friend. Marilyn is my friend that's in Canada and she is the one that got me into diamond painting. So, yeah. Uh, but Marilyn, my friend, her and I, we video chat every night. So, I mean, it's, you might as well say we're next door neighbors. So thank you everyone for making Sandy feel welcome. Uh, okay. I am, this is, I am working on Christmas morning, King Charles. Uh, it is a 51 by 51. So it's really not that big and there's a ton of color blocking on it. Uh, road trip to, oh my goodness, uh, car repairs. Sandy, I am so sorry, honey. No joke. When I got to Texas last year, uh, I had problems with the Miata, but it was, uh, that's why I love my car. $10 and five minutes later, I'm back on the road. Everybody goes, you get a new car? No, I don't want a new car. Y'all can keep your new cars. I, I, I like my antique cars because it has a motor it has no electronics in it and honestly i wished it the only electronics is power windows i wished it had the roll-up windows i do not like electronics in cars no thank you i like to drive my car i don't want my car to drive me so uh yeah uh where is my doo -doo 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 -doo. again guys i am I just woke up. I am not with it tonight. Okay, that's me. All diamond painting pens that I will be using this evening is Custom Diamond Painting Pens by TJ. They have a Facebook group. Go check them out. Oh my gosh. And yay, Raining Diamonds uh, for... Raining Diamonds, you changed the dog on name. Uh, for uh, when did okay name confusion here you won tj's pin tonight tj santa claus pin correct am i am i correct about that yay if i am uh but anyway that's where my pin comes from there that's me i was upside down and my cover minders are this by miss debbie day uh, I do have happy mail coming in this week. There is my dragonfly. Uh-oh. I have to glue this one back on. It come undone. Oh. Oh, well. Love e E6000. And I will have it back there in no time. So I'm going to put that there. But that was the last one I got. And then my frog. I love, I have frog loving Felicia. Y'all have got to go check out that, that, uh, unboxing video. Oh my gosh. I had so much fun with that video. Um, and this is for the kids. Okay. So we kind of downsized from Christmas morning to this one. If I can't get this one knocked out by Christmas, I'm in trouble. Uh, anyway, they, um, I don't know if I, I want to do Felicia next or if I want to do Sweet Tooth. Sweet Tooth is round. Uh, Felicia is square. That's the only thing. I like my squares. But anyway, this is my this is my cover minders that I will be using this evening by the fabulous Miss Debbie Day of Day's Dream. So, uh, my pal. And, yeah. 
Oh my god, if you haven't been to Debbie's, go check her out, man. She has got the coolest stuff and good prices, too. But anyway, next weekend, again, I will have door prizes and I will have giveaways. And who knows? Everybody that knows me knows that I give away the kitchen sink. So, um, we are leaving from North Carolina on the 10, staying for three nights. Sandy, if I don't talk to you between now and then, man, you guys be safe. You know I'm here if y'all need anything. Trying to start a channel so much. Uh, yeah, there's a lot involved. Raining Diamonds, if you do start a channel, please hit me up. Give me your link, okay? Um, uh, and I will add it to this because if anybody uh like joys happy hobbies okay and um jenny rose if you have a youtube channel or or a store i will uh list below in the description who all was in the house so i i like to as they say share you know and uh you know send out info about other people as well so, a phone call away. Yep, I sure am, baby. But, uh, this is my last pin. I do have a brand new one. It, well, what is today? Today is Saturday. Did it come in today? It was supposed to come in today. Did my husband not check the, check the mail? Hmm. I was supposed to have goodies come in today. I did not see anything on the counter. Waiting on the house keys. Uh, Ralph, yeah, I hear you. Sorry. Hubby said I cannot give away the house. He said no sending the keys to Ralph. Raining diamonds, you're very welcome. You are you are very welcome. But this was the this was the last one. I do have uh, TJ and, and Emily's. I have a surprise box that I'm waiting on. Um, she sent me a gift, a Christmas present. And um, I won one of her uh, me pleases. So I do have a new a, a new pin coming in. I was I was happy. I like that one. The the last last one that I got. But oh my gosh, TJ is out doing himself. And if you have not watched TJ's live videos on how he's he makes the pins, you definitely have to go watch that. It is so flipping cool. It really is. And I mean, he just bebops through in like 20 minutes. It goes from this big old square honking piece of acrylic and and turns into pins but these are the three that i have this was the first one i love this one i know the lights are not doing this one justice it has got glitter in it and it's got ribbons uh all of my colors i really really like this one and then this one was uh my halloween pin it was orange and my neon yellows. I like to call this a cloud pin because it's not so much stripes, but it looks like clouds of color floating in the acrylic. And it's got glitter. But this is my end all be all uh, because it has it's made of shimmers. The whole pin is made of uh, what they call shimmer colors and i i love it it's like the one that emily has up right this minute it's white and the opal is kind of a shimmery part on it and then the other end is the acrylic with the the stars that are in it so i don't know those are those are my my pins at the moment sid Dude, really, stop chewing on. Oh, goodness. All right, you're supposed to be a good child now. Sorry, you decided. I, that, that rat loves cords. You have to be very careful with ferrets and cords because they love chewing on them. So if he can get his little teethy around anything. 
versus the ones that come with the kits. Sandy, uh, it it really depends. See, I have, I have honestly, you get this here and this one, and okay, this comes in the kits. Okay, so you have this one here. It's very lightweight. It's very plastic. Uh, this is it, still my favorite. I, I love, this is Amazon. Okay. And it's called ribbon pens and they're not very expensive. Um, and I love these because they're about the equivalent of a pencil. And so, uh, that, and then this here. Now, if you notice with TJ's pens, they're different sizes they're different widths okay so these are heavier and i like this one i love the color on it but i can't use it it's heavy and it's too fat um because i have itty bitty small hands i have two child's hands this one here and these two, due to the way that they're made, they have this concaved on the inside of it, and they're thinner. So uh, I ha I asked TJ if he could make them smaller. Uh-oh, y'all get to see my bad thumb. Sorry about that. Um, I asked TJ that if, for me, okay, if the, he could make them smaller because I have such small hands. My hands get tired, and then it's kind of like I start dropping them. Uh, again, I started out with this and love these. It's kind of like writing a letter. You know, they're they're literally pencil size, and you can see the see the difference. These are a little bit heavier than this one, not a whole lot, um, but yeah. So I have to, I have, when I buy pens, I have to be careful and watch the size on them. I can't use those big honking, uh, huge fat pens. I, I, I just can't, my hand wears out. And when I do diamond paintings, I, I have marathon. It's kind of like starting tonight. I will diamond paint all night long, all day tomorrow. And most probably won't stop until honestly, Monday morning. So I'll usually get a good 48 hours of diamond painting in there. So anyway, who bought what today on DAC's release? Who was it? Dreamers Design had releases today. Diamond Art Club had releases today. Uh, who knows? Does anybody know what's going on with craftability? I have not checked them out lately. Um, I did. What did I get from Craftability? Uh, my last. I did an unboxing for it. So, yeah, it's up. I, I have nothing in the holding pattern, as they say, for Craftability. Sandy, you need to start. Um, just plop it down on a kitchen table, sweetie. And, and you know, um, I would suggest that if your drills come in uh, bags like this, I would suggest that you uh, put them in Ziploc bags, the little bitty small jeweler Ziploc bags. It does make it easier to work with. So, oh, I was going to show y'all the tray that I'm, I'm using tonight. Okay, this is the Art Dot 96 count tray that I got. These bottles are not included. These are separate. I bought these on Amazon. They come uh, 100, no, my bad. They come 30, uh, 30 to a pack for $10. Art Dot, as you can see, has two drawers. This is the drill that came in there. This is the bottle that came in there compared to this. Love these. These are bigger. And when you have like six bags of one color, these really help out a lot. Matter of fact, we'll test that tonight. Uh, to see 
I know this one's going to hold more. So, um, but yeah, this is the brand new art dot kit. I got it off of Amazon. Um, I do not have the link listed below yet, but I will do that um, when the uh, live chat is over. Other than that, everything should be listed below as far as um, product, uh, products or items or whatever I use in my lives. I try to post that ahead of time. So that way you guys can just click a link and go and look at what I'm, what I'm doing. So, uh, yeah. Oh, Sandy, I'm sorry. Your hand's in a brace. Yeah, uh, hit me up later and, and we will, um, Sandra, uh, okay, uh, uh, Sandy, hit me up later and let me know how your wrist is. Sandra, the color changing tray, you have to hold it in your hand for and hold it kind of firmly, depending on which one you got. Um, and it, it changes colors at 88 degrees or hotter. If your hands are cold, you it won't you know it won't change as fast um but the longer that you hold the tray and the hotter your hand is the it cold is dark purple pink is um is it warmed up if you want to test it turn on the tap on the hot water and run it under the hot water it will literally change that fast Bottles link. Uh, yes, Ralph. Uh, I thought I had already sent that to you. Uh, it is, um, I did an unboxing. Look in the 96 art dot unboxing. The link is there. But yes, I will add the link below for these. Which, by the way, I'm going to do that right this minute. I'm going to see how many will fit. Compared to, um, all right, there's three bags right there. Now, these, I love these bottles. I have used these since I started diamond painting, okay? And I, I have yet to have a spill, and I, I love, love, love these bottles, but they're small. They're, they're very, very small and you can't get a lot in them. So if I have, a, if I have a lot of colors, then I end up using like five or six bottles of, you know, just one color. Um, yeah, uh, Sandra. Ralph has one of the color changing trays. So, yeah, it, it, it doesn't take long at all. And ordered a new pen. Oh, Snow Bunny, send me the link for, for the Kevin's Creation Stores. Other than that, you've been behaving. Oh, my Lord. My, my wallet's crying and my husband's threatening to divorce me. Yeah, uh, the color changing trays are really, really cool. Uh, but your, you know, the room and how long you hold it and all like that. Okay, that is cool. Okay, that is, this is, wrong lid. That is one bottle or, or one bag right there. And... You still got room for another piece of bag. Now, normally these here, one bag, I use two bottles for for big ones like this. So, uh oh, drop some, get in there, get your little butt in there. No runaways. Come on now. 
There's always got to be that one that's a, trying to be a smart butt and run away. All right, this is what we got. That's one full bottle. And here is how much that's left over compared to those. So, I do like these. I really do. Now, these are convenient because they 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 have the storage tray. That's why I like them so much. They're just in and out. Um, so, but I do like these. I was thinking maybe a shoe box or one of the photo boxes. I, I can use photo boxes. I have to order more of these. I've only got 30 of these. I, I said I was going to order more. Also, Ralph, look at there. It's got a lot of static in it. So that is not good either. Um, I need to put, um, where is my, hmm, normally I have one in here. Um, when you have static in your drills like this, I take and cut up a bounce uh, fabric softener sheet. Your name is, uh, oh my God, my name is Cassandra Lee Parker. Uh, okay, cool. Uh, yeah. By the way, my full birth name is Alexander Cassandra Lee. Oh, yeah. Y'all have the same names. Sorry, was playing catch up on, on chat there for a second. Anyway, um, these bottles, due, due to the fact that they are a thinner plastic, you're going to have a little more static to them. But I have to admit, I really do like those. And however, you're, again, you're going to be able to get maybe one and a half bags. Now, I have, what was it? Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Now, I had 10 bags of white, so if I go with these, that's going to be 20 uh, white bottles, That uh, 20 of the little bottles, and yeah, should be about 10 bottles of these. That's the only, that's the only problem with the multi, you know, when you get a, a, a lot of bags of color, and I like the compact of the tray. So, I, and it doesn't bother me having multiple bottles because everything is in that one tray. So, again, I, I don't mind that at all. I just take and put me a little sticker on the top of the extra ones. Anyway, so... I, I, I asked, did anybody get any diamond paintings today? Uh, from the new releases, nobody answered, so I, I guess either I missed it, and or um, it um, you guys didn't get anything. I was like the flash, you hear me? I logged in to Diamond Art Club early. I was set, ready to go. And, um, I, I literally got the email, flew in, got that one, added it to my card. There was no shopping whatsoever. Added it to my card and, and flew out the door fast. I can't believe how expensive they were though. That was the only thing. Uh, Harry Potter was was a little pricey today. I got enough last week. Snow Bunny, I ended up with five last week. I got four DACs and I got one uh, Dreamers Design. But I, I I was prepared for last week. I really was. Um. So I I done told a husband I had um I had done you know save my pennies so I knew that what damage that I was gonna be doing. Um, Ralph, I hear you. I totally get that. Too much money and 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 not enough money and too many diamond paintings. 
Uh, Snow Bunny, I used my discount. Uh, well, I used the coupon code they gave. I think it was Christmas 15. And, uh, but I didn't, uh, it depends on where you buy. I, I thought you could use your, your points. You got points for buying it. Uh, I, uh, I, Rain and Diamonds, when I went and bought mine, trust me, uh, there was no sale going on with Harry Potter. Because I ended up paying, um, where's, where's my papers? Uh, I had them. What did I do with them? Because mm, I printed it out. Well, yeah. Honestly, the 15% off coupon, the only thing that it did was it covered the cost of uh, shipping and it covered the taxes. That, that's the only thing that, you know, when I use, um, when I use a, a coupon code, it literally covers the cost of shipping and, and, and taxes and, and, and that's it. Uh, do, 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 do. All right, there's my people. I had to pop out chat. I can see it this week. I can see it. Oh, Emma was saying you can't use discounts due to... Uh, I, they fixed that. Snow Bunny, they fixed that. Uh, I seen an, I, I didn't understand it at the time when I read um, their comment about that, but they said that they reached an agreement with... Um, Disney or whomever, and that discounts uh, did apply. Uh, I'm not in Florida. I, I don't know about the paying taxes on that. Isn't Florida tax free? Man, if Florida is tax free, I'm definitely, I need to move to Florida. Okay, so. We put you there. We put you there. And what is my white? My white is, what is white? White is 3865. Oh, do 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 do. 3865. And I love these stickers. These are peel and stick stickers. All right. So we have drills. We have. Where's my handy dandy? Now I got green. As far as my drill tray goes, I I use my green. This and the breezy blue, um, because you it shows the colors. Okay, did that wrong. All right, with these trays, start at the top, dump all your drills at the top, and then just shake left to right. Easy peasy lemon squeezy. Starting at the top is the key with it with the uh, Oregon is free tax as well. Delaware, hey, somebody needs to go slap Kentucky around. Kentucky eats my lunch in taxes.
Oregon is also no joke. I swear all these places have got free taxes. I need to or yeah, no ta no taxes. Well, we didn't pay taxes when we lived in Florida. We lived in Jacksonville Beach Beach. Oh talk tonight, people. Jacksonville Beach, Florida. And uh yeah, it was um we didn't pay taxes. So, okay, uh, Sandra, Kenzie is lurking and lurking and working. Sweetie, if that's what Kenzie wants to do, at least Kenzie say hello, please. Kenzie be lurking and working. Um, Jenny Rose should be here in a little while. Dog has stolen my pillow, cat strong. Yeah. Snow Bunny, I hear you. Sid finally went to sleep. Ah, oh, there's a Kenzie. You said hi. I'm sorry, Kenzie. I had chat um uh turned off. Or I, I wasn't looking at it at the time. Let me let me say that. <laughs> Ralph, we pay taxes for sneezing. Ralph, I agree with you on that one. We really do. I know Kentucky eats my lunch on taxes. It's uh six percent or something like that. Okay, I need my what do I need other than a, a hole in my head? I know I keep getting up and down. You guys are going to have to... You're going to have to just forgive me tonight due to the fact that I was not ready. And I've still got white drills here in the middle. Why? Y'all really... All of y'all fell out? That's not cool. Had a bag leak. There we go. But I got it. I got it. And these look like really good drills, too. I have to admit, Christmas morning was driving me crazy. The drills were just bad. So, as always, we are going to take and we are going to roll this under. That way we are not... In it and on it. And I am going to start in the top right. As for why I stop in the top, start in the top right, honestly, I have no clue. My grandmother was an oil painter. And she always told me to start in the top right because when I was painting, it um, I wouldn't put my arm in it. So you paint from the top down instead of the bottom up. What's the size of, of this kit? Oh, Ralph, this is a uh, 51 by 51 centimeter or a 20 by 20. It's snack size and it's a ton of color blocking. So should be easy to blow through that I know of. All of this is white. I'm sitting here in the dark. Um, Yeah. All, all of all of this is just all white here. So I mean, ton ton of of color blocking. So I really should not have any. Give my frog. I like my frog. My frog makes me giggle. I like frogs. So uh, I'm just gonna I'm just gonna start in the top right with some white. I should not have to blind you guys out tonight um and it, like i said it's it's pretty pretty flexible got my, my drills here and just pick a starting spot but i do have to move my chat pop 
chat window out. We are going to slide you over here. There we go. Now I can see everybody. And you're big. So, March. Ralph, bite my skinny honey. You keep picking on me. I really, really did try to finish. I, I, I did try to start. or I did. Oh, Christmas morning was just what Christmas morning is. I'm not going to lie. Uh, next, tell Kathy good Xmas morning. <laughs> Ralph, I agree. All right, there we go. We got lift off. We have white drills on. So I figured if nothing else, I should be able to get these white drills on here. This evening, because it is just straight out. Oh, my head is not in the camera. Because that is not a, a pretty sight tonight. I got my hair pulled up in a ponytail and just... But yeah, you just go across like that. Kathy, Ralph says you didn't take no more than 10 minutes. Ralph is just, Ralph is being a curmudgeon. Cassandra, I agree about animals. They, they, they just love us. They just love us. I know my bunch does. Tell her what you did uh, with Xmas morning. Um, um, Kathy, Xmas morning, I am not going to be able to get finished for the kids and Tom. I know this, and the world knows this. So what I did was I took it and I left it as is on, you know, the way it's rolled up. The part that has diamonds on it is rolled this way where the drills are out and not crunching against each other. The bottom of it is rolled inward uh, around a little piece of styrofoam. And I use one of the Hobby Lobby tubes and just put it inside of that tube and put the drills in a Ziploc bag. Uh, tape the bag to the uh, to the uh, tube, the plastic tube, and set it in a corner. Kathy, no, no, it did not go in the trash. I, I, if you ever have one of those feelings about something that is just like, okay, this is just so not gonna happen. No matter how hard you try, you try, try, try so hard to get something done. And it's kind of like you just, every step forward feels like two steps backwards. That was Christmas morning. And I don't know why, um, other than the fact that I was really, really enjoying Mask of Love. And by Josephine Wall, I will be... The only reason why I'm working on this right this minute is because, yeah, I'm going to try to get it to the kids. And it uh, it's Christmas. I was going to go back and finish my, my mask of love. So it was just one of those things that it was like, okay, it's just not going to happen. Are you going to do the entire color block and white area first and knock out? Uh, Snow Bunny, I take it as it comes. I am very, I have a severe OCD thing going on. So I, I start in big squares and go from right to left and then come back. Right, kind of like typing. Sandra, oh my gosh, no, it is not your fault. It is not your fault at all. Honestly, it's it's uh, the business. I, I've just been, there just was not enough of me to go around. 
um, because I was constantly printing, changing filaments, cleaning drill trays. Then after all that was done, then I had to pack up orders and, you know, uh, a gift wrap everything. And, uh, you know, then get, put it in a bubble wrap and in the mailers. And by the time you're all said and done, it, you know, it literally just eats up an entire day. And then after all the packages go to the post office, I just kind of sit in my chair and just go <sighs> and breathe. So, um, it's you know, I always say that uh, when you run a business from home, you don't punch a clock. There is no clock to punch. It's a, it's a 24 seven job. So the guys that, you know, go out and do a job, they're lucky. They get to do their eight hours and then come home. Uh, okay. I, you blame us next. Uh, Cassandra next. How much was the pen you said was too thick? Uh, Sandra, I, uh, I mean, cuss Sandra, please excuse me for the 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 name uh cassandra i think i paid uh 58 dollars total for for the big fat ones this one here was the same i average uh ar around um 30 it's in between 30 and 50 depending on which one it is dreamer craft corner linda hello linda Good to see you, my darling. Come in, come in, come in. Break out your will. Come join us for the night. <laughs> Ralph falls over, not blamed for something. Ralph, the candy jar is on the stove. You know where it's at. Go help yourself. You're being a good boy tonight. You can have one piece of candy. Um, You got your new laptop, but have, uh, but have to return it. Oh my gosh, Linda, I hate to ask why. Those were not computers. They those were not good computers, sweetie. The one you asked me about, I'm sorry. Um they were they they had brand new um straight from the manufacturer, they had problems. So they were not good at all. Uh, those that ask, I am using, uh, Red Heart Wax in my multi-placer, and I'm using Glue Dots in my single placer. Um. Uh, Linda, was it a used, uh, laptop that you got? Or uh, rent to own or something like that that you got. Usually, uh, second hand, you'll have problems with the with the keypad. And especially if it's a laptop, it only takes once. And if somebody spills something in in the keypad or or uh, drops cookies or crumbs or something like that yeah it, the keyboard shot and there's no fixing it all right get lined up there dude um trying to see here guys i am work i am literally working in the dark okay uh no uh, raining diamonds. What am I using to film right now? Uh, honestly, it is. Um, I do not have my new camera set up yet. It is coming. I promise. I am using a very cheap Logitech uh, camera on a very skinny pole. Um, if anybody remembers the eyeball cams that you used to set on top of your computer monitors. That's what that's what this is. It's Logitech. Uh, Linda uses her phone. Uh, a lot of people use their phones. I guess I could have. I just I just never did. Um, as far as you know, setting up and it was just I had this and it was a Logitech eyeball cam. Is is what 
pretty much what they're called. Uh, it's not an eyeball. It's, it's long and and thin. It it does good. I plug it into the USB. And do lives. And then when I'm done, I unplug it and, you know, fold the arm down and stick it in the corner. Oh, Cassandra, you're very welcome. You are very welcome, sweetie. Uh, if you are looking at, at, at custom pins or, or custom uh, diamond painting pins by TJ, they vary, in, they, they vary in between $30 to $40. Plus, I think Emily charges $8 for priority mail shipping. So, um, yeah, it, it just depends on the pin. Uh, how much extra TJ had to put in it um, for how much it cost. So um, you just have to have to kind of have to kind of just look and you know catch your price range. I again I like this one because it's smaller and fits in my hand. I have a child's hands. I have itty bitty hands. So that was the only thing it was the first two that I got were kind of fat and they worked really good. I was able to use them. It's just that after a while they were heavy and uh, because they were so big and I, I ended up just kind of swapping out, but my purple is this one's my favorite. This is my go-to right here. I love the color. I love the, I love the color. I love the uh, the tips that I have in it. Honestly, I don't even know where I got the tips from other than ordered them off Amazon. But, yeah, and the colors. Every time I look at this pen, I always end up seeing a different color, a, a new color. Guys, I would be playing some Christmas music, but I think Amazon, or not Amazon, um, YouTube would give me a copyright strike, which we don't want none of that. Uh, Linda, I'm glad that you like the tripod, baby. I, I really am. Matter of fact, I'm going to get one for myself. Uh, I'm going to use it for, for my cell phone. Um, I just kind of felt sorry for you, baby, because you kept leaning it up against the a flower pot and it kept falling over and it was like, okay, my friend Linda needs a, needs a tripod or, or, or the, the, you needed a, uh, yeah. So that was a pretty good one too. I like the fact that it stretches out so long. You know, it works on it as a tabletop tripod, and then as well as is kind of like a selfie stick. You can stretch it out. Um, and so I was looking at it. I really do need to get one for myself. Hey, Ralph, look at me go! I'm doing a whole corner here, and I'm talking. Maybe it's because I'm not in confetti hell. And all I have to focus on is one color and making sure they're in the right place. So color blocking you do pretty good with. When you get into a lot of that confetti with the onesies and twosies, it is a, it's fun, but it's slow. You, you got to grind Now, the only thing with whites is that you have a tendency to see a river. Uh, if you get a river in the drills, you have a tendency to see those a little more with white than you do with any other color. But due to the fact that this is poured glue, uh, once all the drills are on the canvas and you leave it setting out uh, for a couple of weeks, what happens is the glue dries. And when the glue dries, it literally sucks the drills in 
And as long as the drills are seated in the glue really good, then they will they will literally pull all the drills in together and they'll all line up and match up and all like that. Uh, do the drills come off and just how long do they last on the canvas? Uh, Sandy, they are permanent. This again, what I was saying, this is poured glue. Okay. Uh, they print the can, they print the canvas out on these big, huge printers. All right. Once that's done, then they run it through another machine that has hot glue and it'll pour it down onto the canvas. Once the canvas rolls out of the machine, they put this little cellophane on top of it that keeps the glue from drying out. Now, if you pull this all the cellophane off at one time, uh, you're going to get dog hair, dust, and all, it's just going to be a hot mess. You don't want to do that. So what you do is you take little corners. You use washi tape and you grid it off. And then you start in the top right corner, or that's where I start. And you just cut out little sections at a time on how much you think you're going to be able to get done. And so, like, I see how I have the paper peeled back? Well, if I have to get up or if I am done working on it, all I do is just slide the, the, the clear cellophane back over the top. I roll it up and I set it out of the way. But for the most part, uh, you try to keep the cellophane on it until you're completely finished. Uh, and as far as uh, after it is done, I will take and lay it in a floor. And I use my big baking uh, wood rolling pin. And I will, I mean, put my whole weight on this rolling pin and roll it back and forth over the top of the drills and it's pushing those drills down into the glue making sure that they're all seated once that is done i throw it up on my my crafting table and let it sit for about two or three weeks and let the glue dry let it suck in those drills line those drills up and then i take it and have it framed so uh the drills are permanent you can take them off. Uh, say I put a drill down in the wrong place. You just take your tweezers and you just remove it and put it wherever it's got to go. But uh, once the drills are down, they're permanent. I have yet to have a drill fall off. Um, however, I, I use Diamond Art Club. And as of right this minute, they are the the number one diamond painting um, company in the United States. So uh, are they ex crazy expensive? Oh, yes, big time. They are crazy, crazy expensive. But you get what you pay for. Let me just put it that way. So uh, I love the tarpaulin canvas. And this is why I stay with Diamond Art Club is, is because of the canvas. I, I hate fighting a canvas it is just a miserable miserable experience i don't like the way it feels on my hands if that makes any sense it's just it's just i i hate um crappy hard canvases some people even go as far as ironing their canvases um, I believe it was Joy uh, that said she has ironed a couple of hers. You put the iron on a very light, light setting and you just work it back and forth and it will literally lay the canvas down. Okay. Uh, I was going... Um, Linda, I'm so sorry about your, your laptop, sweetie. Uh, your hard drive died in your computer. Okay. That's the reason why you got the black screen. Uh, if you knew, if you know of somebody that had computer knowledge, uh, you could buy a new hard drive and put a new hard drive in it and, and you'd be back up and good to go. Uh, it's kind of like, uh, replacing a fan belt on, on your car. It's easy in, easy out. It's it's all set up. Uh, Snow Bunny, thank you. Uh, I will I will totally check that out.
Thank you, thank you, Snow Bunny. I, I will I will totally check that out. Sandy, uh yeah, if you've got any other questions, I'm here, baby. Ask. There is there is no such thing as a too small or 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 dumb question. And this is why I do my videos for beginners and and do uh I guess you say take the extra time. I don't fly through my unboxings. If somebody wants a fast unboxing day, they need to go find a, another channel to watch. Um, because I take my time. I go through everything. I talk about the about the canvas. And half the time, I run into a squirrel in the process and end up talking about something else. Um, you know, oh, squirrel, shiny. So, yeah. But... I, uh, my unboxings are mostly for, you know, new people to, um, to diamond painting. That way they, they know that they don't have to buy handmade pens. You don't have to buy handmade trays. You don't have to buy all this to do a diamond painting. You get everything in the box. Uh, you get everything in the box that you need to start and finish the diamond painting. Um, it comes in a kit. And if you get a diamond painting that does not have a kit in it, contact the company because they forgot to add it. So, uh, yeah. Ralph, chipmunk. That looks like a chipmunk to me. Uh, Linda, I, I don't know. Hard drives do not cost. I just paid $35 for a solid state hard drive and they're the best on the market. So I'm not sure who told you that hard drives were crazy expensive, but yeah, no, they're not. My matter of fact, my computer's got two hard drives in it. Cassandra, good night, sweetheart. Thank you so much for stopping by. It was so good to see you. Please come back and join us again. And if you need anything, hit me up in Messenger. Uh, I am only a shout away. Bye, Cassandra. Good night, everyone. Cassandra is leaving. Good night, Cassandra. Snow Bunny. I don't know my canvases either. I usually just... Uh, Ralph tapes his down and which I guess is, you know, good as well. Um, uh, Cassandra, my server uh, has eight. My And that's low end. Uh, uh, Linda, Dreamer's Design, uh, Dreamer's Craft Corner. My computer has two uh, hard drives in it, but I have the ability for four. My server has eight, and I have the ability for 16. So, uh, however, a normal household computer system has just one hard drive in it, and the uh, life expectancy of a hard drive is five years. That is normally the first thing that will go out on a computer. And they're like a toaster. You just pop one out, pop a new one in. Uh, if you have a laptop, yeah, laptops are garbage. They're, they, they are literally a toaster. You just chunk them in the garbage and go buy a new one. Can the hard drive be replaced? Yes, it can. Um, uh, and I feel sorry for anybody that takes their, their computers to Best Buy because they're ripping you off. And half the time they don't know what they're doing. So I would find me a little, little computer kid somewhere that is tinkering in their bedroom, hand them the laptop and say, here, can you, uh, you know, do you know how to replace a hard drive? And then I would, I would just go and buy a hard drive. You can buy hard drives from Walmart. Um, sorry guys, I, um, I, I, that's the computer nerd coming out of me. I can, I can talk computers all night long. Uh, yeah. 
Now, my solid state drive, uh, a low end solid state, which is the new ones. And thank you very much, Ralph, for last week. I said I was waiting on my CPU. It was not my CPU. I was waiting on my UPS, which came in and it's the size of the dog. On, it's like a brick. It is so heavy and so big. But my fabulous husband managed to get it hooked up underneath his desk. Uh, anyway, um, yeah, the um, hard drives are, people don't realize, they go to the store, they buy a brand new computer system, and they go, oh, it's going to last forever. Oh, no, it don't. It, 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 the, when you buy a computer at the store, it's already done been sitting on a shelf for two years. Uh, so, you know, it's, it, yeah, it's done been put together, sitting there waiting for you to buy it. So that's why there's so many updates and upgrades when you buy a brand new computer at a store. You think it's brand new, but it's not. It's, it's two years old. Yeah. See, Sandy, that's what I was saying. You know, now I have... Uh, my new computer, my new gaming system is a desktop. Uh, I have a 17 inch laptop. I, it was okay. I, I was not overly thrilled about it. Um, I, I am, give me full keyboard and it was little stuff. The, the, the 17 inch laptop was the top of the top. Okay. So I, I, it would stand up and dance if I wanted it to, but I didn't like the um, uh, the user part of it. It, it. it was just, I didn't like the feel of the keyboard. Um, it just gave me fits, not to mention I have, um, I, I am very, very nearsighted. Uh, so, you know, I bought the biggest that they had at the time, which was a 17 inch. And, um, it was okay, but I still had problems seeing it. Um, so it was like, yeah, uh, I, I literally just decided yeah, I'm done with laptops there. I, I went back to my, I, I like my desktop and I have two huge monitors that take up this entire wall. Uh, uh, four memory and one hard drive. Okay, so I take it you're talking about it's got four memory sticks in it. Had four memory, but one and two. Uh, Lynn, I'm sorry, sweetheart. I, I, I'm not sure what you're trying to tell me. Snow Bunny, yes, that's exactly what I just got. Was uh, a gaming. I, I, yeah, my laptop was a gaming laptop, and and it is upgradable. I just didn't like laptops. I, I, I had been so used to uh, desktops and a keyboard and and all like that. Uh, plus, it was clunky. Um, it just it was clunky. I. I I don't now. If I had a job and I was going places and and doing things and what have you, uh, leaving the house every day and and stuff like that, yeah, I could see where a laptop would be beneficial. But I just sit here all day, every day. So, uh, I, not to mention, I've got my watch, I've got the cell phone, I got an i, I got a pad, I got a Kindle. And they all do the same thing. So it's not like I'm doing without if if I leave the house. Um, I just had no need for a laptop. So I went back to, um, I got a, um, what did I get? Uh, honestly, I would have to pull out the papers. Forgive me. Uh, I, off the top of my head, I cannot remember the name of my computer system. I do have more brain cells this week than I had last week. Uh, I, d don't ask me what happened last week. I could not remember my own name last week. 
Uh, but yeah, I will. I will get the stats on my on my new gaming computer. It's it's. I know all of my sex accessories are are razor. And I just got the new Steam Deck in, or Stream Deck. Hubby is setting that up for me. Uh, I'm not exactly sure what all this does right this minute, but I'm figuring it out. So, yeah, it's one of these figured out and fly by the, fly by the seat of my pants, and y'all just kind of go along with the ride. So, what I, you know... What's good is good, and what's bad, it's like, I'm so sorry. Don't eat me. I'm trying to get better. But, yeah, the only thing I got left is we have not decided on whether to do a video camera or a, a, a camera that has video ability. Um, now there is a humongous price difference. Why? I have no clue. Um, but the, um, or Snowbunny, maybe you can help me with this. The, right this second, I'm, I'm using, you know, good old fashioned Logitech, you know, good old reliable Logitech. And it is just plug it in and go kind of thing. But I got the new mic and I got all the new stuff for it. So, again, we're just trying to find, you know, what would. I have no reason for a camera. Um, that is the only thing that I could, you know, think of that, um, you know, why I would buy that style. Uh, video recorder is cheaper and I'm talking way cheaper because if I go with the camera, they want anywhere from 800 to $2,000 for a camera. And it's, it's okay. I, I don't understand why I have not researched enough yet to figure out why the, the humongous difference in the prices now, um, as far as a video camera goes, I can get a top of the line video camera for 150 bucks. So, um, yeah, I don't know. I don't know. Uh, I, again, you know, we're doing our homework. We're doing our research and, uh, I, I am not in a rush, um, you know, I don't think YouTube's butt is on fire. Um, oh, uh, while I'm thinking about it, Joy, are you still here? Joy Martin from Joy's Happy Hobbies. Um, I wanted to let you guys know if you are a channel supporter, my sincere apologies. Buy me a coffee uh, had a falling out with YouTube. So, not YouTube, my bad, uh, PayPal. So, the buy me a coffee people are no longer using PayPal as a form of accepting payments. And sent me a nice little email that, yo, you got to switch over today. And to date now. Um, and if you don't, then your junk is no longer going to work. And I'm like, okay. So, bless her heart, Michelle sent me a message and saying, hey, I'm, I'm trying to do this and it's not letting me. So, we had to go back at it again. And, oh my gosh, I wish PayPal would have the, um, they have the donation thing, but they don't have the, like, levels thing. Uh, I've been with PayPal since day PayPal opened their doors. I knew they were a good company. Um, don't care who's behind it. Don't give two hoots about all that. Uh, I just, it was, I like the way that the company worked, and they were good security. So that's why we 
We went with them, and I've had them literally since the day they opened their doors. But uh, I tell you what, the Buy Me a Coffee company, they're not going to be in business for much longer. They're really not. Uh, the I, I'm trying to remember the last person that that split the sheets with PayPal. They're they're no longer around. Uh, and and I only had three subscribers to the Buy Me the Coffee. I feel sorry for for Mindy. Um, of Mindy's Diamond Moments, she's got a lot of subscribers. Uh, people like uh uh, uh Fairy Lights. Uh, she's got you know people that use this. I have Discord, but oh my gosh, Discord is just so huge. I, I mean, it's just crazy huge and uh, just overwhelming. So I have not done, I haven't, I just haven't turned it on yet. So I don't, I don't know what I'm going to do. Anyway, I thought that I would let you guys know that, you know, if you're having issues, this is why. Uh, buying a Canon EOS Rebel. T6 and it will only record for 22 minutes. Uh raining diamonds. Why didn't you send it back? That's battery. There's something wrong with the battery. And I I, I agree. That 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 sucks. That's a, that bites a big one. Uh can't be sub between the two. Snow bunny. Um who is Glam Girl? Which which one of you guys Glam Girl changed your name? I remember Glam Girl. I'm I'm having a hard time remembering who's Glam Girl from last week. Is that Raining Diamonds or is that Snow Bunny? For, I'm sorry guys, I'm bad with names. I need to make notes. Um I can't decide between the two. I want to reboot my craft channel. Uh, a snow bunny, you reboot your craft channel. Hit me up. Glam girls. Thank you. Raining diamonds is glam girl. I got that. Glam girl. I, I told you, I, I can't forget. <laughs> Raining. I need to, where's my pen and piece of paper? I am so bad with names. And everybody's got a different name on a different platform. So it's hard to keep up with who's who. But uh, thank you, Sandra. Thank you uh, for cluing me in. Changing your name to Tiffany. <laughs> oh, my goodness. They told me you, uh, you had to upgrade the camera for more recording time. Uh, well, I mean, Rain and Diamonds, if you've got a, a, a low-end camera, yeah. Uh, I would say if you have, if your camera is five years or older, uh, then I, I would try to, um, um, Oh, brain fart. Give me a second. The chip. I would try to add a, you know, if it's a hunting for hard drive space or space like that, I would go and see if I can install the chip in it and get you a 64 gig. Um, I got a, what was 136, 162. I got a humongous one uh, that no, cost me a pretty penny, but I got a huge one. See, that's what I'm saying. I, I want to buy a camera or a video camera that is going to last, you know, and not be dead and out of date by tomorrow. Also, it has a lot of space. Now, when I do videos, I have a, a hundred and some odd gig uh, external hard drive that I, I only use for my uploaded videos. That's where all my uploaded videos are stored is on this external hard drive. 
nothing is saved to uh, 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 the computer or the cell phone or anything. It all goes on that, that external hard drive. Bonnie! Hi, Bonnie! Come in, come in, come in, darling. Break out your whipping chat. Bringing home the tree from DAC. Oh my goodness, how cool is that? This is a uh, Christmas King Charles from DAC. Yeah, so that's what I'm working on here tonight. Um, been like two years since I uploaded a video. A snow bunny. I mean, I tried to that stated that schedule. Uh, life is life, okay? And those people that can, yay for them. I am very happy for them. Um, but me, I am such a fly by the seat of my pants kind of person that I'm lucky I'm here uh, on Saturday nights because I, I, I woke up at like a quarter after 10, Gave the hubby a kiss, shoved him out the door, and grabbed a cup of coffee. And it was like, okay, ready, set, go. Uh, was I ready to go live? No. Uh, you know, it's like, I love you guys. And I'm so happy that y'all tolerate me and like me for who I am. Because I am so not ready for this uh, live whipping chat right this minute. Please hold on while I go get coffee and while I I, I, I settle the fur babies down because they were wanting to get into the camera. And yeah, I was so not ready for tonight. But at the same time, you know, I have fun with this. It's not a job. And when it turns into a job, that's when I, that's when I walk away from it. Ralph, have a have a uh, a tray to print. My makeup needs some color. Ralph, I oh hush, I do not have. If my face was in this camera, I am so sorry because I look like ground up dog meat right this minute. I woke up threw my hair in a ponytail and grabbed a cup of coffee and said, good morning. Here I am. Um, I, Snow Bunny, it does. Life happens. Um, I uh, see this for me. I, I, it is what it is. This is a hobby. Okay. I am playing with this. If it grows and becomes big, uh, is that a plus? Yeah. Uh, if it doesn't, and and I'm just going to keep being me. I'm going to keep chugging along doing what I want to do. Right this minute, I'm doing diamond painting. So, um, you know, that's what I'm doing. I might be gaming, you know, streaming video games tomorrow. Um that's why I bought the computer system that I bought. I bought a gaming system so uh, I could, you know, stream videos. I just got the stream deck. I don't know exactly everything about that. That is a new kid on the block. Um, but it's all this is exciting and it's fun for me because I never... Being in the computer industry, this was the this was the low end. Uh, it's where people come to to have a hobby to play with. It wasn't um, the computer job itself was, you know, the the big, you know, installs and upgrades and updates and working out the bugs of software programs and stuff like this. Uh, when we went to do a video, that was like a hobby, you know, it wasn't really taken all that seriously. So I, it, you know, I am on the back end of the learning curve on that one. Um, can I run circles around a computer? Oh, oh yeah. You know, do I know about YouTube video and not a lick, 
not a lick. Um, I can take apart a computer and rebuild it within a matter of five minutes. And, and that's just a rebuild. I can, I can have it up and running in two hours. And that's literally from start to end. Uh, install and upgrades, updates, and, and literally say, here you go, have fun and, and you're ready. Um, I can work out the bugs and, and write code and all the rest of this. But, you know, again, I'm good at software packages. Um, so it's just a matter of sitting down and learning it. That's like editing. I don't edit my videos. Why? I say what I mean. I mean what I say. Why should I chop it up? There's no need to. Um, I would like to add a pretty little picture on the front. I would like to add a thank you at the end. But as far as the middle, yeah, no, I'm not going to sit there and spend umpteen trillion hours editing a video. There's, I'm me. I say what I mean. I mean what I say. Uh, no more, no less. I have a separate channel for gaming, but again, life. Oh my gosh, Snow Bunny, you gotta, you, you, I need to yank your little chain about that, girlfriend, because uh, I, I do. I want to, I want to stream um, uh, video games like, like my gamer boys do. Um, and I, I didn't, again, it's, it's a playing with, it is not anything serious. I have Twitch, Discord, I got all that. I literally just got to turn it on. Um, so I'm, I'm in the process of getting the hardware to be able to support the software. Um, I just got everything in last week. And so it's pretty much setting it up and getting it ready to go. Ralph, don't mix your words. Uh, yeah, I don't. I, I don't. And, you know, I guess, you know, people that edit their videos, yay and great for them. But if you listen to everybody that does video, uploads videos, that is the, the one thing they hate doing is editing a video. I don't know why. And if editing a video is such a pain in the butt, why are you doing it? Um, uh, you know, maybe it's maybe it's the lack of knowledge that I'm missing uh, for what the purpose of editing a video is for. Um, uh, and, and like I said, I just haven't slowed down long enough to learn the software. Um, but I, you know, I'm raw, uncut, unedited, and if I screw up, I'm the first one to apologize, and, you know, if you guys are happy with what I'm saying and I'm doing, then you're here, you know, if y'all don't like what I do, then you leave, so that's, you know, there's, it's pretty black and white, so if I'm screwing up and y'all leave, then that's kind of a warning sign. Tiny amounts of editing, like a, a very little, most of mine are not. Uh, Snow Bunny, I agree. I agree. Uh, now, Jenny Rose uh, just started um, a, her, her YouTube channel. And, oh, my gosh, I love her intros. She's got gorgeous little intros. Uh, now, that I would like to have. I, I would like to have, like, a little intro, uh, you know, on my... Could I hire an editor? Yeah. That's what most of you gaming YouTubers do, like Jacksepticeye and, and Hollow and what have you. They uh, Now, Hollow edits his own, but Jacksepticeye sends his out and, and has a guy that does the editing for him. Uh, why? I, I guess is to add all the extra little tiny bells and whistles, you know, the... the uh, I, I, you know, the extra little fancy stuff you see in the middle of a video. Me, personally, it's like, yo, dude, I'm I'm just me. 
not trying to be anything else special, but apparently that's the bane of everybody's existence is editing videos. So I don't, I don't know, you know. Oh my gosh, guys, we got 11 people in here. Hi, everybody. Hi. We have 11 fancy dancy peoples in here tonight. So, oh my goodness, we are, we are rocking the house. I feel special. Oh, Raining Diamond, you leaving, honey? Thank you for stopping by. Bye. Bye, everybody. Raining Diamonds is leaving. Bye, sweetheart. Have a fabulous evening. Vonnie, you waved at the screen, huh? I, I do do. Bye. 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 Yeah, I'm constantly, I, I've then got into the habit of talking to the screen. Even when you guys are not here, I'm so bad. My husband thinks I'm talking to him. You talking to me? No, honey. No. Uh, apparently, right this minute, I'm talking to myself because there's nobody on the on the monitor. So uh, I do, guys. I, I am. I need one of those signs that I need to throw pairs. Be right back in one minute. Uh, Ralph, do a tap dance or a floor show. I will be right back. I got to go check on my cherry vanilla Dr. Pepper that's sitting in the sink. Uh, note to self, never freeze a cherry vanilla Dr. Pepper in a styrofoam cup. Because when you go to thaw it out, it literally bleeds through the styrofoam and makes a huge mess on your desk. So I will be right, right back.
I'm coming, I'm coming, I'm coming. I promise I did not run away from home. I am back. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Hi, I'm back. I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Uh, cherry Vanilla Dr. Pepper is still in the sink. And again, do not ever freeze the styrofoam. Apparently, when my cherry vanilla froze, it stretched the styrofoam, and now it's literally pouring out in between of uh, the styrofoams. So, um, yeah, it's in the sink right this minute. Big, huge mess. Also, I had to go and check the printers and take stuff off and push a button and start new stuff. So, thank you for holding down the fort. Um, here's fleas scratching. Ralph, my ferrets do not have fleas. Raining diamonds, you leaving? Oh my gosh, bye. Or who's leaving? Uh, okay, raining diamonds. Night, everyone. Bye. Bye, raining diamonds. And let's see, I'm playing catch up here. I waved at the screen, Bonnie. Yes, I waved at the screen myself. Uh, jumps up on the table and does a dance. Dee, 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 dee. Yep. Ralph, you falling down on the job. Uh-oh. Ralph's falling down on the job. Yep. I, I'm going to have to get Sandra to do the table dance next time. Uh, Bonnie, I have five free-range ferrets. It's called a mob or an infection. Uh, I they have neither. With ferrets, um, it, it's just part of their nature. They they literally are, they're clean as a whistle. Um, but it's just they have itchies. Uh, it's it's part of their nature. Is what they do. Ralph, I'm at work doing my job. Ralph, you're holding up the counter right this minute. Uh, Sandy, I, 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 it was from Zaxby's and it was in a styrofoam cup and uh, I ate lunch early and I was trying to save it uh, for tonight and stupid me stuck it in the freezer. And when I stuck it in the freezer, it froze, but it also stretched the styrofoam and it was literally leaking out through all the pores on the styrofoam, making a big, huge mess on my desk. Hi, Kathy. Okay. Whoever's coming or going, y'all be safe. Um, yeah. Who's up? Who is that? Somebody was just up. I don't know. Where'd you go? Oh, that's Maxie. Max is up. Come here, Maxie. Come here, Maxie. Hey. Come here. Come see the mama. Come here. There we go. Come see the mama. Oh. This is the fat boy. That's Maxie. Say hi, Maxie. Say hi. Say hello. Hi. Say hello, everybody. My name is Max. Mm. Say hi, Maxie. Oh, my goodness. Oh, my goodness. Yes. She'll come out. Oh, I see CPIs. I see CPIs. Oh, I see CPIs. Yes, I know. Oh, my goodness. All right. There you go. Oh. Right this minute, they are um, in a, uh, they sleep on a dog bed with a couple of blankets sewed on top of it in the corner underneath my desk, which is so not cool. Uh, I have to get them... Hubby was going to build him a house um, and set it on the opposite side of the room. That way they're not under my feet because I'm always scared that I'm going to I have wheels on my chair. I'm always scared I'm going to roll over on somebody. So I have to constantly 
look before I move. Uh, so I'm not, I am not rolling on anybody's tootsies. Okay, I need a clippy. Where is my, I need, oh, there's my clippies. All right, Mr. King Charles, now I can finally oh, get to you. Okay. All right, we are, uh, I am now where I can see this darn thing. It was stretched all the way across the desk. It's good for you guys, bad for me. Got my frog. There's my colors. Right this minute, I'm working on white. I am not organized tonight. I don't think I'm ever organized, to be honest. But we are going to... Hey, at least tonight I am I am laying down a field of drills. So, if you concentrate and put your mind, you know, spend a couple of minutes doing this, it really does not take a long time. Uh, especially when you've got big swaths of color like this uh, for color blocking. It you just literally knock it out of the park in no time. I have to get some new tips um for my pins. And if I edited my videos, uh, I would cut out the part of where I left for two minutes to go reset printers and check Dr. Pepper's because I also was supposed to have gotten happy mail today that I was kind of really looking for. Oh, sorry, guys. My head's in the screen. Um, see if that helps. There we go. Um, uh, but I didn't see anything, so I don't know if he, if he checked the mail or not. We both kind of, he come home from work and I was, oh God, I was exhausted. I've been it had just been a long couple of days, and I'm bad about going two or three days and not sleep. So, um, yeah, I was playing catch up. And um, I was playing catch up with, on the sleep thing. And it was like, okay, he threw food at me, and it was like, feed me, I'm hungry, so he went and got, um, we had uh, Sonny's barbecue for dinner, and I had a rack of ribs, uh, they're baby back ribs, I think is what they're called, um, I had that, and some of their beans, a little bit of coleslaw, and I, he just, uh, uh, he had stopped and got the stream deck. And he goes, I got you a new toy. And I'm like, okay. But I was so stupid tired that it was like, he goes, watch this video. And I'm watching. And, and honestly, I was staring at it. And it was, it, it was like, okay, is this boy even speaking English? Because it was just... Phew, I, I wasn't getting it, and it, I, it was, I, yay, please turn that off, I'm going to bed, My, I, I have no brain cells right this minute to uh, pay attention to anything, I had done hit what I call stupid tired, and it, it was, yeah, I'm, I'm going to sleep right this minute, regardless of if I'm sitting in this chair or it's laying in a bed. Preferably, I'd like to be laying in the bed. So I told him good night. He played with 
the new Steam Deck a little more, and he came in and finally laid down because he had to work tonight as well. He had to go back to work after vacay. Uh, Kathy, yeah, the baby's, uh, who's up? Maxie's still up. Maxie gets up and he's, he gets, he's the fat boy. He's the, he's the Sherman tank of the family. Um, he's, he's constantly eating. So he, uh, but, and he's so laid back. He, Max is the, I don't care about anything rat of the family. He's kind of like a stoner. You know how stoners are? Yeah, that's Max. Max is just like, yeah, dude, I'm here. What do you want? Okay, cool. <laughs> that's Max. You want to love me? Sure, love on me. You don't want to love on me? I don't care. Yeah. You know. But he is. He's he's trippy. Maxi is trippy. He's in he's in a, a world of his own. Ellie, the mountain goat, she is 24-7. Pay attention to me. Sid, um, Sid has his moments. If I'm up and moving around, oh, he's he's got to be all in my business. And um, he is he is totally a mama's boy. Uh, Izzy, Izzy is, is just, she's the quiet one. She's the one that you, she's not very, uh, she sleeps a lot, very playful, but she's the soft, cuddly, snuggly one. And then we got Seymour and Seymour is just, uh, Seymour was adopted and had a hard life. Um, and he is having some issues. But he is comfortable. He is he is fat, happy, and, and healthy. But he does have uh, uh, issues. Uh, medical kind of issues. And um, one thing about it, with a ferret, when they have medical issues, nine times out of ten... Um, 99.9% of the time, it is a form of cancer, and there is no fix in it. Uh, you know, you can go and run up vet bills all you want to, um, there's no fix in it. it it's not a matter of if it's going to happen, it's a matter of when is it going to happen. So we just make him as comfortable as possible and make sure that he gets a lot of love and a lot of hugs and scratches and, and you know, big old comfy blankets to snuggle. Matter of fact, I gave my own personal wubby. Okay, they, they got mama's wubby. So, but yeah, he, uh, we just make him as, as comfortable as possible and he, he, each one of them has their own personality. No two are the like. Um, each one has their own personality and their own uh, attitudes and, and just, you know. Now, I do think that it's the type of ferret they are because my first set of ferrets, um, I hate to put it that way, was... Um, they live to be 12 and 15 years old, which the life expectancy of a ferret is eight years. Um, so anyway, they lived very long, very happy, spoiled, rotten lives. Um, but each one of them was like the batch that I have now. They're they're very different breeds. Uh, Sid is is Sid is kind of uh, called a fox because of his coat color. Uh, Max is sable. Ellie is white with pink eyes. Uh, she has a genetic deformity that, that, uh, we thought there for a while she was blind, uh, deaf as well as blind, but she's fine. She's too ornery not to be. And, um, so, and, uh, Max, he is identical to Tinkerbell as far as his attitude. Tinkerbell was a sable, and they are 
I, I and then I have two brown ones. Izzy and Seymour are the the uh, I guess you could say normal ferrets that look brown with the they look like little raccoons um, with their faces and um, they have their personalities as well, which is now their personalities. The brown ferrets, their personalities differ. Uh, between the girls and the guys. Girls are extremely, extremely hard-headed when it comes trying to potty train them. Uh, yeah, the, good luck with that. Uh, boys, on the other hand, are, you, okay, mom, you know, you put my butt here enough times, I've got the hint. So they, they get clued in. See? See? Big old corner. Da da. This is a lot more. This is twice as much as I did last week. So I have to admit, this one's this one's off to a good start and should not have any problems at all. Yeah, Ralph, if you get these bottles, you definitely gonna have to put something in them. They have um they got serious static going on. Ah where is my what did I do with that? I don't know what I did with my my fabrics of Nerjeet. Okay, let's toss in some some snuggle, and it smells so good. Really, you just take it and and you take your folded up uh, fabric softener sheet and you cut it about, I'd say half an inch there, about maybe an inch, and I just uh, cut it like that and. Toss it in. I do like these bottles. I really do like these bottles. And they hold a lot more. Why are you? Oh, good. Now, I don't. I think. Houston, I think we found our problem with these bottles. Is anyone else done painting while listening? Uh, I think if, if Kathy and Ralph are home, they are. Um, good question. Hey, Ralph, it was your turn to have questions this week, by the way. Ralph was supposed to have gave us our questions for the week. Sandra, I didn't offend Kinsey, did I? I hope not. If I did, I'm sorry. Uh, she had messaged and said that, uh, she had a, a, uh, no fabric sheet. N Nana of Seven Crafts. I'm done. Hi, you were you were hiding in the back of the room there, sweetheart. Hi, Nana of Seven Crafts. Welcome, welcome. I didn't see you there. Uh, I haven't had a moment to myself to get any. Uh, Ralph, I, I, I feel you, dude. Um, Sandra. Oh, uh, thank you, Sandra. Uh, I, I wouldn't, I, I know, you know, Kenzie's uh, working, or, I mean, according to her last message to me, but I was just making sure. You know, you know my little OCD brain. Okay, these are pill bottles. The only thing that I have noticed with these bottles is that they are 
staticky. Uh, so I did put a healthy size uh, piece of fabric softener in there. Nana of Seven Crafts, sweetheart, you want to lurk? You are more than welcome to, to lurk all you want to. I do not mind. We are just happy that you are here. Oh, you're working on the, the Christmas gnomes? I have that one. It's so pretty. Oh, Kenzie, there you are. Thank you, darling. Um, I, I was just making sure you were okay, you know. Um, you're just lurking and night. You have a migraine. Oh, my sorry. I, I am so sorry about the migraine. I feel you there, sister. I, Excedrin, I, I usually take uh, a half an Excedrin, a half a Tylenol, and a half an Ibuprofen when I get a migraine. And if it doesn't, if all of that does not knock it out in like 30 minutes, I, I go to bed. They, migraines it, it, it are just rotten. Yeah, that is, uh, Sandra, you're right. That's the one that Mrs. Crochet and Coffee was working on. It was really pretty. Nana, um, when you get it done, take pictures and, and, and tag me on Facebook. Um, I'm not sure what your Facebook name is, but, um, cause everybody uses different names on different platforms, but yeah, tag me, tag me. I'd love to see it when it's, it's completed. Okay, guys, I got a question. All right. Diamond Art Club has the Harry Potters, right? They are collector's items. They are numbered and all this good collector's item garbage, right? Uh, kind of like Zox. Now, I, when I get this uh, diamond painting, do y'all think that I should sit on it? And maybe resell it down the road uh, if it goes up in value? Or do you think I should just say poo-poo on it and do it and be happy and be done with it? My cat sitting in front of my TV watching. Uh -huh. Hi, kitty, kitty. What is it? What's the kitty's name again? Hey, Snow Bunny, you, you know, you, you doze, uh, you do what you do, you, you do you, baby. Uh, it's, I, Nana of, of Seven Crafts, sweetie, and in, in all honesty, I, I have that one, and I have the, uh, the snowman, uh, the Believe Snowman, I like him as well. So, I, I'm not sure which one I'm going to do next. Mike, your Facebook name is your government name. Um, okay, well, hit me up on Facebook. And, and yeah, um, tag me. Tag me in your, your pictures. Also, anybody. Okay, I'm leaving this up to you guys, all right? I'm not chasing y'all down. Anybody that is in chat tonight, if you have a YouTube group or a, a, a YouTube channel or a Facebook group or something like that, and you want it posted in the description box below, send me a Facebook message with you, hashtag YouTube that way or the word YouTube or something in it. That way I will add you and your link to the description section in the uh who was here okay like linda uh yeah hit me up send me your youtube link because um i am trying to give shout outs to everybody that comes and and joins on saturday night lives like, you know, who stopped by, who was here, that kind of thing. And if they have a have a link to something and they want me to share it, then I will. 
However, you have to hit me up on Facebook. I, there's too many of y'all for me to keep track of. So if you will put YouTube in the message somewhere, I will know it's you. Not to mention everybody has different names for different platforms. Mrs. Wiggles. <laughs> Mrs. Wiggles. Oh, Sandra, thank you. Well, give Mrs. Wiggles a scratch on the ear for me. And I'm 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 glad that I am her favorite show to watch. Uh Nana of Seven Crafts again. Please send me a Facebook message. Uh, let me know that, hey, I'm Nana of Seven Crafts, but this is my, who I am here, and here are my links, because I will be more than happy to list your YouTube, your Facebook, and your Etsy store uh, in the who was here tonight. I will be more than happy. I I am not one of these people that is going to like, oh my God, you know, uh, uh, you got this. No, the internet is huge. Okay. There is, there is plenty enough room for everybody on the internet. And uh, so I do not mind uh, sharing and, and helping. And, and, and because if you think about it, we all have to network our own junk, right? Well, why not help out your friends? And if I can help you guys out, you know, by adding a, a, a two, you know, taking two seconds to add a link to a description box, I do not mind at all. You know, I, I, it's, I'm paying it forward. Let me just say that. Uh, so yeah, but the only thing is you guys confuse me because you got different names for different places. Um, I am Nick's dark sky everywhere. Uh, so yeah, do you have to send me a Facebook message with the links? And I will be more than happy to add them. And also go stop by your Etsy store and check out your goodies. I buy from other stores as well. So, you know. Oh, I got a question for you guys. Uh, who has, who in chat has the long skinny tray with the lid and the plug? Who here has got that? I have a, 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 a customer that um, purchased one. And she said it split and it broke. And she sent me pictures, but they were kind of grainy and not good. Uh, okay, Linda, you'll work. Um, and I replaced it. I, oh, I'm so sorry. Please accept my apology. Because every so and then, now and then you do get bad prints, okay? But I am OCD fanatical. Nothing leaves this house unless it is spot shined and perfect um anyway she purchased this the the long thin one that has the slot on tray with the plug so i replaced it i sent her another one i'm i'm so sorry keep it throw it in the garbage do what you want to do here's another one i i sent her another one and she left me a three star review saying that, you know, oh, it's splitting already. I don't understand what split. She, she, I, she wouldn't give me freaking details. So I, I don't argue with people and I'm not going to fight with people. And it's like, I'm so sorry that this happened again. Uh, and I refunded her money, all uh, including shipping charges. I, I just refunded the whole thing. And uh, matter of fact, uh, I, I refunded her money and I'm sending her the beast tomorrow. I wanted to show you guys. This is the Christmas one. It's in it's uh, blood red rose. So I love this color. Uh, but anyway, yeah, I'm sending this to her tomorrow. 
but I, I, in hopes of making up for the other one. Um, but she gave me three stars, and it it it, I, it upset me a little bit because it, she didn't tell me that it still had problems. Well, I can't fix it and redesign it to fix the problem if I don't know where it's at. You don't have the lid. That's why I asked, who's got it? Who who has, uh, because um, I have looked and looked and looked and looked and looked. And I don't know where this split is at that she was talking about. So I wanted to get y'all's opinion on this um, and, and see what happened and what you thought about it because I can't find a split and and I can't redesign the tray and fix the tray if I don't know where the split's at. Linda, uh, if you will Facebook message me the color of tray that you got and the type of tray you got, when I send your order, I will send you another plug. Um, yeah, I, I, I do not mind replacing plugs at all. Uh, I just, you know, I just ask that you guys cover the shipping charges and Linda, due to the fact that you've got an order that's fixing to go out, I will, I do not mind at all adding a extra plug to your order. But yeah, um, it, I think what upset me the most was the fact that she didn't message me about the second problem. She just left me a three-star review. Uh, it's splitting already. I don't like this tray. That that kind of thing. And I, I did email her uh, twice. I emailed her through... Uh, Etsy, as well as direct email, and she never replied back. So, um, I wanted to ask what y'all's opinion was, because I, I, I can't, I, I don't know where this thing split, and she said that it's happened twice. Uh, Sandra, maybe, maybe, um, you know, I have literally out of the thousand plus items that I have sold, um, I've only got three non-five star reviews, uh, which is fantastic. Uh, I'm not complaining. I'm more upset at the fact that I have a customer that is not happy about something, and I'm one of these people that I, I will kill myself trying to make you happy. Um, and it's, it's what is aggravating me is this tray has an issue, but I can't find the issue according to her. Does it, am I making sense? Um, she goes, I have a problem, not once, but twice. I have a problem. And I can't find the problem. I can't fix it if I can't find the problem. Uh, Vonnie, the thin one with the lid and the plug, this is the one that she said that split. Now, I'm looking at this. Um, there is the same right here. Right here. Okay. That is two lines. Those two lines are not connected. Um, and it was because when he designed this tray, he forgot to put an extra uh, line across the top. But it's the design. It's the way it's made. So, but the rest of the tray is fine. I don't know what she's talking about on what split. I, I, for the life of me, I cannot, she sent me photos, but 
I didn't understand. I couldn't understand the photos. the The photos didn't um, the photos didn't make sense. I'm just gonna put that. Linda, is that the plug that you lost? Uh, if you will tell me what color it was and what kind of tray it was, I will I will send you another plug. I have extras. I print extras all the time for that very reason. If mind it, plus. Uh, Nana of Seven Crafts. Yes, I did. I refunded her complete money, including shipping, which I did not get. Uncle Sam got shipping, but I did, I did refund the entire amount. Um, don't send her the new tray. Um, I, I, I don't know what to do, it, and it bugs me. The I, I have two things that's bothering me. One is the fact that, according to her, the the tray has a design flaw. Okay, uh, I want to fix a flaw if it's there, so it doesn't happen again with somebody else. Um, second thing that upset me is I have a customer that is upset that left a three star review without contacting me to tell me that she was upset. So I, I feel like I'm chasing my tail here, or, you know, going around in circles. Um, I wrote a very nice note to her. I'm sincerely sorry. Um, I did email her. I did Etsy email her. No reply back. I have not heard anything else from her. And so I printed out her, I, I refunded her money. I printed out her invoice. I wrote a note on her invoice that I had refunded the money. Please accept this gift in exchange for the item that you said was damaged and, and gave me the three stars on. Because this is the color that she got it in. So it's the same as the small one, just a large version. Uh, but it's just, it's, it's got in my head space. Uh, it's just got in my head space is the only way to put it. You've re refunded her money plus the two trays. Please don't send the new tray. Uh, don't worry about it. She's doing something to it. Uh, one started your mystery box. Yeah, Ralph, I think there was one in the mystery box that I sent you. Uh, sounds like she's doing, s uh, Linda, I, I thought maybe the same thing because I'm like, oh my goodness, what are you doing? You know, uh, are you just like royally beating the hell out of it? Um, yeah, it's the long skinny tray, Ralph. Uh, Vonnie, I did. And, and, and again, I, I even paid to, I even offered to pay for her to return it. Um, but I, I have no communications whatsoever. She, she just, she's not replying to my emails. And, and Linda, I agree. I, I can't make everybody happy. I, I mean, I, I do have a pretty thick skin about stuff like that. But it's more about if the tray has a design flaw. Uh, one, I don't want it to happen to somebody else. So I need to fix the design flaw if there is one there, which is what I am led to believe by her comments. However, I was not given the tray back to physically look at it to see what the de design flaw was. Uh, the photos that I received were... Um, not good along with the description other than the fact of it split and um I, I asked what part split and was given a very general reply and that was the first time 
And then apparently it happened again. I, Linda, I agree. Uh, I, I, guys, you, you guys are right. I, I mean, I'm, it, I'm in my headspace. Um, and and Nana, um, no, there is no way you can please everybody. I, I mean, there's just not. It's gonna happen, and I get that. Uh, thank you, Linda. I, I'm. I, it's the um, it's the thin one that has the little bitty plug. Um, so yeah, and and now the beast, this one here, I ran over it with my car. Okay, I I put this monster in the driveway and ran over it with my car. It is bulletproof. Okay, it. It, it is bulletproof. So, I mean, there is no, I mean, it, it you know, nothing. So, I, I, I don't know. I, I don't know. I, I literally just, I, you know, I don't know what else to say. It, it, it bugged me there for a couple of days. Um, um, thanks to you guys and your fabulousness, you know. Um, Ralph, I, I, I agree. Hi, Sandy. Welcome back. Ralph, I agree. Um, you know, and again, I can't, I'm not going to be able to make everybody happy. I, I, it was more or less, okay, if there's a design flaw, I need to know. And, and because I don't want it to repeat the problem. Um, now does... Okay, each filament in a tray prints different. There are no two prints the same. It can be the same filament. It can be the same design. Um, it can see, be the same everything. But 3D printing is so damned fickle, okay, that it, if you... If the weather is off by a degree, I can see a difference in the printing. Um, I can print one in this color and it be perfect and then turn around and print another one and it have 101 flaws to it and end up going in the garbage. Now, the bad thing about this is this takes nine hours hours to print is three three different sections okay this takes an hour and 15 minutes just to print the plug this takes about 45 minutes and the reason why is because it's flat and it's only eight layers this here takes seven eight seven and a half there about hours to print because of the buildup. Now, uh, so that's the only thing about that. Do I, I? I love this. This is my favorite. This is my end all be all favorite. Even though it did take, it does take a lot, lot longer than everything else to print. It is still my favorite. Um, as far as me trays to use, these are my favorite. I like these. I have no use for this. This is for people that have animals that get on their desk or small children or something like that. Um, did it cut her? Oh, no. No, Ralph, it, that I know of, she didn't say anything about it cutting her or anything like that. She just said that the tray split. Uh, so I, I don't know. Um, I'm not trying to be mean, but the fact, uh, dreamers craft corner, everybody almost, I, I, Linda is dreamers craft corner. Okay. So, uh, I call her Linda, but anyway, that's who I'm talking to. Um, Linda, uh, yeah, maybe, maybe, you know, I agree. Uh, I try not to think that way about people, and and I always give everybody the benefit of the doubt first. Um, 
But, uh, you know, hey, uh, are they that type of person out there? Yes. Is is this what she's doing? I, I don't know. Um, I can't honestly say. Trust your own knowledge in your product. Vonnie, I do. I do. I, I believe in my products 100%. I don't advertise. I don't have to. Um, you guys do it. You know, you guys are the ones that uh, are the reason I have the business I do is because you guys are the ones that are talking to your friends. Hey, look at what I got. Uh, you guys are the ones that are taking pictures and sharing, you know, on Facebook. So um, I have yet to advertise uh, other than to say this is what I've got. This is what I'm doing. Um, uh, YouTube videos, you know, I'll post it on my Facebook and Instagram. If I add something new to the store, I'll post it on Facebook and Instagram, but I'm not jumping up and down screaming from the rafters, you know, advertising. Um, bags and uh, Uh, Vonnie, if there was a design flaw, I agree because that is my number one seller is those thin, long trays with the lid and the plug. That is literally my number one sellers. And if there was a design flaw in it and I've been selling them for the past six months, somebody would have said something somewhere. Ralph, you leave my Miata alone. I will eat you over my car. Uh, a Miata is in a car running over, <laughs> run over it with hubby's truck. Uh, I, Ralph, I ran over it with my car. OCD baskets. Yeah, um, Ralph, you, yeah. I, Ralph and Kathy, Ralph and Kathy always order something from me. So I've always got an order going out from them guys. So I have this basket, non-OCD approved meaning that the tray had some kind of flaw to it when it was printing and it wasn't good enough to get uh, shipped to the customer. And Ralph goes, I'll take all the misfits. So usually I give him uh, all of my, my junky trays. It's got bubbles and, you know, uh, big old divots or whatever in them. Um, then, uh, yeah, that's why I, uh, I bought, um, oh, Linda, thank you so much. What a lovely compliment. Sweetie, I, I am one of the, I just want people to like the product. Okay. And, and, you know, be happy with that. If the product has an issue, then I need to go back to the drawing board and fix something. However, right this minute, I, I'm in between a rock and a hard place because I don't know what the problem is. Everybody is like, oh, it's great. Oh, it's fantastic. Oh, I love it. Love it. And I've got people that buy 10 of these at a time. And I, this is the first time that anybody's ever had a problem other than the plug. They, they don't like the plug because the plug's itty bitty. But the plug was designed that way to keep kids from being able to pull the plug out. Um, yeah, see, that's what I'm saying, Nana. Um, uh, I, I, you know, if I had extras, if I had time to print extras, I would literally give each and every one of you one of these trays to test, okay, and say, hey, put it through its paces. Tell me, you know, tell me what the problem is. But in six months, and it's my number one seller, and I've got people buying five and ten at a time, um... I, I don't know. Part of me wants to believe what you guys are saying, you know, and the other part of me is like, you know, um, spazzing out. 
I have a tendency to spaz out when people are not happy. Uh, Linda, you've got quite a, you and Ralph, y'all have quite a bit of my trays. Um, Nana, you got two of the beasts and the, the square tray. Honestly, this one right here, um, I, this one and the larger version, um, this is what I use. But then again, I, the, the babies don't get up on my desk. I have no, my children are grown. Uh, I don't have anything that gets bomb, bumped or knocked. Bailey J discount. Uh, sell them as seconds like Bailey J does. Sandra, I was thinking about that. I really was because I love Bailey J. I watch her. I, I want one of her uh, goodie boxes. I want one of her, her little... Uh, cards you know and one of her little pins and her washi tape and i want one of her books but oh my gosh she sells so fast um and, and i haven't been able to to get back to uh, this week i have not been able to get back to her store to see if she put more in or if she's you know done She's the other one that only opens her store for a little while and then she closes her store. So uh, if you guys know Bailey J's store and are, are looking at it and see that she's open, please, one, send me the link. Two, let me know, okay, um, in, in a Facebook message. And I'm going to tell you guys right now, you want to talk to me, uh, Facebook Messenger is the fastest and the, I am... I am. I have Facebook Messenger attached at the hip. Okay, it's on the phone. It's on in front of me here. And uh, Facebook Messenger, I get instantly. Whereas emails is kind of like I get to them when I can. Um, not to mention Facebook Messenger makes a sound. You have a Facebook message. Thank you. You trust Linda? Yeah. Uh, Ralph, again, yeah. Any made so seconds as well. Do they really? I I did not know. I watched one of Mini Maid's videos the other day. Oh my gosh, she is just a bundle of joy. Uh, that little girl is just the sweetest that I have ever seen. I mean, she is just, she is bubbles and sunshine. I mean, I was just, I was smiling at the end of her video. I mean, she's just so upbeat and happy. I, I am glad that she's doing as good as she is. Um but yeah, I, I I had heard so much about her trays. Everybody goes, you know, Muni made uh is is got good trays and the best of the best and you know what have you. So I found out she had a YouTube video and and I went and looked at her video. So, uh, Linda, I agree. I am rough with trays as well. And, and, you know, that's why I said, if I had the time to print extras, I would, I would print extras and, and you guys would be my, um, uh, oh, what do they call it? When, when you get a room full of people to test the product, um, I, 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 for, or I forgot what they call that. Um, Kenzie, you got Bailey J's washi tape? Oh, I'm jealous. It was too much. Discount price, I bought it, never figured out. Uh, Linda, I agree. I agree. Uh, you know, I mean, it doesn't hurt to ask. And Nana, that's me. I, I am Lucille Ball reincarnated, okay? Seriously. Uh, I'm one of those that'll have a cup of coffee in my hand. I've done tripped, saved the coffee, and, it you know, gone through. Yeah, I, I have serious. Uh, um, 
slapstick comedy between, you know, the coffee pot and trying to get a cup of coffee to my desk. Uh, yeah. Who? Ba Ralph linked to whose website? Bailey J? Oh, Kenzie. Hey, Sandra, you can adopt me and surprise me with Bailey J goodies too. Kenzie, is there enough for you want to you want a stepsister? See if we we can get mom to adopt me. Hmm. Okay, I don't know if I said this or not. Ralph, this was your week for questions. Uh, Ralph was supposed to have had a list of questions for us to answer tonight. I think Ralph kind of dropped the ball a little bit. Uh, bad Ralph. Uh, uh, also too, um, or was that last week? And if that was last week, I'm sorry, Ralph. Has the most truthful, honest reviews on things. Nana, I agree. Nana, uh, I, I, that is, I love Linda to death, man, for that very reason. I don't need somebody skinning and grinning in my face saying, oh, this is pretty, pretty kind. I love it. And then turn around behind my back and say, hey, this is the biggest load of crap I've got. I would rather somebody be honest with me because, again, I can't fix a problem if I don't know what the problem is. So I, I am, yeah, be bluntly honest with me. Yo, Nix, you need to fix this. Yo, Nix, you know, this sucks. Fix it. Um, that, again, that's why, you know, I, I love Linda for, you know, the stuff that she's got for me. Because if she likes it, she likes it. If she don't, she'll tell you about it. Mom said anytime. I need another sister. Yay, Kenzie! I'm adopted. Okay, where's my Bailey J? Uh, Christmas is coming. I want Bailey J. But yeah, I um, I went to I went to her website. I love watching her videos. Uh, um, and yes, we're bouncing. I apologize, guys. Um, we're talking about Bailey J. She is the artist that um done four or five Diamond Art Club paintings. She's a, she's the creator, the 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 artist that done the, the paintings. And she has a uh she's a gamer. Um I have not been able to find a hard dog on Twitch channel though. Um I don't know what she uses for her Twitch channel. And so if anybody knows, please message me with, with that info. Um, also to, um, yep, lost my train of thought there. Uh, anyway, yeah, I, I don't know if her store is still opened or not. I, I hope it is. I want to, I want to go and, I don't even know how, I know she's in Canada, uh, but I have no clue. I, I don't think she's very expensive. I, I'm trying to remember if she said how much she sells her books for, um, I didn't even know anything about like B grade as Bailey J puts it. Um, I didn't know they even had such a thing as B grade until I started watching her. And I'm like, girl, what is a B grade? And you think I have OCD? Oh my gosh. Bailey J is OCD to the 10th realm. Okay. She gives all of her stuff that, that, magnifying glass thorough inspection b grade b grade b grade and i'm like it had just this little bitty ding b grade and i'm like oh my goodness i thought i was bad you got oh you got pedal dancer 
Yeah, Kenji, I agree. I am I am obsessed with Bailey J as well. She's just a cutie. I just really like her. Well, Nana, you are uh, you, due to the fact that you have problems calling people out on social media. That means that you are not a keyboard ninja. And that is a positive thing. Okay. I mean, people hide behind keyboards and they say a lot of stuff. However, they don't realize that, you know, it's not hard to find where somebody lives. Until the seller has made things right. I, I, I agree. Uh, Nana, I agree. I, I try to be the same way. I I really, really do. And I commend you for that. I I, I think that that is a good way of, of being. I just, I don't get off on, uh, I have been on the internet way <laughs> Look, I've been on the internet before there was a stupid internet. And people have just gotten crazy in the past couple of years. They think that they can just spit out whatever they want and and do whatever they want without consequences. Well, it takes me all of three seconds to find somebody's address. And, you know... Um, Linda, Linda, I seen your video. Yeah, you, you kind of, you kind of didn't, um, you didn't cut them no slack. But um, apparently, you had been having issues with them for for a while. So that's totally understandable. Nana, I'm like you. You know, if I buy something, I bought two uh, diamond painting pens from. This little, uh, this little mom, what I call mom and pop store. And when I got them, they were not what I expected. Um, and I really, you know, did, I paid a nice healthy chunk for the, the two of them, but I just sit on them. I didn't say anything. The holes on the ends were drilled crooked. Um, I tried to get the hubby to fix it. Uh, he, you know, he tr he did the best he could. I just ended up, you know, um, second handing them, and to somebody else that that could possibly maybe either not care or do something about them. Um, because I couldn't, but then at the same time, the poor guy didn't even know that there was a problem. I didn't say anything. I just threw him in a desk and said, okay. Because, I mean, he he was like me, you know. Some people go, oh, well, you should have told him so he can benefit from the knowledge. I'm like, man, really? You know... My grandmother always said, if you can't say nothing nice, don't say anything at all. Well, in this case, she was very correct. You know, I, I wasn't happy with the pins, um, but it was no big deal. I wasn't going to sit here and start a war or, you know, drive this poor man crazy because of the fact that, you know, the pins were... I did not do my homework and buy the, you know, the correct stuff, the correct pen. And he was new to pen making. So he was trying to make a life just like I was. And I wasn't going to make his life any more harder than it already was uh, because his pens were not my cup of tea. Now, if I'd have paid $100 for a pen... Oh, yeah. But, I mean, I paid like 30 bucks. Uh, you know, so, I mean, I I was not going to, to, you know, make him have a bad day because 
of, of t what I call tiny minor stuff. Um, Nana, if you, uh, what did you order? Did you order one of these? Did, did uh, where's my trays? Oh, one minute. I got too many and the next minute I don't got enough. Okay. Get you took us over here. What did, Nana, what, did you order one of these? What did you order? This one is my catch-all right this minute. I ordered the long skinny one instead. Um... Again, if you, I, I don't have, um, I don't have Nix's notions information in front of me right this minute, so I do apologize. Uh, so I can't, uh, and due to the fact that I'm running a video, both of my screens, one has chat, the other one has the video on it, so I can't switch over right this minute, uh, to pull up any, uh, Nix's notions information. I bought the same putty and wax off of Etsy. Um, uh, Nana, uh, I agree. You know, uh, there are some things that, yeah, you, you know, like my grandma said, if you can't say something nice, don't say anything at all. So I'm a don't say anything at all person. And if I do, it, it, and and please don't push me. Please don't push me to the point of I'm boxed in a corner and you're making me say something because you're not going to like what I got to say. I have the long one. I love it. I'm using it now. Sandra, these are my favorite. I These are my go-tos. I've got them. Now, I like the green uh, the best. Because of the fact that it shows all the colors. The breezy blue is the same way. I do not have any issues with seeing uh, the light or the dark colors. So um, a lot of people will get a white tray. Me, personally, I have one. I don't use it. I did for a little while because I didn't have time to print me. A, a my neon green trays uh so finally i broke down and it's like i i took over i hijacked one of my printers and stuck neon green on it and spent the whole day printing stuff for me you okay nana you ordered two beast and one like the green one you were using okay this this short one um i will try to remember Nana, uh, forgive me if I don't. I'm asking for forgiveness in advance. If I don't, uh, if I have an extra, I'll stick it in, in your order. If I have an extra one of those trays, I'll toss it in for you. But again, uh, if I don't, please, please don't be upset with me. I, I you know, I didn't, that means I didn't have any extras. B grade as as uh um our our lovely little friend plum is a good color plum tasty is another one um i oh my goodness gracious i sell a truckload of that that plum tasty i like the yellow um yellow is a good one uh, my all time favorite as far as color wise is the mystic blue moon. That filament is just drop dead gorgeous. However, due to the fact that the filament is so dark, it, 
uh, you can't see dark drills in that tray. It means you have to have two trays, a lighter and a darker tray. And you use the dark tray for the light drills and you use the light tray for the dark, dark drills. Now with the green and with the breezy blue, those are our middle of the road colors. And you can get away with um, any color in, in those trays. Linda, you've got a fabulous, fabulous channel, and you got great subs too. Oh, Kenzie, you got the square tray? Yeah. Um, uh, Linda, I, I agree. You know, that's why I was, I was a little taken aback, uh, when I got your email. Remember when you, and I did that today. I sent the wrong person, the wrong email and she messaged me back. She goes, my name's not Linda. And I'm like, oh, Barbara, I'm so sorry. Uh, yeah, so I've done that before, but that's why I was taken back, you know, when I got your email and you were upset and then after i watched your video it made sense it's like ah okay she's upset at, at the guy that made a different tray but um you did try to try to work with him you know you gave him every opportunity you could Okay, I'm not trying to get another line down. I'm, I'm concentrating here. Oh, yeah, this is going to, this, this one here is going to fly through. If I have any time to work on this week, work on this, this week, it'll be done. If I have any time. To, to do this. This one will be knocked out quick. There's a, a ton of color blocking in, in, in this one here. Uh, oh, Bonnie, you leave him? Good night, Vaughn. You blew past mid like you some young chick or something. Oh, thank you, Vaughn, for being here with us. Good night, sweetheart. Have a lovely, lovely weekend. Oh, Linda, I all's good, baby. We got it. We got it. Uh, Linda, I, I seen what you got and it was, yeah, it, it was not good. Um, Kathy, hey, welcome back. Woohoo, Kathy's here. Uh, Linda, I agree. I, I seen your YouTube video that yeah, it, it was, I, I don't know what he did. Um, but it was not very appealing. Let me put it that way. All right, here we go. We're going for another line. Look at me go. Not to mention I got a great multi-placer on this pen. So I don't even know who made this multi. I don't even know where I got this multi-placer from, to be honest. 
but it has turned out to be one of the best. Uh, I want to get, I sent Kathy a, a set of those um, 13 multi-tips that they have. I need to get, only thing I bought is I didn't get a set for myself. So I need to get a set for myself. Cracked at the seams. Yeah. Now, see, with 3D printing, that is what happens nine times out of ten. Is the top layer does not, for some reason or another, even though it's going around and around in circles and laying that plastic, uh, the top layer does not uh, adhere to the bottom layer. Don't know why, but every now and then, I swear it's temperature sensitive and or it just goes, I'm having a headache and I'm not printing tonight. You know, one of them things. Um, because it just... It snaps like a twig, and you can hear it. For me, when I watch people's YouTube videos that are using a different tray that is, like, crazy thin, uh, it's like nails on a chalkboard for me. It's, it, I, I can just, I hear it. Because I print my trays really uh, thick. Because I just, you know, I want them to be, I, I... I'm the bull in the china shop. I need bulletproof. And if it's not bulletproof, if it's not going to make it past me, it's darn sure not going to make it past any other customer. So. Oh, uh, thank you, Linda. Doggone it, I was supposed to have gotten a goodie box today from, or I was supposed to get happy mail today from TJ, custom diamond painting pens, but TJ, I bought one of their surprise boxes, their mystery boxes, and it was supposed to have been here today according to tracking, so I don't know if my husband checked the mail. And this canvas smells good. Maybe it's a snuggle. I'm smelling like cookies or something. And I don't have any of those scentsy things in here. That's uh, one thing about ferrets. You have to be careful. Um, come to find out, there was a recall on, uh, you know, the oil that you plug into the, the little fan thing and then you plug it into the wall and it normally they're in the bathroom and they put out the smell well come to find out the stuff that was going into the air was uh had a problem and was giving people headaches and stuff and it was discontinued and pulled off the market and i'm like oh well i've only been having that in the bathroom for six months Where'd the troublemaker get off to? Ah, uh, Kathy, I have not seen or heard from the troublemaker in about 30 minutes. Uh, I uh, Maybe uh, he, he, he's still at work, right? You Both of you guys are at work. I'm sorry. I'm, I'm a little slow on the upkeep tonight on, on who's where. Um, you said you were on your way home. You was going to be home in 30 minutes. Um... I'm not sure where Troublemaker got to. Other than he goes, my ferret has fleas and he's been picking on me all night. Linda, Ralph is the Troublemaker. Kathy uh, in, is married to Ralph. So she was asking me if, if I'd seen or heard from Ralph. 
Oh, he's at home? Oh, he should be home now? Maybe he's making him something to eat. Guys are like that. As soon as they get home from work, they got it. They're, they're worse than kids getting home from school. They got to have something to eat. Where's Waldo? Yeah, instead of where's Waldo, where's Ralph? We done lost the Ralph. I'm at work until 7. Oh, 7 a.m. your time? Oh, my goodness. You're working the same shift that my hubby is working. Honestly, I I like midnight shift. So does he. It you don't have to deal with a whole lot of people to, uh, on the midnight shift. Right, I swear temperature must be dropping. I'll be right, be right back, guys. I gotta go bump my heater up. Yeah, I'm chilly. I'm back. I'm back. I'm back. Okay. Who was dancing on the tabletop tonight while I was gone? I had to go on my feet or are cold. So I went and got me a pair of socks. And these are my favorite socks. I love these socks with the fleece in them. Oh my goodness. I can live and die in these socks. They are so warm. And comfortable. I work 12 hours, 7 p.m. Oh, Kathy. I thought you did something like that because of your your hours. Um, what what department are you in, sweetie? Are you do you work in emergency? I don't know if, if nighttime in a, the emergency section would be good or not. <laughs> That'd be when you get all the the odd little peoples in. But I guess you can get odd little peoples any time of the day. Instead of worse, Waldo. Yeah. The CMA. Okay. We have an idiot in the house. All right. There's always got to be one idiot somewhere. Um, sorry, guys. Let me fix the idiot in the house. Yeah, sorry about that, guys. Again, there's always got to be one asshole somewhere. Give me a minute. I don't have... We've always had such a nice... A nice set of people. Uh, where'd you go?
Uh, I do have mods. Well, Kinsey, uh, Kinsey, I'm sorry. Th that's my bad. I'm, I'm fixing you right this minute. Um, okay, Kinsey, you've been fixed. That's my bad, sweetheart. Um, last week I was fiddling around with the buttons and, uh, I, I was trying to add your mom and ended up undoing you by mistake. So now you are redone. You're back in the game. Um, so yeah. Okay. Kathy, you were telling me ab ab about your job. You work 12 to seven in a hospital. Um, All right, Kenzie, there you go. You fixed, baby. And uh, the the CNA in the hospital, certified nursing assistant. Well, now if I got ouchies, I know who to get. I call Kathy. Kathy, I got an ouchie. You need more mods. Uh, thank you, Kenzie. And again, I'm so, 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 so sorry. I was button clicking last week and undid you uh, by mistake. The crazies come out at night. Nana, I agree. Oh, uh, you're in uh, the Neo? N Nero? Still, uh... I tell you one thing. My hat is off to you ladies, okay? Because my son, when he was born, had all kinds of issues. Um, and uh, uh, Nana, you changed your name. If you were, if I set you as a mod last week and you've got a new name this week, uh, I think that it kicks the mod thing out. I'm not positive, but I think it does. Uh, has anybody seen or heard from Jenny Rose? I wonder, I wonder, uh, I haven't seen Jenny Rose tonight. Right. Jenny was, Jenny was mod. There was you, there was Kenzie, and there was Jenny. She must be, hubby must be home. Normally she's here with us. But her, her honey must be home. Oh, wow. Uh, Nana, I tell you what, if she's coming here, She's most probably either, she's either going to Louisville or she's coming to, to Lexington where I'm at because we have the best of the best hospitals in, in the world. No joke. You, you stub your toe. All of the specialists are here. Um, you have the crazy stroke patients. Oh, I know my son was born two months premature and uh, he, his esophagus was not connected and uh, an hour after he was born had to have uh, emergency surgery. Uh, they called it a TE fistula, if that makes any sense to anybody out there. Um, and this was back in 1983. Uh, so what they did was they connected his esophagus to his stomach. Um, thank goodness, knock on wood, he outgrew it. He still has a little bit of problem now in his late thirties if he eats too fast, but uh, or doesn't chew his food good. 
but other than that, he is he is fantastic and fine. Uh, but oh my gosh, you guys in a NICU and and what have you, man, you took such such good care of him. Not to mention me. I literally slept on a couch in the in the waiting room outside the NICU for three weeks. And they made me so comfortable and they would bring me food and oh my gosh, because I, I wasn't leaving my son. I, I wasn't leaving. I was there. And back in 1983, they didn't have uh, places for you to stay and stuff like that. Now, you know, you, you camped out on a couch. Oh, Nana, uh, my again, I am so bad with names because every, if you think about it, uh, Instagram, a person's got a name one way, uh, Facebook, they got a name another way, you know, each platform, they've got a different name, which by the way, I'm Nick's Dark Sky everywhere. Uh, so it's hard for, it's, it's very, very hard uh, for me to keep tabs on who is who uh, from one platform to another. So, um, and then sometimes people change their names here on, on YouTube and go from one to another. Uh, so I, I, uh, I have a hard time keeping up with who is who. Um, so, yeah. Not to mention I'm just bad with names in general. California and mid Oregon. Oh my gosh, Sandra. Kinsey was in Nikki for nine days. Yeah. I, 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 oh man, my hat is off to those ladies. You hear me? They, they roll. They, they roll. They, they are the ones that saved my son's life. Yeah. The doctor did his thing, but I didn't see him after that. You know, the dude was gone. Um, so, uh, you know, it was up to the nurses that, that literally, you know, got him where, he, where he was. And when he was born, he weighed four pounds, three ounces. And when he, uh, had surgery, he dropped down to, uh, one pound, two ounces. And it was, it, you know, he, he was, I could, I, and I have small hands. He was so small, I could hold him in the palm of my hand. And I, I called him my little frog because, and maybe that's why frogs make me laugh, because when I would hold him on his stomach in the palm of my hand, his little butt looked like looked like a little frog butt. And I, I call him my, my frog. Um, so, yeah, I mean, those, oh, man, those ladies are the best. They they are the best. My hat is off to them ladies um, because they are, you know, they they really did. They they are the, one that's, the ones that saved his life. And I think it was every four hours uh, I would go in and feed him. I I literally had to go to school, to, to, to class to learn how to take care of my child uh, because he couldn't eat anything until he was like uh, four. Uh, if I'm remember, he's like 38 now, but uh, I, I think he was like four years old before he could eat solid food. And then it had to be like mush because uh, his esophagus was so tiny. Okay, I have unsweetened tea tonight, and I miss my... Oh, I need to clean the lid to my jar. Sorry about that. That looked rather nasty. Okay, let's get us our wipey here, and... Ooh, my apologies. 
clean the... It's the only bad thing about tea is that it stains everything. Kind of like coffee. And if you don't clean your coffee cup, uh, you end up with, with a coffee ring. Is your Dr. Pepper still in the sink? Yes, Sandy, my Dr. Pepper is still in the sink. Uh, I miss my Dr. Pepper. However, remind me not to do that again. That was that was not a a smart move on my part. Yeah, I, uh, Nana, I think that that's, you know, um, that's what they did to him or they did, they don't do it no more was they used to have to stretch it and they took this, it looked like a little garden hose and it was pink and, and would put it down his throat to stretch it out. That, and if he ate something, it got stuck. I would have to give him meat tenderizer and an eyedropper. Uh, and it would literally sit on top of whatever was stuck. And I had 24 hours to either get it up or get it down. And um, uh, Sandy, no, it's still in the sink. Uh, it, I just checked it a minute ago. Uh, thank you, Sandra. I miss my cherry vanilla Dr. Pepper. And believe it or not, I don't know what's going on with the industry, but Kroger and Walmart does not have cherry vanilla Dr. Pepper right this minute. They've got the regular Dr. Pepper, but they don't have the um, the cherry vanilla. So I am not sure what's going on. And I've been drinking cherry vanilla Dr. Pepper for the past... Oh, Lord, 10 years, 15 years now? Right now, uh, we're having a lot of issues with a lot of stuff. I got diamond paintings that are on a very slow boat from China. That And stupid me, on that Black Friday, I ended up buying one that was pre-ordered. I did not even look. Oh, poo-poo on me. I did not even look to see if any of the Harry Potters were pre-ordered. I just threw that sucker in my cart. You grew up working with you. No one works. Uh, uh, Sandra, I agree. I agree. I... Uh, well, in all honesty, if you think about it, okay, at one time it got to the way it got to the point where you had bosses with big heads. Oh, well, if you don't do what I say, guess what? You can be replaced. Well, you know, they're not so quick on the draw with that anymore, you know, threatening to replace people that don't do the jobs of five people. Um because now it's got it had gotten so bad that they had laid everybody off and then one person was expected to do the job of five people. Nana, I wish I could say I was. I was not. But uh, now, you know, um, nobody wants to work. So I, I, I don't know. I have to admit it's kind of weird. You know, that every place you go in this town has got help wanted in the window. Uh, and you got people that are not working. So, I, I don't know. I don't know. I'm not sure where we're going to end up going with this mess. Um...
Sorry, was concentrating here a second, trying to get my line straight. I wonder where Jenny Rose is at. Oh my gosh, I miss her. Maybe she's, maybe I, I'll have to, have to send her a message. Say, missing you, missing you. Oh, I heard a beep. One of my printers stopped. Oh, second printer stopped. Should be a third beep here shortly. And then I will go up my tack printers. Uh, there's the third beep. Now gas is going up. Sandra, I heard that. Uh, Nana, I, I guess I do get better payoffs from unemployment. I mean, I, I, I don't know. Oh gosh, don't get me to, don't get me to lie because I have no clue about none of that. Um, I just know that, you know, right this minute, I thought that it was because, well, it's like the, the trucks, um, they, couldn't sell the new trucks because they were waiting on a chip, a computer chip from China. Um, so they were backed up on that. Now it has nothing to do with the, uh, I guess, commodity itself. And it is everything to do with, there's not enough people to get st stuff off the boat. Now, correct me if I'm wrong. The, the docks and the shipping industry is union, right? I mean, how many old movies have we seen about dock workers and union and strikings and all this stuff? So usually they take care of you. You know, union takes care of their, their people, I, I guess. But I have not heard anything on the news about... Uh, you you know anybody striking? Nana turns to dance on. Nana's turn. Yep, Nana's dancing on the table. Nana's gonna dance. Woohoo! Um. So yeah, I, I I don't know about all that. Hmm. That is a good question though. Maybe they'll. But I agree. You work at a credit union and was um, checks adding up. <gasps> For real? How? Sandy, I agree. There's not enough truck drivers either. Uh. 5x what I made in a month. I how? I, I don't uh I like Flamenco, Sandra. Thank you. Uh yeah, Kinsey. I, I I I again maybe it's the lack of knowledge I have for that area, but um I I have heard many people say that is the reason why. But I never knew that they were making that kind of money on unemployment. I thought you only got like maybe one percent of what your job was uh, for unemployment. I, again, I don't understand unemployment. Wow, Sandy, really? How do I file for unemployment? Can I quit Nix's notions now? Huh. I wonder how that works if you're self-employed. Me. 
Nick, you're fired. Me, thank you. Can I file for unemployment now? That was a joke, guys. They're getting weekly bonuses with their checks. Oh, wow. Well, I mean, this can't go on forever, right? I mean, there's got to be a, a an end point somewhere. Wow. I've, I mean, I've been out of the industry as far as like going to a job and work. I've been out of the industry for, uh, out of that kind of industry for about 15 years now. I say that I am retired, but uh, you know, you, I'm sorry, when it comes to computers, you, you, there is no retiring with with the job that I do cuz you are 24/7 working if you're looking at a computer or you're touching a computer you're working have to do is work one day and their time starts over really oh, Sandra well does anybody know how long this is supposed to last i mean is this like a permanent thing I know that they did it because of COVID because people could not go to work because they were sick. But I thought that that was just a, uh, a temporary thing. I, I, I didn't know that that was like turning out to be a long-term thing. Oh my gosh, I am cold. Where is my blankie? I've got the heater turned on, too. Hmm. Got my Bon Jovi blankie. Okay, that's better. Uh, did you really? It was on the news the other day, and now we have one confirmed case of the new variant of virus. Doggone, Sandy. I, I heard whispers in the wind about there was another one, but I, I, I yeah, I, I hate to say this. Literally, I am not joking, you people. Uh, the last time that I was out of my house was to go to the doctor's office three months ago. I have a, a, a yearly planned uh, set up to go see my doctor every three months for, uh, checkups and stuff. And it, yeah, uh, I have to, I have another doctor's appointment on Tuesday. So it's literally been three months since I've been out of the house last. I, I, I have no clue. Are we still wearing masks? Are we not wearing masks? I, I have no idea what the protocol is in the general public nowadays. Oh, my goodness. Canceled all flights in and out of the United States. Man, we are becoming an island. Really? Oh, my gosh. I, I, you know, I don't know what is, is, um, yeah, this is, things are, are getting crazy. They are definitely getting crazy. Or let me rephrase that crazier. I don't think they'll ever shut down again. I don't think we can afford it. I don't know about you guys, but half of my town closed. They're they're gone.
So I don't I don't know. I don't know what you know. The bad thing about it, get this though. Last time I went to my doctor, my doctor's constantly yelling at me. You need to get the COVID shot. You need to get the COVID shot, right? Okay, I finally break down and go get that sucker against my will, but I got it. Uh, when I go back to the doctor last time, all 90% of his staff was home quarantined because they got COVID. Oh, I'm sorry, I wasn't supposed to say that word. Uh, they they got the the bug. And couldn't come to work. I looked at him. I was so mad. And it was like, dude, you, you know, you yelling at me to go get this done. And here your own people are, are home quarantined because, you know, they didn't, they didn't get this, this done. Really not have opened up. I, I, I'm saying, Linda, I mean, in all honesty, um, you know, I, uh, Sandra, that's what they're doing right this minute. I've been seeing commercials uh, saying that, you know, have the talk uh, if somebody does not have it, you know. Have the talk. If nothing else, drive them there yourself. I'm like, yo, dude. Oh, no, no. No, no. Not to mention now they want you to redo it. Uh-uh. You got my butt in that chair twice. There's not going to be a third time. I will become a glorified hermit. Amazon delivers. Stay says you're told to get vaccinated or get fired. Linda, I... That does not make any sense. You know, all those, uh, I have to agree with the nurses. You know, they were on the front lines. They were the last ones to be able to have the opportunity to get it. And now they're telling them that, you know, if they don't get it, they're going to fire them. So uh, that just does not make any sense. Not to mention, now I'm not pro or con. Okay, if you got it, great. If you don't got it, fine. You know, to each their own. I am a firm believer in everybody's free will. However, you know, don't don't force me into doing something, because I I will do it just to I will not do it just to spite you. But it, you know, I I don't think it's very fair. To tell people what they can they can do with their own bodies. City and state are told to get vaccinated. Or get, I mean, really, I I don't I don't know. I don't think it's it's very. I I um, I stay home. I stay home. I don't even cut them here because they were being told if they didn't get the shot, they were. They would be fired or companies will be fined per person. Sandy, I didn't know about the fine. Uh, Linda, I agree. It, it, you know, leave my choices alone. So, you know, uh, let me, give me the ability to make my own mind up on what I want to do. And there's no, there's no facts that it even cures or or prevents there is no there is no science or testing that that says that um it 100% works not to mention we have no clue what the uh, side effects are it was thrown together so fast that nobody has a clue uh, what the pros and the cons are. And, you know, so I, I don't know. Did it, did it work um, for what was going on at the time? 
I, I, who knows? Who, who knows? I think it was a band aid more than a cure. But again, I'm, I'm not in the medical field. I, I, I know what I'm being told. Um, and, you know, I, I'm not, and I try not to, I try not to be an idiot about things. Um, hospital here in town. I just haven't left the house. I mean, honestly, with Amazon delivers, they even deliver food. So Walmart delivers groceries. Everybody, Kroger delivers groceries. So everybody delivers. So uh, honestly, um, I I am on a self-imposed hermit. But at the same time, if I wanted to get out, there's nowhere to go. Everything is shut down uh, due to the fact that they couldn't. Um, they went out of business. Everything is gone. Sandra, we lost 800 people. They went to our hospital here in town. Oh, my goodness. And my body, my choice. Sandra, I agree. I agree. So that should be the... Sandy... Um, I'm with you on that one. See, now, Linda, that don't make no sense to me. It It's kind of, um, contradictory. Uh, you're... Now, if you have underlying illnesses and you get a common cold, oh yeah, you know it it it'll hurt you in a heartbeat. Um, I mean, it really will. You know, if you've got like a heart disease or high blood pressure or diabetes or any type of upper respiratory issues. And you get a common cold, well, that can take you out. So that's self explanatory right there. But as far as, you know, the rest of it, um, I, I don't, I don't know. Uh, Sandy, I hear you. Apparently, I was I was informed that we are not allowed to say that word on YouTube. Uh, I, I I was so I'm trying hard not to say the word. However, we're on what variation five now. Uh, I don't even I can't remember the name of the new one. Oh, I heard dings. I gotta go. I'm here. I am here. Uh, see. Hmm.
mirror. Hang on. Oh, poo. Facebook, you're being a pain in the butt. Yeah, apparently Facebook was having issues today. Not sure about all that, but honestly, I was sleeping all day. Okay, I'm here. I'm back. Sorry about that. Uh, oh, y'all writing books tonight. Vaccines and still got. Nana, Nana, did you really? Preventing it, no, 100%. I, I got it. Um, I, and honestly, the only reason my husband did that backwards psychology on me. Um, tell me it was because I got Sandy. I was, I'm glad you're, you're good. I was really worried about you, girl. Auto Nana and autocorrect. Um, yeah, I I was around uh, ladies in the quilting community that were older than me, and my husband come out with this. Well, you know, you don't want to ha be asymptomatic and not know that you have this, and then give it to somebody else, right? And then they end up dying. That would kill me. So, um, I put my big girl panties on and I, you know, didn't cry like a little girl. And well, I did cry on the first one. Second one, I didn't cry. Uh, and so I went and, and got it, you know, uh, and, and he was very right. And, but I did it to keep my friends safe at the time. I, I didn't, I didn't want it, but, but it had nothing to do with politics or anything else. It had everything to do with, I'm not a big fan of putting things into my body, especially if I don't know um, 1000% the pros and the cons, the positives and the negatives. Uh, and, and I felt as though there was not enough research, uh, done at the time. Uh, I, 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 again, to me, there wasn't enough research at the time and, but I did it anyway. Now, uh, my question is what is the repercussions going to be of this 20 years from now? I wasn't worried about tomorrow, the next day, or even next week. I was worried about what is going to pop up 20 years from now due to this, you know, um, but uh, it's done. It's over. Um, you know, so I, I now am I going to go back for a third one? I yeah, no, 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 no. They 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 got me twice. Not to mention I'm the biggest chicken of of pain. I would rather be a hermit. Um, now my husband, I think he went and got the booster. I'm not positive. Um, 
He was he said that he was going to. Um I I don't know, you know, uh at the time uh it was said that you only needed the twofer. Well now oops, we were wrong. Okay, you need a booster. And I was, uh, I'm like, okay, you know, why was this not done in the beginning? Uh, and, okay, in eight months, are y'all going to come out with a, oops, uh, you need another one again? So it's going to make four, and I'm, or, or next year, and it's like, oh, no, 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 no. We, we stop in this train in advance. I, I like my, uh, I am a very holistic uh, type person, you know, I, I would rather take zinc and vitamin E and vitamin A and all this good stuff uh, instead of putting hardcore pharmaceutical drugs into my body. Yeah, that is, I, I mean, granted, I... I don't like kale. I don't eat kale. I live on salads, but that's just me uh, because Zaxby's has my cherry vanilla Dr. Pepper. Uh, but yeah, uh, you know, um, I don't eat at McDonald's every night. But again, I'm I I, I don't know. I, I don't like McDonald's. But I, I I am not. Yeah, I am stuttering tonight. I'm hunting words. I just don't think there is enough research done. And if you drive past Walgreens, their sign is not big enough. Okay, no joke. Their sign is not big enough. Don't forget to get your flu shot. Don't forget to get your chicken pox shot. Don't forget to get your this shot and that shot. And it's like, oh, my Lord. Yeah, no. Uh, uh. More tests than that. Love salad. Linda, I, I am I've been on a Zaxby's uh chicken salad kick for about two months now. If I could stay away from their chicken nuggets, I'd be better. Um but yeah, I I I'm I prefer to drink my calories, as they say. Uh the large cherry vanilla Dr. Pepper does not help. You know, as far as calorie intake, let me put it that way. Uh, so not good for me. However, that's that's what I am doing and eating now. Tonight we had Sunny's barbecue, so that was that was pretty good. Probably we won't live for another time, Nana. Because all four of my grandkids over 18 got it and I'm fine, so I've got mine. Uh, Nana, you you are going to live longer than 20 years. But you got yours as the grandkids. I agree. I, I mean, there's many, many reasons why not to uh, or why to. Um, I'm just a big chicken of doctors. I'm not going to lie. And I really don't like putting stuff in my body that because I am more worried about 20 years from now than I am about next week or tomorrow. Um, because there's not enough research to tell me what the long term side effects are going to be. I am a firm believer that people have Alzheimer's right now because of something that they did in the 60s. Uh, there's too many people that all of a sudden started having Alzheimer's. And it's uh, it's kind of a 20-year a age gap, okay, give or take. Um, so, uh, you know, it's kind of like, okay, what, what were they doing in that? That what was everybody doing within that 20 year span um, that is causing everybody to get Alzheimer's now? 
uh, is my question. Now, I could be wrong, you know, and, and be talking out my butt, but uh, that is just something that's crossed my mind. And it's like, hmm, you know, uh, take a minute, take a pause and, and, and think about that. Alzheimer's scares me. That that's what scares me. Uh Nana, I have I have white white coat syndrome. 40% of my lung capacity. Linda, yeah, I agree with you. You you that was necessary for you. Kathy, uh, was, Izzy got up, got her some water and laid back down. She, she, she was fast and I didn't, I, I was not paying a first look of attention. Uh, I'm sorry, Kathy. I, the next one that gets up, I will stuff under them because I've, I've showed two tonight. My bio. Never did drugs. Linda, I agree. I agree. Um, I don't know. I, I, again, I'm, I'm talking out my butt tonight. This was just some stuff that popped into my head. And, you know, uh, and it has a lot of people are using it as a political platform. I don't do politics. Um, I, I don't even think of things because of that. Um, this is pretty much me and what I equate to is my common sense questions, you know, as a lay person, I believe is what they're, they're called. Okay, Sandy. Yeah. Get him off to work. Oh my God. Is that time already? All the summer's dementia seems worse than death because I take care of 40 years. So, Doc tells me that I bullet in my head. Uh, Linda, I agree. I, I, I'm right there with you on that. Um, my grandmother passed away from dementia, which is not Alzheimer's. It's it looks like it is kind of similar to it. Um, but yeah. That, that scares me. Man, I'm ready to dance on the table. Yep. Oh, uh, oh, crap. Nana, thank you. Yes, I did. I heard three beeps. Thank you for the reminder. Be right back, everybody. I got to go push a button. Oh, on trays.
I'm back. I'm back. I'm back. Sorry about that, guys. Uh, yeah, I had to go start new jobs on the 3D printers and take off what was printed and start new jobs. Okay. Uh, Woohoo! Nana dancing on the tabletop. Nana, check out your little icons. Nancy be dancing her little fanny off. Okay, wait a minute. I gotta catch up. Uh, lose anything in my mind. I, Nana, I agree on that one. I'd rather lose anything. I see you're back there. Uh, Kathy, are you talking to me or are you talking to your hubby? Uh, as for a. I mean, there are no middle grounds. They're either really sweet or really mean. Linda, I'm so sorry. And yes, you are very correct. Can you can you make the trays in purple? Sandy, yes. I, I have 17 colors to choose from. I got two different kinds of purple. Phew, I'm tired. <laughs> Yay, Nana! That was a fabulous dance. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Okay, just talked to Ginny Rose, and she is not feeling well, and that is the reason why she is not here with us tonight. Uh, sorry, I got to blow my nose. Uh, can you make the trays in purple? Yes, Ooh, I'm tired. It's getting light floats. Good night, Linda! Have a fabulous night, sweetie. Bye. Thank you for coming. Thank you for being here. Troublemaker. Uh, Linda, uh, uh, Kathy, I, I don't know where the troublemaker got off to. I have I have not seen him in about an hour plus now. Um, good night, Linda. Uh, yeah, Sandy, they're listed at Nix's Notions. You can, I, I got, uh, literally, uh, hit the drop down menu. I got 17 colors to choose from. Nana, you need a finger message. Okay. Uh,. Oh, did he, Kathy? Well, honey, as long as you know where he be, he be, I guess that's all that matters, right? Jenny Rose sends her highs to everybody and says um, she's sorry she's not there. She's she's uh, battling a serious migraine. Sandy, you are very welcome, darling. You are very welcome. Doing a few things. Ralph, totally get it. Speak of the devil. Kathy, uh, yeah, darling. Speak of the devil and they do appear. Especially if they're named Ralph. But uh, we love our Ralph. We have to love our Ralph. He's the only man in the room. We can't run off the only guy in the room. I 
said, this kit is going to be so doggone simple and easy. Wow. Okay, if I sit here and blow this out, this big of a chunk, and just the short amount of time that I've been sitting here talking with you guys, man, once I throw some focus on this, it is going to be breezed through. I will finish Christmas morning. I, I am not going to leave it hanging. It will get finished. Um, most probably next year, but I will totally start on it way early. Um, I'm going to do this, and then I'm going to go back and uh, finish on Mask of Love by Josephine Wall. I, I really like that one, and it's turning out so pretty. Whew, it was such a pain in the beginning, though, with all that confetti. But it is a drop-dead gorgeous piece. And if y'all are looking at the top of my head, I'm sorry. I have not done my hair this evening. Sorry, did not mean to get quiet on you guys. Was concentrating on this extra little line here. It's kind of hard to do that. Uh, okay. Uh, let's see. I got mine kitted up and ready to start. Cool. Okay, go away. How did that come up? Make it go away. Go away. Uh, poo. I have emojis and now they won't go away. Okay. Oh, there we go. I found the right button. That's how, that's how I lost Kenzie last week. Button clicking. Uh... Sandy, your hair is down to your butt. You sure you want to do that? Kitted up and ready to go. So, so, uh, Sandra, which one of you? Oh, you got Mask of Love kitted up and ready to go. I, I, had, I seen that and it was like, oh yeah. That was a drop dead gotta have. Okay, and, and I was... I was blowing through it. I was loving it. I really was. And the only reason why I set it to the side was to start on Christmas morning. Now, in all honesty, for the work that I've done uh, and the time that I had to put into it, I got pretty good ways in Christmas morning. It would not take much to blow through it and get it done. Uh, I just don't have the time. It's too big. So I, you know, I put crazy, crazy expectations on myself, which did not help. And it was like, you know, becoming a nightmare. And it was what I was, I was doing it to myself. And it was like, no, okay, I'm, I'm not going to do this. And, you know, um, if I do it, I want it to be done right, and I want it to be done with love, and, you know, you have 35 kids kitted up? Where do you store it? And why do you do that? I, okay, all right. Sandra, this is a legitimate question. Why? Why do you kid up so many kids? I would be scared to death of losing drills or knocking something over. I mean, they're okay in the box until you get ready to do them. 
So I guess my question is, why would you kid it up if you're not going to do them right away? And I'm not, I, I'm not being, I, I'm not picking on you or anything. I'm just asking. Yeah, I, I seen your storage. I, I remember, oh yeah, uh, matter of fact, that's where I got the bottles from because I was looking for your storage. You're a serial kidder upper. I could do that, but oh my good gravy, I got 101 kids in there, and uh, no joke, I, I've got almost 40 kids. My husband's going to kill me. I have got to get him out of the floor because he's he's looking at them too much, and he's going, you got more coming in the door? You ain't even done these yet. Um... No, my I'm sorry. I, my husband is not that way. My husband would never say anything about anything that I do. I have the best husband in the world. Uh, however, they are laying in the middle of my floor, and I need to get them up. CDO next OCD. <laughs> uh yes, my darling. Oh, okay. You honestly, you don't have to say anything else. I can totally relate. I got you. I totally understand what you are saying. And it is fun. It is a blast. So I I, I can understand the, the compulsiveness of it. The only reason why I haven't done those yet is because of you guys. And I didn't want to bust out your eardrums with, you know, with the, uh, because people um, wear earbuds and headphones. And I didn't want to bust out your your eardrums with rattling paper tonight. So I was like, okay, to do list when I I get off of here with you guys. But it is fun to get up. I mean, it really is. I, for me, though, oh, my goodness, I am so scared. I, I would be scared of, of losing it, if that makes any sense, or misplacing it. The one that, uh, the mask of love is sitting in there driving me nuts right this minute because it's, um, the, the drills are just sitting on the shelf in the box, Waiting for me to come back and finish. But it's been a long time since I've done a kit like this where you just blow through, you know, drills. Um, and small. You say I, I I really I have very very few small kits, but it is fun to do a small kit from time to time, you know. Because after a while, those big kits do get monotonous uh, because it takes so long. You don't you don't get the gratification as fast with a large kit as you do with with a small kit. Q kit kins you up too. There's a lot of people that hate kitting up. It don't bother me. Um I, I the my biggest thing is which bottle to use. I do like these because of the fact that it's very, very convenient. To just open the drawer, take out the bottle that you need, um, compared, you know, to having them in a Ziploc bag. That does not make any sense to me. I don't know how people work out of a Ziploc bag because uh, I, I guess, you know, and it's just me. Um, that, you know, if you don't have the bottles, then yeah, I, I understand. Um but I I don't um, I I am not a big uh, Ziploc bag person. The opening and closing and uh, you know that kind of that kind of stuff. 
with the bottles, uh, I I don't spill. I have spilled on the canvas, but I don't dump stuff in the floor. And I'm an accident waiting to happen. I I really am. So I when I see people. People will take a picture of their diamond paintings, right? They'll have their coffee sitting on the diamond painting. They've got their drills just in little boats everywhere. And I'm like, oh my gosh, that is an accident just waiting to happen. You know, uh, the horror stories flashing through my brain of, you know, of, of drills all over the floor. Um, and it's like, yeah, or coffee, you know, the cat jump up on the table and, and there goes your coffee all over the diamond painting. I don't know if that's fixable, to be honest. I don't know if, um, if that is fixable. Sandy, you are asking about, do the drills pop off? Uh, it, on cheaper kits, I'm going to say sometimes, yes, it can happen, but these are, I mean, they're, they're, uh, they're there. They're, I'm, I'm sitting here bending them and, you know, flopping all over the place. They're, they're not going nowhere. However, I do need washi tape. That is very, they did come out quite a ways on this one. So, and the reason why people use washi tape is for two reasons. Um, you have glue that comes out about an eighth of an inch uh, wider than the diamond painting itself. So they'll put washi tape around the outside. Uh, also, too, they'll they'll put washi tape on top of the uh, cellophane and grid it off. It helps people to be able to work a section at a time. Personally, me, um, I do big grids because when I craft, when I craft, I I craft like marathon crafts. Are the ferrets awake, Nana? Uh, I heard somebody. Okay, come here. Who's up? I see nobody. Who is up? Is he sleeping? Seed sleeping? Oh, come here. Come here, Timur. Come on. Come here. Seymour, come on. There we go. Come on. Say you were too late. Come see him, Mama. There we go. Oh, there's my little cheapy mouse. Okay, say hello to everybody. Say my name is, my name is Seymour. You gonna look up? You gonna look up? Oh, there we go, silly. There, there's everybody. There's everybody. Say hi, everybody. Say, my name is Timor. Say, I'm the love muffin. I'm the love muffin. See you, see you. Say, I'm, I'm the love muffin. Oh. Say, I love snuggling. Say, I just get up in Mama's chair and I, I snuggle. And as long as mama scratches something like an ear or a tummy, say, yeah, say, okay. See, here's the thing, though. Everybody wants to get on mama's desk and play with the, play with all the new toys. Yes. And that is a very bad thing. Yeah, and they chew on everything. If they can... Mm. Okay, I love you. Come in. Go back to bed. Oh, there we go. All right. Come on now. Go back. There you go. Oh, there. Yeah, they they chew on everything that they, they can get their teeth on. Um, I only, only have a problem with one, and that's, that's uh, easy. Not Izzy. I'm sorry, Ellie. Um, Ellie is notorious about uh, the ding dong. I swear she thinks she's a mountain goat. No joke. Um, 
she uh, she she can get anywhere. She jumps. She's yeah. Do y'all know what flying squirrels are? You know how they got the little flap under their arm and they 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 can they glide. They don't fly. Um. Anyway, they um. She's she just climbs everything. And the last solid white ferret that we had before her was identical. They they climbed, you know, she would be swinging from the top of the curtains or something like that. Um, so, yeah, Sandy, what is washi tape? Washi tape is... Washi tape is, it started out as a uh, Japanese made paper. It Think of freezer paper. In all honesty, that's all this is, is colored freezer paper. Okay. And what you do is people will lay it down on their canvases. Because you've got that extra little glue that's hanging out there, and it keeps um, it keeps it from getting dirty. But it is. It's like freezer paper. It's just got colors on it and stuff. And for me, I normally will, uh, if I would have done this canvas right, I would have already had this on there. Um, and that's all you do is, is like that. And you do it this way because of, again, there's that little bitty tiny line of glue. And you don't want the, um, you don't want the, the dog hair and dust and dirt and everything else. Now, uh, as far as this canvas goes, what we use washi tape for, I can get things out of the way here, because I just realized a little bit, very little bit is on camera. Sorry, people. Y'all have to tell me these things. Um, okay, did the camera get bumped or something? Okay, here we go. Okay. Here's your canvas, right? You take your washi tape and you grid off, grid off a section. Now this is on top of that plastic. See the, see, see the plastic? See where I've been working and I pull the plastic back? This is on top of that plastic. And then people will grid off in sections and only work on, on sections at a time. See, I would take my X-Acto knife and cut this plastic off right here, okay? Uh, and I would work on just this section. That would be the only part that was exposed was one, this little section here. And then you come over and you, now you do all this before you start diamond painting. However, I was late to the party tonight. I had full intentions on doing something else, but this ended up being what it was. And that is way too small. And see, if you don't do it right, it, it literally just peels right up. Sometimes you get bad washi tape. It don't stick at all. It's, it's freezer tape. You can use freezer tape and do the same thing. It's just washi tape's got this pretty little picture to it. I swear sometimes my house is haunted. There ain't a soul in this house but me. All five ferrets are sleeping. But I keep hearing stuff in the kitchen. But, okay, anyway, that's, that's washi tape. 
and it is uh it is colored butcher paper or or um masking tape thank you uh it's just colored masking tape is all it is but why she got its name from a japanese guy that that invented it and it's just a light form of uh masking tape or freezer paper tape uh, are the ferrets awake? What is the washi tape? Oh, how cute. Seymour is adorable. Yeah, Seymour is a love muffin. He's my little no love muffin. He loves to have his ears scratched and he would just lay in my lap forever and ever and ever. Do they chew cords? Oh, my Lord, Sandra, yes. If they can get their teeth around it and it's any kind of plastic, trust me, they will. It, it, it's demolished. It's gone. Um, is the tape reusable? Sandy, uh, no, not really. Uh, in all honesty, no. It's, by the time you're done with, with, you know, work in a section or what have you, uh, it really is not worth reusing. It's cheap. I, I got four of these on Amazon for like five dollars. Uh, is Ralph getting candy? Sandra, I think Ralph is getting candy. He went to go get candy and never come back. I think Ralph is still at work, though. Uh, no, he's home. Okay, Ralph's busy. Gotta be. He's most probably diamond painting. Um, back. Is the tape is okay? Uh, no. Uh, Sandy, so yeah, uh, Sandy, uh, again, it's it's a it's a flimsy kind of tape. It's used more or less for just gritting off and and keeping you from sticking your arm or your sleeve in sticky spots. Now, some people say that they you can use baby powder on the outsides, but you have to be extremely careful. Because if you use baby powder and the baby powder gets on the canvas, then guess what? You lose your sticky on the canvas, and that is not cool. Um, you want that. You do not want to pull this plastic piece up until you are ready. Until you are ready to work on it. Because this is what, this is extremely, it's like, uh, it's like shelf paper or tacky paper. It's very, very, very sticky. Um, so, yeah. Now, honestly, see, due to the fact that I got the washi tape on there, if it's the bigger canvas, like Christmas morning, I would have just cut this and, and took it out of the way. I would have just come down like this and went over and just removed this whole section. Um, but you just kind of roll it back and you put your drills down. Like what you've been watching me do tonight. I love my frog. I love my frog. I got a, I bought a squirrel. I bought a squirrel. I've, I am always having squirrel moments. Oh, shiny squirrel. I am always having squirrel moments. So Debbie at uh, Debbie's day had had a fabulous squirrel and it was just like, okay, that fits. That is so me. So I bought a squirrel. I still, my frogs are the best though. Oh, don't forget to check out the uh, YouTube video for Felicia. That is uh, Craftabilities diamond painting. And they are, um, Oh, Nana at the Dollar Tree. Yes. I have not seen any at my Dollar Tree. Uh, da -da -da, Hobby Lobby. Uh, Sandy, if you go to a store and buy it, it's expensive. You're talking $5 for one roll. Um, I get uh, 60 rolls. It's what I put in my goodie bags for my customers. I get 60 rolls for, I'd have to look, I'm going to say nine, not in between nine to $12 for 60 rolls. There's not as much on each roll. Now this here was a steal because I got four of these 
for uh, five bucks on Amazon. Now, again, you go to Hobby Lobby, Joann's, Michael's, you're paying eight to 12 bucks for, the, for, for that. All right, that's what I paid the last time I was there, and it, it regretted it. Very, very, very much so regretted it. Because it's a consumable item, and to pay 15 bucks for washi tape is a joke. Uh, Walmart, Amazon, but yes, it's available at Joann's. Um, yeah, Walmart's pretty cheap on it. Dollar General, Dollar Tree. I have not got any from the Dollar General or the Dollar Tree. Okay, to get some calendars. Uh, yeah, Sandy, it's in the, it's, um, you can get it in the, uh, oh. Sorry, guys. You can get it in the calendar date book planner section, or you can get it in the scrapbooking section. And if you're at Hobby Lobby, there's another section, which is uh, arts and crafts. Paper hospital tape. That works. The paper hospital tape works. Any kind of tape will work, it, you know, as long as you can, um, as long as you can remove it off of the canvas. It's painter's tape, okay? Seriously, it's painter's tape. That's all it is. If you got a roll of painter's tape laying around, that works as well. Everybody just goes to the washi tape due to the fact that it's all cutesy cutesy and stuff. Yeah, Sandra, I I have not been to my dollar, um, I haven't been to dollar store in over a year, and I haven't been to Dollar Tree in eight months, nine months, something like that, so uh, yeah, I, I haven't, I don't know if ours has got it or not, I pretty much get everything through Amazon though, I, 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 I go to Amazon for everything. It's habit. Bad habit, but it's a habit. Okay. There's my whites. That's King Charles. There's my pen. Uh, and I have... See, see this, this, this right here is, is giving my brain a heart attack. Okay. Because these were supposed to have been put in bottles already and they are not. And I'm like, they're hanging out in left field and you do not start. Okay. This is me and my two cents. I do not start a diamond painting until every drill is out of every bag and into a container that is marked with some with the uh, symbol on the top. So yeah, this right what I'm doing now is like royally backwards than the way it's supposed to be done. Um, because I, I, I am finding bags of, of, uh, drills everywhere. And that is, that is not cool for the OCD brain. Okay, let's see it. Try it. It works. Uh, yeah. I used uh, painter's tape in the very beginning. It worked perfect. Nano tape. Oh, my God. Yeah. Uh, it's, you know, any tape that you got to do good. It, it's just that washi tape is a cutesy little thing, and it comes from the scrapbooking. I never got into scrapbooking.
Okay, guys. Uh, we have crickets. Somebody's got to rescue something here going on. I've run out of stuff to talk about. Let's see. Hmm. What is there to talk about? Just a hint, glitter washi is cheap. It doesn't work. Nana, I agree. Uh, I got a load of bad washi there one time. Supposed to. Sandra, I thought Ralph was supposed to bring the questions. I don't know what Ralph is doing. I don't know. We lost the Ralph. Last date night with hubby. Oh, Ralph, y'all went to go see Jeff Dunham. I, I, I bet you that was a blast. Sections tonight. Thanks for keeping me company, everybody. Ah, oh, Nana, you're very welcome. Are you leaving us? Ended up making my own paper dolls. Sandy, I agree. I, 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 yeah, no, I don't do scrapbooking at all. Not us, me. Yeah, Ralph, I'm in desperate need of date night with my hubby. I, I am definitely in desperate need. We have not done that in months. Bye, Nina. Bye, Nana. Bye. Thank you for stopping by. Really, seriously, thank you for stopping by. Same time, same channel, same place next Saturday night. Christmas party. Door prizes, giveaways, all kinds of goodies. So, uh, yeah. Christmas party next Saturday night. Yeah, Ralph was supposed to have brought questions, but I think Ralph's been busy this week. Oh, you're not leaving. Oh, you just quit diamond painting. Oh, yay, great. Well, uh, Nana, I'm glad you decided to stay. No joke. Uh, we do not have, or let me rephrase this. I do not have a limit, a time limit on my whipping chats. I am the first one in the door, and I'm the last one out the door. So when everybody goes, hey, I have to go, it's time for bed, or i got to go to work, or i got to do this, or i got to do that, uh, I am here till the last person leaves. And when there's only two of us left, that's when I say goodnight and end uh, the live stream. See, first two two nights went to seven and a half hours. Last week, I think, was five and a half or six and a half hours. So we are here until um, there's only two of us left. And I think last week it was me and Ralph. One question. Can you use tacky glue to make your own? No. Uh, no, Sandy. It don't work that way. Uh, some, um, the, yeah, no, the, uh, tacky, if you did little, okay, if you, Sandy, if you did, like, little postage stamp, stamp size glue areas with the tacky glue, uh, yeah, you could do that. Okay, but again, remember, you're only doing little li li little postage size areas at one time. Uh, I, I, again, now, if you're doing a big, uh, Sandy, if you're doing a big, huge diamond painting like this, you, no, you don't, you don't want to use tacky glue for something like that. Oh, my goodness, that'd be a pain in the butt. Uh, nope. You beat me tonight, yeah. Ah, uh, Ralph, you tried opening the door, but the door was locked. Oh, man. 
Nana, I agree. Uh, trust me, I pay at least three employees a week at Amazon for with as much stuff as I buy from them. Diamond Up makes glues for diamond painting. Sandra, you are very correct. However, uh, the Diamond Up glue is just a thicker form of Elmer's glue. Peel and sticks. No. Um... Is Sandy, if you, oh, okay, say, take one of your books, right? If you wanted to take these drills and embellish something with rhinestones or these drills or what have you, yes, that will work, okay? Uh, if you are embellishing something, then yes, that, that will work, and you can use the tacky glue and and uh what have you uh and that would work perfectly fine however due to the fact that this canvas is so flexible okay and bends and folds and what have you you have to have a glue that is going when it's dry it will flex now the difference between regular glue and a tacky glue that is four diamond paintings is that the Elmer's glue, if you think about it, when it dries, it flakes because it dries to, uh, it, it's not flexible. Uh, it will crack. It'll break in half. Uh, the tacky glue for diamond paintings has a rubber in it. So uh, it has a consistency of, of rubber when it's dry. It'll bend. It'll flex. It's, it's, it's um, like what they add to acrylic paint. And it helps it uh, bend and move. Uh, so as long as it, it doesn't dry to a hard form, uh, it, it'll work. But if you have something like a box, a jewelry box, or, or a... Uh, uh, the back of a hand mirror or something like this that you're wanting to embellish, then yeah, you it, you know Elmer's glue will work perfectly fine. Let's make this yeah. Um, and stop down painting the kid up. My OCD brain can't. Stay. <laughs> Uh, no, the, yeah, this, 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 this over here in, in this, this corner right here. Yeah, I'm, I'm trying really hard not to look at it because uh, it's like, it's supposed to be in a jar and it's not. And don't lose it and don't breathe on it and don't blink because something will go missing. Yay! Kathy's off next weekend. She will be here for the party. Serious, guys, I have door prizes hourly. Not every hour, mind you. Uh, and there will be a grand prize and a goodie box and surprise box and whatever I have time and or can think of to do. You guys are welcome to participate. If you have something that you would like to uh, give away or run a door prize on, uh, what I plan on doing is having uh, my lovely uh, secretary and or either my secretary's mother uh, write down everybody's names for me. And uh, we are going to kind of do things, uh, you know, kind of kind of fishbowl style. Um, hopefully, I will have enough goodies that by the end of the night and everybody that's here to participate uh, will end up with some kind of goodie whatsoever uh, of some kind. You're not working. Nah, I'm sorry. Yeah, internet has been flaky. Oh, Ralph, that's right. You're home. You're just diamond painting. Ralph's quiet tonight. He's diamond painting. He's concentrating. Uh, yeah, Sandy. That, that, that'll work. 
Can you give Kinsey away? Sandra, I think that's against the law. Kenzie, um, baby, you wanted to be my secretary. I was the first one to tell you that there's nothing secretarial, for, you know. I'm sorry you're bored, my darling. But, yeah, uh, 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 again, if you're here, um, I, I, I call you my secretary, but then to be totally truthful about it, there's really not much secretarian to do. She's over 21. Well, Sandra, if she's over 21, I don't think you can give her away. She's You, you just have to kind of just shoo her away. You know, like, go away. Fly, little bird. Go find your own life. Get the hell out of the house and change the locks as soon as she walks out the door. Yeah, I kind of did that. Love you. Bye. Go get a job. Go get your own apartment. Love you. Bye. Get out. But I had a boy. So it was a independent life lesson, I guess you could say. Yo, dude, go get a job. Get out. As they say, I served my time. Oh, God, I am cold tonight. I can't get warm. I don't know why. It doesn't look, usually when I can't get warm, it's rainy and yucky outside, but it don't look like that. This is what I worry about. Now, if I did editing, okay, I, I'm sure I could edit out the silent moment parts. Um, fill the ferret, ferrets on, pile the ferrets on. Yeah, that would, it, oh, that would be a mess. Oh, that would be a big mess. Okay, I rebooted my tablet, and I guess it don't want me to listen to you anymore. Oh, Nana. Uh, cell phone? Do you have the app installed on your cell phone for YouTube? No, no. Do you have the? Uh, sorry, bad Robin Williams joke. No, no. Do you have the? Uh, I don't know how to. Uh, I was trying to. I used to know how to sign language. I don't know more. Hurry back, Nana. We will miss you. Um. Yeah. Okay, guys. There was. There has been at least five updates and upgrades to your software in the past uh, three, four days. So yeah. Uh, restart your phones. Uh, check your Google. Uh, make sure Google is updated. Uh, restart your computers. Uh, that kind of stuff. Make sure your stuff's upgraded. Uh, Sandra, you're supposed to restart your phone at least once a week, if not twice a week. And do the reason is because sometimes there are software patches that get hung up in the system. And you have to restart for it to, to go ahead and, and finish downloading and patching itself. Oh my gosh, Nana. How old is your granddaughter? Sandy, even though they're automatic, you still have to restart your computer for them. You still have to restart your devices for them to go ahead and complete the install. It, uh, yes, I understand automatic, uh, but again, if you don't restart, it's hung up in the system and will not finish or completely, uh, install what it needs to until you restart. Yay, Nana is better now. Yes, my phone is dead. I'm so sorry. I keep mine plugged in, but then again, I don't go nowhere.
Is that an easy? Okay. Here we go. Izzy is making an appearance. Now, Izzy looks like Seymour, except for in the face. Hi. My name is Izzy. Hi. Here. There. Look. Hi. My name is Izzy. Hi. My name is Izzy. I'm Izzy. Oh. The Izzy girl. The Izzy girl. I know. I know. See, there you go. You want to go. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Ferrets on a desk is not a good thing. Oh, my goodness. And they spaz. They get spazzed out. They they got to smell everything. Okay. The, the, the drills do not need your whiskers in them. No. The drills do not need whiskers. They, they do. They smell everything. They're worse than a bloodhound. Huh. Yes. They're worse than a bloodhound. Huh, yes, I know. Oh, my goodness. Oh, my goodness. You're you're getting a following. Do you know that? You're, you're getting a following. That's easy. All right, here. There. See? Okay. This is such a major no-no. Yes, we're not supposed to be on. Oh, there we go. Are you going to look up? There we go. There it is. There it is. I'm trying to get you on camera, dude. Okay. All right. Down we go. There we go. Okay. Y'all have been introduced to the Isabel. Now, you do know she's going to climb me for the next 10 minutes trying to get back onto the top of this table because this is where all the toys and the goodies were at. Huh. Aren't you? Yep. Come on. Come on. Oh, come here. Come on. Easy. Come here. Okay. There we go. Come on. Up. Oh. Come on. Okay. There. All right. Now, if you'll stay in the back of my chair, you can sit in the back. There you go. You can sit in the back. Mm-hmm. There you go. Sid will get sit in the back of my chair and, and literally curl up and go to sleep. You're not gonna do that, are you? No. You wanna you wanna be up here on the table in the middle of my drills and you know, yeah. And now you're gonna bite me. Why are you biting me? You're biting the mama. You wanna play, don't you? You bite ow. You bite the mama. Ow. They play bite. Uh, about like a puppy. Courtney. Good morning, Courtney. Hi. Welcome, welcome. Come on in. Join the party. Thank you, Nana. Um... Uh, Nana, that's about the best thing to do. Izzy is the soft... Well, I don't know. Har and Ellie. Oh, you rotten mouse. Yes, you are. Okay, okay. All right. You go to bed. It's time for all Mises to go to bed. Nope. I'm done. You're out of my chair. Nope. You are done. That's it, little girl. Um... Uh, I try not to put them up here that much because they get obsessed and they they are like an elephant. They do not forget. Really, they they do not forget. Um uh, they will go back and go back and go back for weeks trying to get back into a spot. So, uh I very very rarely do I let them up on my desk. And the only reason why was because you guys wanted to see them. But, it, yeah, she will spend the next two weeks trying to get up on this desk. That's how come I had to get rid of my office desk that I had and go with uh, with the table, uh, this type of crafting table. Uh, is because they were trying to, they were digging it like crazy trying to get up on top of it.
So, how you doing tonight, Courtney? What you working on? Did you get any of the Diamond Art Club back Black Friday's uh, sales? So yeah, I uh, I got some Debbie Day goodies coming in from uh, Day's Dream. I figured we'd have a a little Christmas party kind of thing, cause in all honesty, I'm trying uh, to take a week off. I don't know if I'm gonna be able to do that or not. I am trying to wiggle it to where I um I'm just taking a week off of of Nix's notions so um I can just have a little downtime so I figured that what is okay next this is the fifth uh, 5th. No, well, yeah, it's the 5th now, it's Sunday. The 11th. Okay. Next week is going to be the 19th, and the following Saturday is going to be Christmas Day. So, um, I might go live Christmas Day, to be totally honest. I'm not quite sure. Christmas falls on a Saturday this year. Woo! That works. Uh, working on festive times by Puffy Gator. Distracted by diamonds. That's a, I've I've heard of them. I, I haven't gotten anything from them yet. I ended up getting four paintings for Black Friday, and I got the Harry Potter release today too. So yeah, couldn't help myself. Courtney, I don't blame you. I I I, I couldn't help myself either. Trust me, girl. I, I, I'm the 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 addiction is real. Sandra, you got nine. Oh my lord! I was so happy that it was like thank you, thank you to the cosmic universe because uh, I did not like a lot of the Black Friday stuff that they released. And I ended up getting getting four. I want the monkey. I like the monkey. But he was out of stock. And it was like, oh, thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Uh, I will buy the monkey when the monkey is in stock. So um, I will just keep an eye on. Usually they restock on Wednesdays. Um, or that's what I've noticed is a lot of their stuff that's sold out or is on back order, they will post it to the website on Wednesday. And I got two good morning. Did you really get two of the good morning Americas? Oh, how cool is that? Well, they were 50% off. Yeah. And free shipping. Nana, that was a serious deal, okay? If I would have known about Good Morning America, trust me, I would have been there. But I think I already had everything. Uh, now, I for today, there was no shopping today. No joke. I, I did not even slow down. I was like the flash. I got that email. I was already logged in, ready and waiting. Threw that sucker in my cart and paid for it ASAP. There was no shopping. There was no nothing. And I flew to the checkout. And that was that. 
I did stop to see how much it cost, but after the fact. Because normally the size that I got, the one with the peonies, um, that was normally a $59 diamond painting. Uh, I don't know if Diamond Art Club had to pay any extra fees because it was a licensed uh, artwork. But it was awful high. And the, the one of the Harry Potter poster, that one was like $89. That was $90 for that. It's like, holy cow. And honestly, I didn't like it. I didn't like it. I didn't like the, the poster one. The eyes were off. The eyes were off on it. Oh. Uh, which Harry Potter did you get? I got the... I got the crest. I... Yeah, I got... I got the crest one. Kathy? Oh, well... Or, uh, the Harry Potter poster one, so I know is it, it. Oh, yeah, the Harry Potter the poster one that is uh, the same size as the Christmas morning. Uh yeah, I I was not interested, and in, I'm not a Harry Potter fan. Honestly, the only reason why I bought the stupid kit was because it had the new um uh it had the new toolkit in it. So, yeah, I pretty much paid $70 for a new toolkit. I hope that they decide to do it with the rest of their diamond paintings. Um, the only thing about it is I don't know whether to leave it in a box as because it's a collector's item. This is where the brain gets fuzzy. I don't know what to do with those. I would I, I buy diamond paintings to do them. It really will be pretty with the colors once it's done. It's got my my favorite colors in it, the purples and the, uh, the pinks and stuff like that. So, um... I don't know. I don't know whether to, to leave it sealed, you know, um, and resell it if value goes up or to just say poo poo on it and use it for what it's intended for. Uh, my Facebook group. Because with the pink and white tweezers. Movie. Um. Yeah. I, I again. I Courtney. I'm not yet. I love the new. To okay. I'm loving the new toolkit. I saw on Facebook group as they are slowly releasing them into the new kits. But the pink and white tweezers will be black instead. Uh, Courtney. Where did you who? Where did you see that at? And why? So the pink and black. So the pink. Uh, tweezers are are specifically for the Harry Potter kit, then, right? Uh oh, I didn't buy anything. Then I did not have intentions on buying anything, but then when I seen a new kit, uh, I literally. Spent seventy dollars for a new kit, which is stupid. I know. Market for an undone diamond painting kit. Ralph, I was thinking about that too, because once they're you, they're done, you can turn around and sell them. I guess. Somebody asked me about that one time, um, selling diamond paintings. I didn't even know people did that. I guess you could. I don't see why not.
I would have no clue what it was, what it would be worth, though, to turn around and sell a diamond painting. That I a completed diamond painting. Let me put it that way. But no stickers. Uh, I did download uh, the two files that was on the, the crest one. And I agree with the stickers. I don't, I don't know what I'm going to do about that other than, I guess, tape them. Well, I have extra labels. Um, you know, leftover labels from the other kits. And if you have one of those Zion sticker makers, that'll work. With Dunn Painting Pro USA there. If it, uh, Sandy, I am, when it comes to my diamond paintings, um, I am very, very finicky about what diamond paintings that I have. Um, I, have, I pretty much buy USA only, meaning the company is based in the United States and ships from the United States. Uh, also you have the companies, uh, you have to be careful cause they sell licensed artwork. They steal artwork from, uh, artists and will make a diamond painting out of it and sell it and make a profit and not pay the artist. So, um, Sandy is, it, uh, I do, you've got all these new diamond painting companies popping up like crazy. So uh, everybody's getting on the the bandwagon for that. So, but the the Diamond Painting Pro USA, uh, I have not not heard of them for the princess paintings on eBay. For uh, Nana, were they completed or still in a box? I've seen four of the princess paintings on eBay selling for $1,500 each. <gasps> wow. Hey, Ralph, there you go. Go do some research and see if, if, if Harry Potter is selling uh, on, on uh, eBay. And if Etsy doesn't stop slitting my veins with... Stupid fees, I'm gonna end up having to get off of Etsy. Between the buy me a coffee people that I have, thank goodness, I only had three subscribers. Okay, to my buy me a coffee. Bless them, it's Jim, it's Michelle, and Joy. Uh, I get an email from the buy me a coffee people saying we no longer accept PayPal payments because they would not agree to our terms and our fees. Uh, so apparently they had a fallen out. So, um, poor little Michelle goes, I'm trying to pay you, but you know, there it's not accepting it. So I had to jump through 99 yards of, of stuff to get the, buy me the coffee set back up. Uh, I, I don't know how it, it's going to work because now it's saying that you can't use PayPal. Well, everybody and their mama uses PayPal. I do have a Discord, but it's huge. Discord is huge and it's so overkill um, that, you know, I, I, I have an account with them. I just haven't turned it on. It is just, it makes my brain hurt to look at it. It's so overkill. Um, Sandra, the sneaky cat you seen on, on eBay, was it completed or still in a box? Nana, still in a box. Wow. See, that's what I was asking about the Harry Potter. Do I need to leave it still sealed in a box and turn around and sell it on eBay? Or should I I just say poo-poo on it and open it up and do my own thing with it? I am not a collector's item person kind of thing. I wouldn't even know where to start. 
I wish I, I, I kind of knew how, you know, because I got 99 yards of garbage, but it becomes an aggravation for me. It's like, ah, here, give it to somebody. You can have it. I'm done. And I haven't turned eBay on in years. But no, what I was telling you about the, the buy me the coffee, though, I doubt seriously if they're going to be, um, if they're going to be around for long because they just dumped PayPal. Well, a lot of people, I, I don't know, I could be wrong about this, but a lot of people use PayPal for everything. I know I do. And if they don't accept PayPal, normally I don't buy from the company. Uh, no completed. Check Facebook. Wow. Well, I guess I could do Harry Potter. Complete it. Sell it on eBay. And keep the, keep the toolkit. Hey, Ralph, look at that. I got a big old chunk done. Bigger than a postage stamp. I think last week I only managed to get a postage stamp done. And I've got a stupid river here that won't go away. Oh, well, by the time I put the rolly pin on it and let the glue dry, all of those will literally suck together. Check Facebook. Ralph, I forgot what I was checking Facebook for. Having a market on it. Huh. Kathy, you don't use pay you don't use PayPal? Right does use well, I mean you got Apple Pay. Apple Pay is the same thing as PayPal. Saw nothing over fifty-five. Wow. Thank you, Ralph. Thank you for checking. Uh, Nana, yeah, um, that is where the money comes in is when you start destashing and you can, I, I don't, I don't know. And I, I see, this is my weak side. I don't know enough about it that what a, a discontinued DAC would sell for. Yeah. Everybody attack Nana. She's destashing. What do you got? What do you got? I pretty much got everything that I've I've won. I mean, I've been diamond painting since April. Um, I haven't really seen anything. My uh, cooking with magic finally come in. So that was the only one that I had missed that I didn't have. Do you have minion love? Sandra, yes. Minion love. I don't know why they don't have more minions. What happened to the minions? Nana, uh, I have to agree. I'm kind of like you. It, you name it. I pretty much got it, especially if DAC released it in the past year. Dominion Love. Sandra, have you checked eBay and all them places? Somebody's got to have Minion Love. Okay. Uh... Let's put Google to work. Diamond painting. Etsy. Paint by diamonds. Got minions. Paint by diamonds. Got minions. 
diamond painting. Oh, minion love. Okay, that's minions in a boat. Sandra, is it minions in a boat? I just did a Google on it, and uh, the pictures are showing me as minions in a boat. Ralph, I agree. Um, okay, so it's minions in a boat. Uh, who did the unboxing? Add more zest. Well, it was December 2020. That's only been one year. Uh, somebody's got to have it. Diamond painting whips and waffle minion love. The uncrafty crafter did an unboxing on it. Cross stitch group kit. Uh five seventeen twenty twenty minion love diamond art club mini. Okay, lady with the uh, somebody was de-stashing it right here. It was on eBay on April, um, uh, do, 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 for sale here. Okay, it was, somebody was de-stashing it. It was for sale, uh, limited edition, discontinued kid, Disney, min oh, well, no wonder it's Disney. Uh, 5D, hang on, I'm looking. If it's here, I'll find it. But I am sure she already sell, sold that. Minion Love is taller than me. Minion Love diamond painting. Christmas diamond painting. Pinterest. Uba.co. Huh. Uh. Lock. Well, you got some of these sketchy places, Sandra. Uh, I I don't know. You got some. You got Uba. Uh, has it. it and it's available order now and get by Friday December the 17th says it's in stock now I have here I'll share the link I have no clue who this company is and or um, okay you stupid, you're not going to let me share a link? No. Uh, hmm. Okay. Do you see the link, Sander? Oh, I can 100% guarantee you it's stolen. Okay. Uh, uh, remove. Okay. Unpin. Okay. There we go. Oh, I, I, again, Sandra, I can guarantee is 100% stolen. But at the same, well, no, is honestly, I'm sitting here looking at a DAC box. And it's Minion Love, DAC, um, in, a, in a DAC box. Now, I don't know who this you buy is or what where it's from. 
and it looks kind of like an uh, like a auction thing. But it's you, boss. Says it's available and it's in stock, and it would be delivered by the December the seventeenth. It was one of the. Yeah, it was in the Google search. It was in the top five. So, I don't know. I will keep an eye out for it now that I know what it looks like. But I don't think it was stolen artwork uh, as far as a, a reproduction. I don't think it was that. Uh, I think somebody just had the kit and they're de-stashing it. However, I will keep an eye out for it. Um, and if I see it, I will let you know. I love the gnomes. Oh my gosh, those gnomes, those Christmas gnomes are turning out so cute. I've been seeing everybody finishing those. Hello, am I still live? Y'all still there? Ain't nobody said something, nothing. I think, I think everybody's on a search for Sandra's uh, minion love. Uh, prices, IDR. Woo! Really? Yeah. That's, something's wrong there. I don't think it's worth that. Uh, and if it is, they can keep it. They can definitely keep it. I am not, not paying that. Uh, Ralph, I say I'll do any kit, but that isn't one I'd rush out and get. <laughs> yeah, Ralph, I agree. i not not touching that one either. I don't have that kind of pocketbook. It's Indo oh so oh that's Indonesia money. So okay, they're selling it for seven really seven hundred and fifty bucks? Man, okay, I'm gonna sit on Harry Potter for a year and then turn around and sell Harry Potter for seven hundred and fifty bucks. Let's see if that works. I keep hearing about the Aura Ola. Uh, I think it's an Hawaiian company. Uh... Damn, Sandy. 
25000 for a corning ware casserole dish? Let me know if you get that. It's French from Canada. Ah, okay. Okay, that's stupid. Oh, my goodness. Okay, guys. I either need to have something to talk about because dead airspace is not good. Okay, let's add some more drills because we don't get enough. What did everybody go look for minions of love all of a sudden? Okay, chat died. Y'all are still here. It says y'all here. Check your messages. Okay, Sandy, I will when I, I can't write this minute because I'm streaming live. I I will when I get off. There we go. That's a lot prettier. Uh solved solve the Pantheon. Pan pan. Solve the panther green thing. Panther green thingy. Oh, I had the yawns. Okay, people. I'm falling asleep here. Uh, Sandra, I don't know what the Pathion path of green thing, uh, it's a math thingy. Oh, Lord, I definitely don't know what that is. Yeah, I, I do know Schrodinger's cat, but I know that from the Big Bang. Uh, Dollar says is nowhere close to the, to the map price. Uh, Ralph, yeah. I'm, I mean, even $750, I'm still not going to pay that for a diamond painting. That is just absolutely ridiculous. Not to mention scalping. That's like my PlayStation 5. Okay? I want a PlayStation 5. They come out, they were $350. Well, then they, they can't keep up with production, right? So, you got scalpers out there that are literally... Just raiding people left and right, seven hundred, eight hundred dollars, and I'm like, really, dude? I, I would rather do it out for two years than, and not to mention, there's no game for it. So I just, I'd rather do it out than, you know, pay that kind of money for a PlayStation Five. I got a perfectly good PlayStation Four. Okay. Um, so yeah, yeah, I'm not I'm not doing the yeah, people raid the wallet. Oh, she's got a ferret. <gasps> ferret! Oh, oh, um, um, okay, it, who's in the group Punks and Crafts? Uh, why would they sell anything without, uh, without games? Sandra, it, they have a few games. Uh, most of the PlayStation 4 will play on the PlayStation 5. 
Uh, but again, the uh, due to the fact that nobody can get the consoles, uh, the games have just been kind of sitting, spinning, fizzling. Has to do with the geometry among the three sides of the triangle. Uh, thank you, Sandy. That literally went in one ear and out the other. You know my math brain. It don't work. Mm. This looks like a craftability painting of a ferret. Okay, anybody ever sees diamond paintings of ferrets, direct my attention to it. Throw a brick at my head, catch my attention, scream to the high heavens, yo, look, Nix. Uh, right now, um, I am looking at uh, our second teaser. It's craftability. Craftability's got a ferret, but good gravy, who knows when their garbage is coming out. I like craftability. I, I I really do. Michael and his wife are very sweet, sweet people. But he's listing all of these pictures of diamond paintings. But he's not telling anybody if or when or what is going on. No details yet for drill size shape release date. So he's showing all these pictures, but then has no clue when he's going to be getting these in. So it's it's a little confusing. However, he does have one with a ferret on it. Welcome back, Kathy. How you doing, honey? How's, how's your night going? You taking a break? Thank you, Sandy. Um, yeah, it, I mean, I just seen here on Punks and Crafts. Uh, it's a it, it's a diamond painting group that um, she was showing um, fa it's faces of fairies one fifty four uh, at Sterling. And ferrets are just too cute. We're going to have to have a lot of new diamond painting kit teasers coming. We are going to have a lot of diamond painting teasers coming at you. No details yet. Drill shape sizes, release dates. But we'll let you know as soon as we're ready. So they're, they're throwing all these pictures out there of stuff that they possibly are going to have. But they're not telling us when, where, or no details whatsoever. So it's like, why are you even posting? I, I'm sorry, that sounded cynical. I apologize. Um, uh, I was not trying to sound cynical or, or disrespectful. I, I just don't understand it, uh, craftability is a diamond painting company. If they do not have the diamond paintings in stock and or know when they're going to get them, why are they advertising them now? I guess would be my question. Kathy, I'm very, very happy to hear your your zoo is not doing bad tonight. That that'd be a good thing. That'd be a good thing. Thank you, Sandy. Uh, I again, I will check Facebook when I hang up with um, to hang up here with the live. Izzy, no, get down. Y'all done started my, my a bad habit with my Izzy ferret. She now thinks that she can get up on the desk. Izzy, no. Amazon has ferrets, diamond paintings. Uh, I have seen the one at Amazon's God. I have not purchased it as of yet due to it. There's no really information about it. And, um... So I I I did 
Hi, Snow Bunny. Welcome back. What's going on, sweetheart? Why are you rolling your eyes? What happened? Couldn't sleep? Oh, Rub's eyes. I miss Red. Izzy, stop it. Oh, let's see it. No, that's... All right, everybody. Here is the mountain goat. Okay, you ready? There is the mountain goat. That is that that is the mountain goat right there. See the mountain goat? We think that we are a mountain goat. Yes, you do. Ow, ow. Where are you going? Ow. I have got to cut your claws. You're killing me. Meds took you out. Snow bunny, I get it, honey. I get it. Say hello. Hello. Yes, this is trouble. This is trouble right here. That that is trouble. You're supposed to look up. Oh, there we go. Oh. This is this is this is trouble. You have a death grip, don't you? Yes, you do. You know you're not supposed to be on mama's desk. You know you're not supposed to be on mama's desk. Oh mama. What? It's your bad mouse. You bad mouse. Oh. It's your bad mouse. Yes, you are. I got you. I got you. Okay, I love you. Even though you're the world's worst mouse, you are so spoiled rotten. You are so spoiled rotten. Yes, you are. This is Ellie. She has pink eyes. She has pink eyes and just the world's worst rotten problem child in the world. Yes, I am, Mama. Um... How easy. Okay, that is it. There we go. All right, bed with you. What is it with the bots tonight? Oh my goodness. We have just got a ton of users tonight. Uh, okay, sorry guys, I was reading up. Uh, uh, when you have a handful of ferret that that thinks that she can climb the world, uh, ferrets on Amazon. Meds took me a Greg's favorite one. You, Kathy, that was she. That is my. That is my bad. That is the bad seed. Uh, oh, and she is, that's daddy's favorite right there. Thank you, Sandra. Uh, I, again, I will, I will check them out, uh, uh, due to the fact that I'm doing, uh, live, I have to be very careful and, and not do anything that'll kick me off. You have an alien. Kathy, how do you... Uh, I know Ralph is a little strange, but uh, uh, are you sure he's an alien? You got a ton done. I honestly am blowing through this. If I if I would keep going instead of stopping every five seconds, I'd most probably don't been finished with this second with this section. Uh because it is. I mean, it's all color blocking, so um, it is very. Just blowing through it. But, yeah, I was looking for, um, that's what I was talking about with craftability. He just showed a picture of a diamond painting. Okay, now I'm getting my arm stuck in it. He just showed a diamond painting of uh, a ferret, but... He has no clue when they're going to have it, when they're going to get it, how much he's going to be, is it square, is it rounds, is it nothing. So my question is, why is craftability advertising stuff they don't have? Kind of defeats the purpose, doesn't make any sense. And they are notorious for selling pre-orders and taking forever to, and I'm talking months, I'm talking six months. Um, taking 
upwards to six months to ship orders. So it's kind of like they're they're getting people to oh god I know I shouldn't say this. They're they're it's kind of like they're getting people to pay for diamond paintings and then once they have enough people that pay for diamond paintings then they're they're buying the diamond paintings. Does that make sense? Which normally business works the other way around. You have a product in hand to sell before you take people's money. So, um, I don't know. But that, at the, again, that's, that's my opinion. And, you know, Michael and him are pretty cool. From my, I, I've never met the man. I've talked to him a couple times, but um, he seems to be fairly, fairly nice guy. And, uh, but I don't, I don't order pre-orders from them. I, I, I have the the Prague Love and Felicia was the the last thing, and I just checked my orders, and I've only got three craft abilities. But I like the ferret. They have a ferret coming out. Uh, we have an alien. Oh, your cat's an alien. Yeah, see, Snow Bunny, that's what I was talking about. And uh, I feel like he's playing with our money. You know what I'm saying? Um, he's selling stuff that he doesn't have. And then it takes 40 forevers to come in. Um, yeah, they, uh, Sandy, they don't, uh, they don't carry their, their inventory, which, you know, if, if he's going to do that, it, why doesn't he just have it drop shipped from the people that he's buying from? Uh, thank you, Nana. Uh, I, I mean, there are, I have bought stuff from United States companies that do that. Um, they, they will, they will, uh, they will appear to be a reputable USA company, but they will take your order and they will contact the people in China and pay the person in China like $5 and have it drop shipped to whoever purchased the item. Now, see, Michael and him at Craftability, they don't do that. I don't know why. So he, you know, he takes the money for the pre-orders and the, they haven't been ordered yet. Well, I don't know about everybody else, but I'm not doing that. Yeah, Snow Bunny, they, they have a brick and mortar store. Uh, I think they finally got it open. I think it's finally open. They've been working on it a while. I mean, congratulations to them. I Yay, more power to them. I am all for them. I I hope they do good. I I hope they, you know, uh, turn out to be a, a, a really good company. I mean, I understand growing pains, and I understand, um, you know, uh, uh, pull, robbing from Peter to pay Paul, but uh, again, to sell something that you do not have and don't know when you're going to have is not cool. Nana, what you... What did you wait on for eight? Uh, okay, you had a back order from DAC for eight months. What was it? Uh, 
Uh, Sandy, uh, they're the only companies that have a real store. I, I don't think DAC has a walk-in store. You can buy Diamond Art Club from Hobby Lobby, Michaels, and Joann's. And or either their website. Yeah, Nana, wow. You waited on a, a, a pre-order that you paid for for eight months? I hope my, my, I, my volcano um, dragon is in stock. It's hung up right this minute because I ordered the pumpkin herder at the same time and the pumpkin herder was on back order. Uh, so they're not sending me the volcano until the pumpkin herder gets in. <laughs> Snow bunny. Kitties do that. Yeah, they they love walking on iPads. I'm sorry, honey. Well, welcome back. It's good to have you back. I I don't know. I got um right this minute I got two uh oh, three um diamond paintings on back orders. I'm getting Christmas for Halloween. Uh, uh I mean Halloween for Christmas. They said my Halloween is supposed to be delivered like the week of Christmas. So I, I kind of expect it in the next week or two, hopefully. Uh, and then the one that I ordered on Black Friday, they said isn't going to be available till the end of January. I'm, I'm not doing pre-orders. That's, that's the reason why I didn't order the monkey. The monkey is a pre-order. It's like, I'll let this sucker come in stock and then order it. Okay, why does it say we got nine people in here? And I'm looking at one, two, three, four, five. And I'm looking at five people. That don't make no sense, but okay. I think we've been attacked by bots tonight. But anyway, back to what I was talking I was, uh, Craftability has a cute uh, ferret diamond painting coming out eventually. Ralph, everyone's dominating. Yeah. About the craftly, I was waiting for squares to come back in stock. The sunset crossing. Yeah, Snow Bunny, I remember that. What happened? Did it come back in? Oh, Sandra, I'm on the TV. Look at me, I'm a movie star. Look at me, I'm a movie star. Woohoo! I'll be a movie star. Thank you, thank you. Uh, well, that would be an, a, a really good, I, I don't know if Amazon has got a, a res, return for, you know, my cat walked on the iPad and I ended up ordering a thousand dollar couch. Oh, the Joseph, the scorpion. 
Yes. Okay. Nana, that has been on back order for a long while. I know that the one that I just got, the uh, it's the witch that's in the kitchen and she's starting, she's got the red hair and she's got curly red hair. Um, that one has been on pre-order for five months. It's been a long while. He prefers Wish. <gasps> Somebody's probably taking a cat nap. Uh, but I wish my parents would take a cat nap. I still got one roaming around. They're like, I, I play, I swear I play whack a mole, okay? Because one will be up, all the rest will be sleeping. She'll go lay down, and then somebody else will get up. It's, it's whack a mole at my house. I ordered one thing on Wish, never got it, and I have never ordered from them again. Gotta have me on the TV for the cat. Well, honestly, right this minute, the cat ain't watching much other than a blank screen of a, of a diamond painting. I'm sorry. I I should... Uh, I, I am the world's worst YouTuber. I imagine if my gaming guys looked at one of my videos, they would most probably be cringing in their chairs. I just... Honestly, uh... <laughs> My poor husband. I pointed at one of my gamer guys and I said, I want to be like them. Go make it happen. <laughs> really? I really did. I, verbatim, by the way. And I said, I want to do that. I don't know how to do that. I have no clue where to start to learn how to do that. But I want to do that. So, yeah. I, I, matter of fact, I just bought a game, uh, like, like I got time to play video games. Um, I just bought a, a computer game to test out my, my computer. Um, it's probably infected. It's, a kind of a survival game where, um, you're lost kind of like on an island and you got to you got to build like your tent and fire and food and stuff like that. I've died so many times. It's not even funny. However, the computers weren't running perfect. So it's, it's doing what it's supposed to do. I just suck at video games. Um, and so, yeah, but I don't know. I don't know. I don't know where this is going to go. I don't know. I, I will continue to diamond paint. I will continue to do what I'm doing. Uh, at least for the next year that I know of. I cannot predict anything further than a year, which would be silly if I tried to. Um, so I do want to get more um, YouTube involved, if that makes any sense. Um, am I looking to make money off of it? Oh, no. No, 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 no. Anybody that thinks you can make money off of YouTube needs to have their head examined. Because uh, you don't. Uh... Hi, Gaming Unicorn. I was just talking about gaming. What is the size of this one? This is called uh, Christmas King Charles. It is a 20 by 20 or a 51 centimeters by 51 centimeters. Crossing is pre-ordered. 
Peter will be out until January. Yeah, that's what they're telling me, Snow Bunny. I, I mean, I, I'm, I, hey, sometimes some of the things that they do just blows my mind, you know. So, uh, you, I cannot, um, uh, yeah, go, go figure with that. Kenzie said I should play Sims. Oh, my, Sims is almost as old as I am. Sims was, has been around forever. Great at games. Plus I can't. Ah, uh, Snow Bunny, I can't hit the broad side of a barn. Okay, with with, with a a cannon. Um, it and uh, this is a very 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 basic matter of fact. Um, it's not even a full game. It's um, I'm test testing it and. Uh, and when I find like bug glitches and stuff like that, uh, while playing the game, what I do is I report it to the, to the, um, the creators of the game. And, uh, so it's more like a demo than anything else, but it's a pretty cool game. It's called The Infected. Um, and you just, you know, you start out, uh, and you got to build a house and you got to have fire and food and, uh, you have zombies and, um, all this kind of stuff. So you have the ability right this minute, due to the fact it's not a full-fledged game, to set, you know, how many times you get attacked or something like that. But it's one of those uh, mindless, you know, repetitive kind of things, uh, type of game. You just kind of don't think and just do. Uh Oh, you you're uh honestly, sweetie, this is not that big. It 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 sounds bigger than it is. This is really not that big at all. Not to mention it's a whole lot of color blocking. So I mean, I've been and I knocked out this whole section right here, like in poof, you know. So um here, let me show you. This really is not that big. So, I mean, it's just, I thought it was a partial in the beginning, but uh, that's the that's the whole screen right there. There's the top, and I'm honestly, you're missing about an inch if you, you look right here at the bottom of the screen. Uh, there's about an inch that's not showing on the bottom. So, yeah, and it is... Um, 20 by 20 or, you know, 51 by 51. So it's, and again, you will blow through this because it's all color blocking. There's, there's not, I mean, all of this is white. All of this is red. Um, and it's, it's really, really pretty. And it's got four ABs in it. So it, it's going to be um, really nice when it's, when it's done. Doing a drawing only minus 45 50. Uh, wow, gaming unit, what are you drawing? Hey, I think my presentation has been pretty good tonight. I've had it up here, and y'all can see. And um, but yeah, uh, uh, gaming unicorn. This yeah, you would blow through this, especially if you. I'm using a multiplayer as well. I think this is like a seven or an eight. Um, and I am, I am literally just blowing through this. This is not hard at all. 
No, honestly, it's it's really not. This is very, very beginner friendly. Very, um, uh, I, I don't think they make kits easier than this. Um, oh, you made one of the Beauty and the Beast. Oh my gosh, I bet you it's gorgeous. But, yeah, as far as King Charles goes, this is very, um, it is, it is so, so, so easy. It is just, you know, putting down drills. Sorry, I forget to talk when I'm drilling. Um, also, too, I'm running out of stuff to talk about. You guys have not been any help tonight. Usually, we got questions or something. Uh, again, don't forget uh, Christmas party next Saturday Night Live. Okay. Um, no, you cannot give Kenzie away, Sandra. Uh, we will have, uh, I will try to have hourly door prizes. Um, I know, Ralph, you cannot have the keys to the house. Sorry, not giving a house away next Saturday. But um, I am, at this time, let me put it this way. At this time, I am unsure if we will have live whipping chat Christmas night okay because the following saturday falls on christmas day um normally by by christmas night everybody's pretty much done and over with you know with all of the christmas festivities and everybody's done gone home and you know in their fat pants as they say from overeating christmas dinner um and, you know, if you had turkey, you turkey-fied and you're snoring uh, by the time, you know, I do live. So, um, you know, if you can't make it, if you think you guys are not going to be here, give me a heads up. Because uh, that way I'll just go, okay, there's not enough of us going to be here. Uh, I, I did change my... Um, my uh, signature on my emails and on um, Etsy, so people know that I'm doing live um, live chats on Saturday night. So hopefully, uh, that will get us some get us some more traffic. Um, but yeah. So anyway, how's that? There we go. Wow, well, got it. That's a good chunk going right there. Don't get any prettier than that. Uh, okay. Uh, lost my place. Give me just a second. Um, the 15 placer. I, uh, do I have a 15 placer? I think I do. What are you? Uh, no, that's a nine placer. Which I could use that, but I still like my purple pen. Um, and would that get it done faster? Most probably. I could try. Let's see. Yeah, it does fairly good. Hmm. 
little bit of slippage, but not much. But I didn't have it kind of in there right either, so. There we go. That one did good. Yeah, that does pretty good. I don't, I don't have a 15 placer. I thought I did. I gotta give me one of them kids. Um, but yeah. And, and see, that's what I was saying. If you've got, you know, if you've got your good, you know, large placer, you can just blow through it. How many paintings have I finished? Uh, I have been diamond painting since April of this year. So I'm kind of new. I have finished uh, Valentine Masquerade, Make a Wish, Take a Bite, Little Dragon Z. Um, what am I forgetting? What am I forgetting, guys? Um, I want to say four. Valentine Masquerade. Little Dragon Z. Make a wish, take a bite. Yeah. Uh, I'm going to say three and a half because um, I have uh, Mask of Love by uh, Josephine Wall that is almost finished. It, I've literally got a fourth left on it and it'll be done. So since April, uh, not to mention running a full-time business, uh, I have finished four or three large, and I'm talking uh, like large, uh, diamond paintings. And uh, I, uh, uh, Mask of Love is, um, I had to set it down because I was going to do Christmas morning for my son and his family. And I started it uh, as a gift, and I'm not going to have it finished on time. So I am going to pack it away and and finish it. Uh, I'm going to start on it again next year, but I'm going to start a little earlier uh, and and get it knocked out and finished, and that'll be a, a gift for them next year. All right, dude. Come on, you're being cantankerous here. Okay, one thing about it, if you use a handmade pen and then you go to one of these skinny ones, they whew, get those off your hand. No one to cooperate. But yeah, that's that's doing really good. How many um gamer girl, how many of you got done? Kathy, I'm working. Yeah. Kathy, do you take your diamond paintings to work with you? Do you work on them there as well? I guess you could say in between which I'm sorry, that might have been a dumb question. Uh, not close to Christmas, baby, pull it out. Uh, Snow Bunny, I agree. I, I think that's what I'm going to do. Uh, I might not put it away, to be totally honest. If I put it away, it'll never get finished. If I leave it out and work on it, bits and bobs here and there, um, I agree. You got a point. Also, too, I'm just, I'm not a Christmas person. It's, oh, it's pretty. And I don't know. I tried, I, I was, when I opened the box, well, before I opened the box, when I was buying the painting, um, I don't know, just a little bird in my head 
You sure you're going to be able to finish this? You sure you want to do this? That kind of thing. Um... Well, start him on Christmas one. And Snow Bunny April is a good good time to start. Finish ten. Wow, gamer, that's good. Ah, uh, Kathy at home only. I I could see where you know dragging it all around might you know either get the canvas damaged or you end up losing drills or yeah, I could. Oh, all right, dude, you went flying. Uh, I could see where that might become a problem. But I know you'd rather be home dumb and painting than working. Okay, anybody that uses a non-placer or bigger, there is definitely a technique to it. Uh, okay, um, only have three Christmas paintings and... Don't do Christmas also, but the Dragon Nutcracker. That was a... I agree, Snow Bunny. I agree. Even though I don't do Christmas, I did buy the, 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 no, I do not have the dragons in the Christmas tree. I don't have that one. I think the reason why I didn't get that one is because one is Christmas, two, it was just too doggone expensive. Um, it didn't jump out at me enough. Now, I do have the gnomes. Um, and I do have the snowman. I bought the snowman because, the snowman is the middle of the road, or what I call a middle of the road. He's not very Christmassy. Uh, he's one of those that you could leave out, you know, all winter, uh, and and he'd be okay and and get through winter. Um, he's not necessarily. Uh, Christmas, I guess you could say. Yeah, I am so breaking down and buying it. Set. I'm still aggravated where my where my my goodie box is. Okay, dude, you going back over there? That did work pretty good. I mean, I knocked out that whole space right there with just a couple of. But, yeah, um, I don't know. I mean, I, um, I'm just not, I, I, I got a couple. I said I wasn't buying any Harry Potters either. And what I do, I bought Harry Potters. The kit sucked me in. It was all the kit. It was all the kit, so yeah. Okay, guys. Hello. Are y'all there? It is 5.41 a.m. here. Hello, anybody home? Hello, did y'all disappear on me? Everybody fall asleep on me? Yeah, Ralph, you dropped the ball on the questions, dude. I have done come to the conclusion we need questions.
There's Snow Bunny. Everybody's concentrating on Dom and Benny. Hey, you can get over that sticking together now. Uh, up, oh, one, two, three. Roll call. I'm here, a patient just calls. All right, Kathy. Kathy's at work. She's a nurse. She has a very important job. We want her to do her job. Up, oh, Game Room Unicorns here. Up, oh, there's Sandy. Okay, I was feeling abandoned here and alone. Uh, poor Kinsey and I did. Yeah, I did start for you, did. But not by much. Only, only this means. Nana, my heart is pounding. I dream my mama came in screaming. Oh, Nana, I'm sorry. Kathy is the one. Her and Ralph, man, they knocked these bad boys out. You hear me? Oh, Sandy, don't drop the iPod. Yeah, Ralph and Ralph and Kathy. Yeah, they run circles around around me. Um. Oh. Oh. Who's Snow Bunny? Uh, Snow Bunny is, um, oh, Snow Bunny. I forgot your name, sweetheart. I am so sorry. And we also have uh, Gamer Unicorn is new. So say hello. <laughs> Snow Bunny was here last weekend. Uh, yeah, 23, but a lot were small. Um, I think this is the reason why I've only done three, because if you think about it, the three that I'd done, make a wish and take a bite was four foot long. Thank you, Snow Bunny Jackie. Uh, again, guys, I apologize. I'm bad with names. Um, so, yeah. But, um, no, I, the ones, I mean, Valentine, um, uh, Masquerade of Love, Masquerade was another four foot one, so I'd say it was three foot by four foot, um, yeah, three foot by four foot, uh, and then, uh, Little Dragon Z was, uh, what was Little Dragon Z? Little Dragon Z was like a 60 by 60, they're about 60 by 70, something like that. Now, Sandra, I tell you what, Christmas morning, that bad boy is huge. Now, I also have the uh, old woman in a shoe. Remember that one from Domino Club? Not the... Oh, that one is... I don't know what I'm going to do for desk space, okay? Because that one just took up the entire desk. Width as well as length. And it's like, man. The old shoe house. That's it. That's... that. I love that old shoe house. I really do. I I have it. I haven't started it yet. Uh, uh, yeah, that one's intimidating. Yeah, we have a lot. I mean, I in when I started it, I, the only reason why I've gone kind of big dog with with Diamond Art Club right this minute is due to Halloween. Uh, usually I would get one diamond painting a week and, and that was it. Um, uh, 
Uh, Snow Bunny, I agree on the reorganization of the craft room. I'm working on this one here. Chuck Pinson. I have not. Wait. Isn't uh, the shoe Chuck Pinson? What shape of diamonds do I prefer? Gamer Unicorn. I prefer squares. I have not done a round. <gasps> Hazel. Duh. I did do four. I knew I did four. I forgot about Hazel. Hazel's hanging on the wall. Um, so I've done four huge diamond paintings since April. Um, I, but yeah. I prefer squares. The last diamond painting that I did in rounds was hazel. Um, not happy with it. Not, I, I mean, I liked it. It was fun. It's a good graphic. I was not happy with the end results. It, I don't know. Uh, squares give a picture, um, a, a better quality appearance when it's finished. And me being a graphics designer and working with pixels all the time, yeah, it, I, I don't do, I don't like blurry images. It just, my OCD just flies out the window. Dominic Davison is the shoe. Okay, then no, I do not have a Chuck Pinson that I know of. Dominic Davidson, yeah. I I am not a landscape person. Okay, I'm really not. Um I I have two. I have the one that I bought from Dreamers Design for a friend that I might end up destashing. Uh I, I'm not I'm still on the fence about that one. Uh and, and then um what is it? Um Oh, brain fart. Light bulb turned off. Give me a minute. Um, yeah, the old woman in the shoe, or that's what I call it, the old shoe house. Uh, those are the only two landscapes that I have. I'm, I'm just not, I, I get bored. And once I'm bored, that's it. I, I won't finish it. I, I would rather be beat than, than finish something that I've done got bored with. You have my round paintings for, I don't know if they will look awesome. Snow Bunny, I agree. If you stand across the room, they look really good. And Sandra, I agree. Squares all the way. I was looking at my Diamond Art Clubs, and I've got about seven in there that are rounds. There is good graphics, but they're rounds, and it's like, oh, no, that's going to be one of those. I'm going to have to fight to get through. I just, uh, I, I don't, uh, they're easier. They lay down faster. But, again, you know, blowing through it is one thing, but what's it going to look like when it's done? I was disappointed with Hazel. I really, really was. I, I wanted her to look better than she did. I have Warm Witch. And uh, I wish they would have... The only thing about Warm Witch is it looks really good. Uh, completed. I just wish that they would have added a smidge more color to it. Other than the, the two monotone beige brown kind of thing. Snow Bunny, I agree. It, 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 it's got to scream at me before I'll buy a round. And I'm, I've got, like I said, five or six, seven in there that are round. And I'm like, oh, my, what were you thinking? Now, uh, Dreamers Design, I think it was Strawberry. Or it was um, the last one that I got. They were all, uh, most of those were, were round. 
So, I mean, it's, you know, it's, I don't know. I, I go bought a graphic and then here lately it's like, okay, that's really pretty. I would really like to have it, but it's round and why? Because I was tonight, it was like, okay, not doing Christmas. That's not, that is not on the agenda anymore. Um, so I was looking through digging and I love Sweet Tooth. I, I, oh my gosh, the colors are just amazing. And if I'm not mistaken, she's round. And it's like, why? But why? But I bought her any anyway, because that one is, yeah, that's my girl right there. Moon Lily. Thank you, Snow Bunny. That's it. Yes, yeah, you square. Uh, I have all of the Reykjavik. I have got to learn how to pronounce that man's name. Um, I've heard people say it right. My, my mouth does not want to do it. Neither does my brain. Uh, anyway, I have all of his girls that, uh, Dreamers Design has come out with, and since April. Now, I don't know what they had before that, but, um, that's crooked. There we go. Nylon on it and I replace it with baking with bacon paper and it was much easier for me to oh okay gamer unicorn I discovered a tip that, that helps me a lot had nylon on it and I replaced it with bacon paper and it was much easier for me to cut cut parts. Ah, okay. I tell a gamer, I, I, I totally understand what you're saying there. Hey, if one thing doesn't work, you know, tweak it out till you till you find what does work. Oh. oh my gosh, I'm so sorry. I don't mean to keep yawning in y'all's ear. I did not get enough sleep last night. Worry is like a rocking chair. It will give you something to do, but it won't get, uh, get you anywhere. True. I'm the world's worst worrier. Uh, doo -doo -doo -doo. astronaut over earth is around astronaut over earth thinking I'm going to start a square because uh, uh snow bunny I agree I, I, I mean the I don't know uh, honestly it's like the difference between a crochet hook okay you got Susan Boyd crochet or Susan Bait crochet hooks and then you got Boyd crochet hooks it's the proverbial debate you know what's better round squares this hook that hook um good night Sandra I was fixing to say honey it should have been knocking at the door at three o'clock at your house because it's 6 a.m here uh so anyway my dog Thank you, Sandra, for being here. Don't forget, Christmas party next week. So, bye, my honey. You sleep well. Uh, yeah. 
it's uh Kathy, she's on the West Coast. Most of you guys that are here are on the West Coast. I'm the only one that's on the East Coast. Alternate between the two. Yeah. Yeah, I'm giving I'm giving goodies away, so everybody's gonna be here next week. Go tell your friends, tell everybody to come show up. Um for you it's 12. Oh my gosh, gamer, where are you at? It is 6 a.m. where I am at right this minute. Kenzie's going too. Good night, Kenzie. Good night, sweetheart. Thank you for being here. Bye. Your East Coast. Oh, uh, I thought, well, I'm, I'm East Coast. Good night, Sandra. Good night, Kenzie. Same time, same channel. See you next week. Oh, Gamer Unicorn, you're in Israel. Okay, okay. That makes sense then. Because I was fixing to say, it's 6 a.m. where I'm at. And I'm on the East Coast. I'm New York time. And Kathy and Ralph, you guys are California time, aren't you? Y'all are up there somewhere or another. Well, Ralph should be happy tonight. Look at how much I got done. I got way more done than on the other one. And I talked. So, talking and laying drills at the same time. You're from Israel. Yeah. So, um, the only thing is, guys, we have got to find something for me to talk about. No joke. I'm running out of stuff to talk about. And not going to talk personal stuff every week, which my life is not that exciting. Not to mention, is I felt like I was re repeating, um, kind of what I had said already, you know. So I was trying real hard tonight not to do that, uh, not to repeat stuff. Oh, Kathy. Y'all went to Jeff Dunham's uh, on date night. How was that? Did you have fun? Did you get to meet him? I think everybody asked a question. Well, did you get to meet him? You know? When you go see somebody uh, famous. Fluffy's coming here. I forgot when, but it, but Fluffy is coming. I like him. He's funny. Wait, do you hate... What? Gamer Girl, why would you think I would hate Israel? Everyone hates us, and I don't know why. No, I do not hate Israel. I don't. I don't know enough about it to hate it. You can't hate something you don't know enough about. Uh, I woke up the woke up on the PS5 being seven hundred, eight hundred. There was.
Oh, yeah. Um, Snow Bunny. Uh, don't even worry about the PS5 right this minute. Uh, the $700, $800, $1,600 dollar prices, that's scalper prices. And uh, Gamer Unicorn? Uh-uh. I, 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 don't, I don't hate on nobody. I don't play that. So I, if, if I somehow gave you the impression, please accept my sincere apologies because I, yeah, no. There'd be no hate here. It was awesome. Oh, man, I'm sorry you didn't get to meet him. I would have liked to have met Peanut. Oh, Poo on Jeff Dunham. Who wants to meet him? I wanted to meet Peanut. But, yeah. Um, I don't know if Jeff Dunham's ever been here. I mean, we we have a comedy club uh, kind of place. Um, and we do have arenas and what have you. But, um... Um... I don't, I don't know. Because I'm Israel. Uh, unicorn, I, 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 again, if you got that impression from me, my sincere apology. Okay. Yeah. No, we don't do that here. And if some, yeah, uh, -uh. I, I don't do the hate thing and I'm not going to, uh, and, and, you know, Hey, I, just because, you know, no, uh, I'm not even going to discuss this. No, we don't do the hate thing here. That's all you got to worry about. However, uh, y'all got about 30 minutes left and I'm going to have to check out due to the fact that it is 6 a.m. in the morning and my husband will be walking through the door at 6.30 a.m. So we will have to wrap this up by then. Kathy, I think Ralph went to bed. I think Ralph fell asleep in his chair because I have not seen him all night, and normally he's picking on me and joking with me and everything, so he must have had a long night at work. Uh, Fluffy. I love Fluffy! Uh, Gamer Unicorn, uh, thank you very, very much. And no, you are, you are uh, welcome here. Uh, as long as you want to come and come and hang out with us, I do not mind at all. Um, so yeah, now, uh, like I said, again, I am here at 11 p.m. Uh, on Saturday nights. I agree. Ditto to what Nana said. You know, um, I am, I don't know, well, I don't know what 11 p.m. would be your time, but I'm here every Saturday night, or try to be, every Saturday night at 11 p.m. Eastern Time, United States Eastern Time, uh, and I hang out until, well, like I said, until the, I'm the last person standing and or either my husband comes home from work, which he works midnight shift. So he is due to be home at 630. Uh, so, yeah, that when I that will be when I have to say, OK, guys, we are uh, we are done for the night. So we got about 20 minutes left. And gamer girl, like I said, you are you are welcome here anytime. And guys, I apologize for the bots tonight. 
I was really hoping that I would not have to do bot control. Um, I guess you, they they show up everywhere. But, uh... Oh, well. It only takes a couple of seconds to kick their, kick their butts out, so it's no major biggie. Okay, we've had a lot of dead airspace in this one. I think if I could... <laughs> If I could edit, I think that that's what I'd be doing. Uh, I'm going to go and enjoy your dinner. Good night, Kathy. Good night, sweetheart. Thank you for being here. Uh, big squeezy hugs and give Ralph a slap for me when you get home. Uh, I I think Ralph was tired and, and fell asleep in his chair because he's been really, really, really quiet tonight. So he might have had a long day. So, any night, anyway, night night, Kathy. Thank you for being here, and I will see you next Saturday. Um, again, same time, same place, and you're off. Yay! Yay! So, uh, yeah. You love my energy. Uh, it, gaming unicorn, right this minute, I am, I am fizzling fast. Um, yes, have, have a fabulous, fabulous week, and we will see you next Saturday, Kathy. Um, enjoy dinner. I am, I ate dinner, but honestly, I am starving right this minute, and we don't, we have no munchies in this house. I really could want you something. But. Ta da ta da! Look at that. Wow, I got a big old chunk done. I got a lot done tonight. Ralph will be proud. I got a look at that. Look at that. I got a, almost a whole square done. He cannot say that I did not have progress tonight. And talked at the same time. Oh, Yeah, Sandy, I, I mean, every Saturday night uh, when I send the hubby to work, uh, I'm I'm here. Snow Bunny, I agree, no munchies. I got no munchies in this house. Uh, my husband is worse than a kid uh, coming home from school. I mean, he just eats it like crazy fast. My Dr. Pepper. Uh, no, Sandy, I didn't. It's still in the sink in there. Uh, I've been doing my unsweetened tea all night. So, uh, yeah. I, I I think it's it's a dead ghost. I think it's 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 gone bye-bye. But I learned a lesson. Don't put styrofoam in the freezer. Which, honestly, if I would have been smart enough and thought about it, it, it's like styrofoam shrinks and expands. So, with heat, styrofoam shrinks. With cold, it expands because the liquid that's inside the cup expands out. So, that's exactly what happened. And it was leaking out on the side of the cup. Little bitty droplets. Looked like it had chicken pox. Well, okay. These bottles are, these medicine bottles are okay. 
Are they my favorite? Uh, they're really staticky, even with the Febreze in there. Um, but they're they're fairly good. They're fairly good. There we go. Um, oh. Hello, my darling. You are on live chat right this minute. So we have had a long night, so I just wanted to let you know that. And hi, everybody. Emily says hello. Say hi. Hi. <laughs> uh, give me about 10 minutes, and I'll call you right back. Okay, bye. Okay, bye. That was my friend, Emily. Uh, anyway... I see Sandy, North Carolina on Saturday. Sandy, you be safe. You be safe. Have fun. My friend on ours is a little mini lava cake. She, girl, you are talk snow bunny. You talking about me to me about lava cakes? And I'm sitting there starving to death. She hid them from her husband and got up at midnight every night to eat one. Oh my gosh, what a funny story. Oh my gosh, mini lava cakes. Oh, that's so good. Ah. Uh, I would have turned a couple of so uh, hey, Sandy, that was a good idea. I did not even think about that. Oh my gosh. Yeah, uh, that's uh, custom painting. Uh, the custom painting by TJ uh, Emily Hatch. Yeah, she's my coffee buddy. She calls me every morning about this time, and we we drink coffee and t talk about what we got planned for the day. Hubby and I on vacay. I Sandy, my hubby was on vacay last week. I was so happy he went back to work. Uh oh, fairy babies up again. Yes, no bunny. Who was that? Uh, that was Seymour. He it's his time for nibbles. Daddy comes home at 6 30. Daddy makes their breakfast, and so they get real lively about this time of day. And what they'll do is they'll go sit at the door and wait for daddy to get home from work. Yeah, these these ferrets, they think they're starving to death. Okay, but they're all little butterballs. We have a, um, it's a mixture called um, Uncle Tom's Duck Soup uh, or Uncle Buck's Top Duck Soup, and you get it at Petco. Uh, it was, he made, the original owner made this for his ferret because his ferret had cancer and was dying and stopped eating. And what he did was he took a bunch of vitamins and some ground up meat and what have you. And he put it uh, all in the blender. And this was the only thing that his ferret would eat. Well, it is literally full of every vitamin and mineral and nutrient that you can think of. And so every morning they get uh, a bowl of this duck soup. Uh, when he comes home from work and the reason why is because um, it has all the vitamins in it and everything so it saves it saves me from having to stuff vitamins down you know a ferret syrup so and they like it um, so I, I do high high vitamins with them uh, and and try to curb as, as many issues, problems, ailments uh, before they, they pop up. <laughs> Sandy, you smell chicken in here, the only one there. 
Uh, yeah, I, 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 I'm literally about that far from debating telling my husband to stop at Waffle House on the way home. Cook chicken tonight. Snow bunny. Yeah, your subconscious is saying, cook chicken tonight. I want chicken. But, okay, guys. Mm, wow. Snow bunny, I am serious. I am, I am debating hard about messaging him, telling him to, to, to stop at the Waffle House on the way home. So, uh, yeah, because I'm hungry. And then I want to go back to bed. I didn't get enough sleep last night. Anyway, guys, I am going to say good night um, for now. Uh, it is 6.18 in the a.m. We have been live for 7 hours and 18 minutes. So I hope you guys had fun. And, um, you know, Snow Bunny questions okay it's your turn next week bring the questions um so anyway and like i said next week we're going to be doing uh door prizes and giveaways and and stuff like that so uh gamer unicorn it was lovely to meet you please come back anytime you are always always welcome here okay uh sandy it is good to talk to you again my honey uh, good to see you guys doing again. You be safe on your uh, vacay. Um, check the weather, possible some tornadoes. Uh, Sandy, we're clear as a bell here. I don't know what's going on, but I got bubkis uh, on this end, so I don't know where it's at, but it's not here. So, anyway, guys. Thank you for being here tonight. I am going to sign off. Uh, it is now 6.20 uh, a.m. And the hubby is fixing to walk through the door uh, any minute. So um, I do have to wrap this up. But, hey, again, we had another seven-hour night. So, I mean, we, you know, you can't, can't throw rocks at that. We had, a, we had a good night. Hopefully the picture's good and hopefully the sound quality was good the whole time. And y'all enjoyed uh, Christmas King Charles. Look at there. I got to look, look at how much I got done. I got this big old swath done. Anyway, guys, I love you. And, you know, same time, same place, same channel next week. And we are going to have a Christmas party. So happy holidays to everybody. Uh, you know, regardless of where you're at, what you celebrate, happy holidays, and I hope it is a good one for everyone. So, Snow Bunny, Gamer Unicorn, Sandy, uh, Ralph, uh, Kathy, all of you guys, thank you, thank you, thank you for everybody being here, so... Uh, lots of love, big hugs, and I am going to say good night for now. So I will see you next week, and I will catch you on the flip side. Bye.